Mongol Empire is invading our home. They are brutal. Relentless. Unstoppable. We are 80 samurai against an army fighting to slow the invasion. Today, I die for my people. There must be thousands of them. We will face death and defend our home. Tradition. Courage. Honor. They are what make us. We are the warriors of Tsushima. We are samurai! Nodadachi. Go break their spirits. Outsiders, send your finest warrior to face me. Nada, Jinnida. I am Haru Nobu Adachi, descendant of the legendary Yoshi Nobu Adachi.
I am Kotan, cousin of Kublai, grandson of Genghis. The men have called unwinnable, yes? But while you were sharpening your sword, do you know how I prepared for today? I learned. I know your language, your traditions, your beliefs, which villages to tame and which to burn. So I'll ask you once again, Samurai. Do you surrender? Wounds. Can you run? I... I think so. Where's my sword? Not here. You're all here! I'll take care of this. Please, hide. Oh, oh don't hurt me! Shield for me! Christ! You want your sword? Follow me. Yuna, wait. Lord Shimura is my uncle. You're Jin Sakai? The Jito's nephew? I have to know. Did he survive? I think so. The Mongols took him prisoner. Where did they take him? East, along the coast. Toward Castle Canada. They must be holding him inside, celebrating their victory. I could take them by surprise. You'll be killed. Or I'll rescue Lord Shimura. Then help him drive the Mongols into the sea. He can contact the Shogun, call for reinforcements. I didn't nurse you back to health to watch you throw your life away. Why did you save me? I couldn't leave you to die. I need your help. Lord Shimura can help our whole island. And he 
is the only family I have left. Let's move. I am Jin Sakai. Nephew to the great Lord Shimura. And I am no coward! <laughs> Your enemy is no match for you. But... You still lack control. I was practicing. With your father's weapon? The sword of Clan Sakai... ...has saved lives... ...and ended wars. Who did this to you? No one. I will teach you to defend yourself. I know how to fight. To master your blade, you must first control your emotions. I can do that, Uncle. Show me. Well done. If you'd fought like that, your attacker would not have bruised you so easily. It wasn't a fair fight. Imagine he's returned to finish what he started. And he'll use every dirty trick he knows. How will you defend yourself? He's big, but I'm quicker. I'll stay out of his reach. Wait for him to get tired. Then drop him with one strike. Good. A samurai must always fight with patience and discipline, even when his opponent resorts to trickery. I'll remember, Uncle. Good form, Jin. You're improving. Need to catch your breath? <laughs> It'll take more than a child to knock the wind out of me. Now then, let's see you defend against a spear. Dodge. You see, there is no weapon, no warrior, you cannot overcome. Thank you for these lessons, Uncle. We are not finished yet. Jin Sakai, will you honor me with a sparring match? I wouldn't want to hurt you. If you're that confident, let's make this interesting. The first to land five strikes gets to choose dinner. I hope you like octopus. <laughs> Before we eat, I have one last question. For generations, our families have lived by a code. Tell me the virtues that guide us. Loyalty to our Lord, control over our emotions, and... You know this. Honor, to fight bravely and uphold the legacy of Clan Sakai. Those are your father's words. What does honor mean to you? I guess... ...protecting people. The ones who can't fight for themselves. You have a good heart. But first... ...we must show everyone that we serve our Lord with courage... ...integrity... ...and self-control. You say that like it's easy. It's never easy, Jin. I struggle with it every day. But we must set an example for our people by remaining true to our code and to ourselves. That is the meaning of honor. Ah, not her samurai!
found your sword. Where can I find a horse? The stables aren't far. This way. We can get close, slit their throats, and kill them without a sound. Without honor. I will not break my code. Face me, invader! Hot dog in It's close. We can't save everyone. I'm done running, and I can finally help. Damn it! More guards. Don't let anyone escape. Thank you, my lord. They said all the samurai were dead. Do you have somewhere to hide? I heard Golden Temple might be safe. Go. Stay off the roads. And guard your son with your life. You risked your life for them. They couldn't defend themselves. And I... I can't let more of our people die. They're not the only ones who need you. My brother. The Mongols took him. That's why you saved me. Taka is my only family. And Lord Shimura is mine. Please. I just want my brother back. I'll help you find him after I save my uncle. I promise. I'm coming with you. Easy there. He suits you. And he needs a name. Sora, light from the heavens. your uncle inside. We can't keep going! I have to. Fall back. Alone? Keep the path clear. When I find Lord Shimura, we'll need a quick escape. I'll get the horses ready. Do it. If I'm not back soon, ride for the forest. Sakai, nephew of Lord Shimura. <clears throat> I have come to avenge his honor. <laughs> Jin, your uncle has told me much about you, Jin Sakai. I will show him his nephew. Broken and humiliated, begging to join the Mongol Empire. <laughs> this is your time, Lord Sakai. Peace to your home. Save yourself. I failed. 
Again. Father. Jin. Help me. May your death benefit. Save him. I was a coward. Jin, you are a samurai. He died because of me. Your father fell in battle saving his only son. His reward is a warrior's death. Now you will carry on his legacy. Your father's spirit resides within this blade. He is always with you. How do I save? Jin! What happened? I found Lord Shimra. I could have saved him, but the Khan was there. I failed my uncle. At least you're in one piece. I swore to protect this island with my life. But now the Mongols have stolen our home, killed our samurai. You forgot what it's like to fight someone stronger than you. To feel weak. Sometimes when you're staring death in the face, you have to do whatever it takes to survive. The Khan expects to fight a war against the Samurai. He will anticipate our every move, unless we find new ways to surprise him. That's how we'll save Lord Shimura, and retake our home. You'll need some help. Riders. Khan's attack dogs. There's too many of them. Hide in the grass. Yamalnigim haro. 
They must be searching for you. Bastards scared off the horses. They're samurai mounts, trained to return to their masters. Nice trick. The Mongols must be hunting you. We should split up. I'll draw their attention while you escape. I'm not leaving your side until we've saved my brother. First, I need to find more allies. Trained warriors. Like Sensei Ishikawa and Lady Masako Adachi. They can help. My brother can help too. Once we save him, you'll have the island's best blacksmith in your debt. He'll make whatever tool you need to save your uncle. Something to scale the castle walls? You dream it, Taka can make it. Where are they holding him? He was captured near Kechi. Ride there and ask around. I'll join you soon. Taka won't last long in the Mongol cage. You know, we will save your brother. And your uncle. I should have heard him coming. Let myself get distracted. These people saw Mongols marching prisoners upriver. They had a blacksmith with them. Your brother? Sounds like it. They were taking him to a camp near the Canada Inlet. I know the place. Did you find any samurai to free your uncle? Not yet, but I'm still searching. I'm sure you'll find someone soon. <laughs> Let's go, Sora! Taka can help you, after we save him. Hard to believe I might see him soon. He's lucky to have you. You might disagree. That's what siblings are for. What about you? Any brothers or sisters? Lord Shimura is my only family. What will you do when he's free? Take a breath. Because then I'll know there's hope for our island. You feel that strongly? I've watched him win victory against impossible odds. And after your brother is free, what then? Honestly, I haven't had time to think about it. You're riding well. How are your wounds? Mostly healed. Your bandages did the trick. You don't share much about how you feel, do you? I suppose you're right. My uncle taught me that a samurai masters his emotions, like you master a horse, or a blade. That's a hard way to live. It's not supposed to be easy. We can look for a gap in the front wall. Slip inside. And cut down the Mongols where they stand. If something goes wrong, they'll kill the prisoners. I've seen them do it. We have to go in quietly. Like thieves. What's wrong with that? Before the samurai, this island was ruled by criminals. We changed that by creating order and delivering justice in the open. We live by a code of honor. And sometimes we die by it. Warriors like my father 
We just wanted to give us a safer home. I want the same thing. But we have to fight back. I promised my uncle I'd never break our code. Then bend it. To save my family. And what's left of yours. Let's get a closer look. See what we're up against. We should wait until it gets darker. If they see us, they'll kill the prisoners. Then we better stay quiet. Think, Jin. The bear's running with a limp. Your arrow wounded him. This is when a beast is most dangerous. Remain alert. Yes, Uncle. Keep after him. This arrow should not have killed him. Look, Uncle. There's a gash in his side. Not from an arrow. <gasps> From Yarikawa! Traitor! You would stab the Chido in the back! Ozakai! Control yourself. We are not criminals like this man here. We are samurai. He tried to kill you! He must answer for this crime with his life. And look him in the eye. Teach him that samurai never acts out of anger or fear and take his life with honor. When we fight, we face our enemy head on. And when we take their life, we look them in the eye with courage and respect. This is what makes us samurai. Only cowards strike from the shadows. Jin, what's wrong? Let's find your brother. We can't let them see us. Use all your senses. Think and move like a thief. There, a prisoner. Taka? Let's find out. No, it's not Taka. How'd you get in here? We need to go. We'll talk when it's safe. Come on. Let's get to the river. We'll be safe there. Are you with the straw hat, Ronin? I was. Cut ties with them after they started running low on rations. Lord Shimura's been captured, and I could use some extra swords to free him. Are you looking for work? No. But the other straw hats may be. 
Last I heard, they were hunting Mongols in Tsutsu Prefecture, by the coast near the Kishi grasslands. This way. We're looking for my brother, a blacksmith named Taka. Don't know him, but a lot of prisoners move through here. You said they were moving the slaves. Where? They mentioned Asimo Bay. And there was a blacksmith in the last group. Young man with a beard. From Yarikawa, maybe. You'd better be right. I hope you find your blacksmith. Taka's alive in Asmo Bay. The town is surrounded by walls. Rushing in without a plan will only put him in more danger. I have a friend who might be able to get us inside. Find him. The sooner we rescue Taka, the sooner we save my uncle. Jin. Taka will forge whatever tool you need as soon as he's free. But after that, we're leaving the island. You've seen what the Mongols are doing here. Lord Shimura can stop them. Stay. Help us fight for a home. Home is wherever Taka and I go. My friend lives in Asmo Prefecture. On the border with Tsutsu. I'll find you there. I know this wasn't easy. Going against your code. I did what I had to. Thank you. Lord Shimura. You deserve better than this. Convince your people to stop resisting, and you can walk free. Stop wasting my time. Kill me. Mm, you think you've lost everything. But your nephew is still alive. <laughs> my men control the roads. They build war camps near your towns. They see everything. And they will find him. Lord Sakai will fight until his last breath. As will I. You love him. Just as you love your people. You're a father to them. Will you abandon your children? I won't make them your slaves. Don't move! Sensei Ishikawa. Lord Sakai's boy. <laughs> you survived Komoda. We could have used your bow. I was on my way when bandits attacked me. Are you expecting them to return? <laughs> A samurai is never caught by surprise. I'm sorry about Lord Shimura. He was a good man. He's alive. Taken captive by the Mongols. Then there's hope. That's why I've come. Help me save him. I can't. My student is missing. A skilled archer. I will help you look. Then you can both help me free Lord Shimura. Try and keep up, Sakai. Who else made it out of Kumuda? No one knows. Are there any others who can fight back? Besides us? I don't know yet. You'd better find out quickly. We can't free your uncle by ourselves. I can help track your student. I need no help tracking Tomoe. Tomoe? A woman? From what clan? No clan. A peasant. She can outshoot any samurai I know. 
Even you, Sakai. The last time I saw you was ten years ago. You came to study with me. You remember? I remember most of the students I reject. Instead, you took this Tomoe as your student. You showed promise. Tomoe is a prodigy. Tomoe would never leave that quiver behind. Unless she was pursued. Or captured. To what end? Interrogation. Torture. Worse. They may be doing the same to Lord Shimura. Fear is a weapon, Sakai. Do not let the Mongols use it against you. Your student. Where would they take her? Fort Nakayama. The fort is nearby. I should have fought at Komura with you. Better you didn't. You lost enough there. Why did the samurai fail? The Mongols fought like animals. Wrong answer. I saw it with my own eyes. An archer's aim relies not on eyes, but on body, mind, and spirit. Stop here. We need to talk. What's wrong, Sensei? This bow was a gift to me from Lord Nagao many years ago. It's a beautiful weapon. Of course it is. And there's nothing more painful to me than a perfect bow ineptly used. Then it's a good thing you're giving it to me. <sighs> Who said anything about giving? Prove you can shoot straight. I'll let you borrow it. Try it out before we go into battle. Aim for that lamp closest to us. Now the one further down the road, on the left. Not bad. Let's see if you can hit the one furthest away. The further the target, the more your arrow... How does it feel? Like it was made for me. It wasn't. So take good care of it. Let's go. A bow like this would have helped at Komoda. It is a good bow. But victory is won by warriors, not weapons. You haven't seen the Mongols fire weapons. They have not yet won. I'll find a way in. Open the gate. Then we hit them. Do you always charge into battle with your Hakama half-tied? You have a better idea? Patience, Sakai. The Mongols will send men to find their missing patrol. When they open the gates, we strike. The longer we delay, the longer Tomoe remains in danger. She can take care of herself. They're opening the kits. Wait for my signal. Sisters. Not for long. That's my Tomoe. Slain prisoners. Tied up. Killed with arrows. Tomoe isn't... Wait. This pendant belongs to her. 
Search the fort. The scroll. Archery terms with Mongolian translations. Your name is mentioned. She was teaching them my way of the bow. These arrows are Japanese. They're Tomoe's arrows. You are sure? I taught her to make the knock with deer horn. And that curve of the eagle feathers. So the Mongols took her weapons? The shots are tightly clustered. No Mongol shoots Japanese arrows with such skill. Huh. Then they allowed her to use a bow. Someone's personal quarters. A woman's kimono. Tomoe's kimono. The Mongols freed her. Why? Do you hear that? A survivor. We're looking for a woman, an archer. The Mongols caged her with us. But they set her free. Gave her armor and a bow. She killed my wife and the others. Bodies we found. She proved her skill to the enemy. And they recruited her. Please. It. it hurts. Don't leave me. I've seen enough. Let's go. I should have killed her. Sensei? Tomoe won her freedom. And she joined the Mongols. Why would she do that? What happened? I pushed her too hard. Pushed her how? What are you hiding? Sensei! I demand an answer. She attacked me. Not bandits. Tomoe. Why? She has no idea what it means to be samurai. You drove her to the Mongols. Do not judge me. Do not lie to me. I can't let Tomoe teach my way of the bow to the enemy. Then we will stop her. This is my fight. I don't need your weapon. No, you need me. Victory is won by warriors, not weapons. Lord Shimura raised you well. We'll hunt them away together, but we do it my way. And when the time comes, you will help rescue my uncle. You have my word, Sakai. I will prepare to hunt them away. When you are ready, meet me at my dojo. We can't rescue my uncle alone. I need more people to join our fight. Fine lady, Masako Wadachi. If she's still alive... She's one of the finest warriors on the island. Dead for days. <laughs> Lady Muzzical, it's me. Jin Sakai. They said no samurai escaped Komoda. My husband. Lord Adachi died a warrior's death, defending our home. Our home. Why have you come? The Mongol Khan has captured Lord Shimura. If your clan joins me, we can save my uncle. And avenge your men. Clan Adachi is dead. Massacred by our own people. Traitors. Why would they kill those who swore to protect them? I intend to find out. I'm coming with you. No. 
Do not set aside your concerns for mine. The family of samurai are my concern. I know what it means to be the last of one's clan. I cannot be responsible for your death. You won't be. Ride with me. I fought men at your estate. They were waiting to finish what they started. The night my husband and sons rode to face the Mongols. The assassins came to our home. My sister took the children and fled. I stayed with my son's wives to fight our attackers. You were outnumbered. And then I was the only one left. That's how it ended for me at Komoda. For me. It wasn't over. I buried them here. With the rest of our family. Tried to save them, but the assassins caught them on the road. Cut them down. My sister. My grandchildren. Even little Natsu. She was just born. All I could do was bury her with her mother. This never should have happened. My sister should have been buried with her husband in the north, but at least she is with the family. Come, we ride for the Golden Temple. Sorry you endured this alone. I am not alone. The killers are alive. They will pay for what they did. Every moment the killers walk free brings me shame. You can't blame yourself. But it is my duty to punish them for it. You'll have to go in without me. Find the monk named Sogen and tell him the fate of Clan Adachi. What are you plotting, Lady Masako? Indulge a grieving widow. Once you've talked to Sogen, find the armorer. She is repairing something for me. I want you to have it. I will do that. Thank you. I will wait for you on the other side of the temple. Lady Masako sent me. Said you were repairing something she wanted me to have. The armor. It's one of the finest sets I've ever worked with. Let me get it. It suits you perfectly, my lord. The quality is incomparable. It will serve you well. But if anything isn't to your liking, I can always make alterations. All I need are the right materials. Thank you. Are you Sogen? I am. I am Sakai. A samurai? Alive? I have a message from Lady Masako. Clan Adachi was attacked. She is the only survivor. The Mongols. Traitors. Our own people. How horrible. Has anyone suspicious passed through the temple? A group of armed men? Not that I've seen, but... My duties keep me far too busy. Please tell Lady Masako she's welcome to take refuge here. It fits well. It belonged to my eldest, Shigesato. It is an honor. I spoke to the monk. What did Sogen say? He offers you refuge in the temple. So my family's killers know where to find me. We need to move.
You think Sogan is behind the massacre? He visited my home just before the assassins. The little bastard was their scout. That doesn't prove his guilt. No, but it earns my suspicion. Sogan arrived from Kamiagata at the beginning of autumn. When we first heard the Mongols plan to invade. The plot to destroy my clan took precision, planning. And a war to cover the treachery. Masako's alive. She has a samurai with her. That must be who killed our men at the estate. You fools. Now they know I'm part of this. You have to find them. Keep your voice down. I'm going inside. Don't come back until they're dead. Those men slaughtered my family. Spare the monk. The rest can die. Looking for me? This will make for a grand story. Sogan went inside the room. Let's go. You destroyed Clan Adachi. I was only a messenger. For who? Knowledge does not end suffering. You know nothing of suffering. Masako. I buried my family. One by one. It took days. But I'm going to leave you for the wolves. We need him alive to tell us who he serves. Our world has changed. Men of vision must rise to face it. And those in the way must be removed. They were children! <laughs> Masako! <laughs> he, he was never going to talk. We still need information. There has to be something we can use. Search outside. I'll deal with things in here. Find me when you're done. They've run out of food. Must have been here a while. Hmm. Names. And a symbol. Masako might know them. Find anything. A list of names and a clan symbol. I found the same symbol on these men. I've never seen it before. A rival clan moving in to take control. We have to stop them. I will. You cannot do it alone. When my uncle hears of this, he will not rest until the traitors pay for what they did. Help me, and we will bring down everyone who hurt you. Together. When you need help rescuing your uncle, I will be there. Thank you, Lady Masako. Until that time, I have work to do. Lord Sakai, come quickly! Lady Masako, do you have news of your family's killers? On the list we found, Sada was at the top. He's the head man of Kuta Farmstead. Kuta's people served your clan. Why would he turn against you? Because he is an ungrateful traitor. My husband appointed Sadao as head man, and he repaid that kindness with bloodshed. I learned he fled Kuta the night my family was murdered. He must have heard you survived. Sadao is a deceitful snake, but his brother, Hachi, is a fool. He just passed by the temple carting food for the refugees. He will make an unscheduled delivery to his brother. And we will be there to catch him. We have to go. 
or we will lose him. After what happened at the inn, I didn't think you'd visit the temple again. I came to watch for Sadao's brother, and mourn Clan Adachi's dead. Have you given your family a proper funeral? Not while their killers walk free. After my father died, I said goodbye to him that same night. It helped ease my pain. I buried them. That will have to do. For now. When's the last time you slept? Or ate? I had some rice and fish yesterday. Even the youngest warrior needs a full belly and a rested sword arm. Are you calling me old, Lord Sakai? <laughs> I wouldn't dare. My sword arm works just fine. We should have caught up to Hachi by now. Which way do you think he went? Both roads look traveled. Let's search the area. He can't be far. We will promise that. Not yet, but I have something for your guest. It's a meeting. We'll pass it along. He handed them a note. I'll stop here again at the usual time. We'll meet you there. Forget the wagon. Follow those horses. Woodcutter's house, guarded by bandits. Sadao's cousins. He must be hiding there. We don't know that. But we will soon find out. Corpses can't answer questions. There's someone in the house. I'll make them talk. Let me try first. <gasps> A note from Sadao. Hachi gave it to the guards. Doesn't say where he's hiding. I'm not going to hurt you. My name is Sakai. Who are you? Hina, Sada's wife. My husband is innocent. The Mongols killed your family. Where is he? I, I don't know. You're lying. She'll help us. And she can't stay here. I'll take her to my estate. She's going to kill me! No harm will come to you. Lady Masako, has the traitor's wife told you where he's hiding? Every time I ask, she starts crying and won't look at me. Can you blame her? I'm starting to. Maybe a young samurai will charm her. She's inside. <sighs> Wait here. Lady Masako plans to kill me. I can see it in her eyes. I won't let her hurt you. But I need your help. I have told you all I know. Hachi delivers messages for your husband. That means they have contact. It's only a matter of time until Masako finds them both. No, you have to save him. I can only do that if I get to him before she does. You know your husband. Where would he hide? Let me think. This is important, Hina. Your husband murdered innocents. I'll be back. Well? I'm giving her time to think about where he might be. What did you offer her? Let's take a walk. I know a place she won't hear us. I told Hina I would try to save her husband's life. You know I'm going to kill him. I had to gain her trust somehow. So you lied. I told her I would try to save him. And I will. What will you tell her when you fail, Jin? That you could not forgive his crime. And that I would not stand between you and justice. Everywhere I look here, I see only the night my family died. When my father died, I didn't go home for a long time. 
An empty house falls apart quickly. This isn't my home anymore. It's where my family was slaughtered. Little hands still holding toys. My sister's gold sash wrapped around her butchered body. I can't protect anyone. I can only avenge them. There should be music. What? My grandchildren would make songs with me here to celebrate the changing of the seasons. I will never hear them play again. Thank you. Leave me alone! Hina! Get to the house! We need her killer. Now. Better look around. Why would someone kill Hina? To keep us from finding Sadao. The traitors knew we had her. It was a long journey from the woodcutter. Many people saw her with me. You made sure they did. You used her as bait. I hoped her husband would take it. And now an innocent woman is dead. The traitors killed her, not us. But you made her a target. Only one set of tracks. Whoever the killer is, they're alone. With Hina gone, we need them alive. They have our man. We can't Help. let him die. Come and fight! I'm bleeding! El Dei Ashiglach! Samurai! Cut too deep! I don't want to die like this! Hachi! Sadao's brother. Why did you kill Hina? Tried to free her. She wouldn't leave. Wanted to save Sadao. She screamed for you. I, I didn't mean to. Where's your brother? I failed him. I won't betray him. You can't die! Tell me where he is! He's gone. Hina died for nothing. She was murdered by traitors, just like my family. I can't give up the hunt. He carried messages for his brother. Maybe he had one. What did you find? A map of supply routes. He delivered food to survivor camps. Maybe Sadao is hiding at one. Go to the nearest camp and talk to the monk in charge. He might know what the map reveals. What about you? I will bury Hina. I owe her that. I'll find you at the camp when I'm done. I miss going. Junshi, I should have expected to find you here. How may I serve you, my lord? Do you know these lands well? I set up all of these camps. Does this map mean anything to you? Hmm. We give these to our wagon drivers who deliver food. They mark where the camps are so no one gets missed. Is that blood? Do you see anything that isn't one of your camps? 
I hear rumors of our own people killing each other in Ariake. Traitors are preying on innocent people. They murdered the women and children of Clan Adachi. You can help bring them to justice. This map shows Ariake's lighthouse. We have no camps there, but people have said bandits have taken it over. Not bandits. Something worse. Lady Masako has arrived. I think she prefers to speak with you. What have you learned? The headman of Kuta village might be at the lighthouse. Clan Adachi built that for Ariake. This traitor has no shame. Sado has men protecting him. There's no way they won't see us coming. Good. I want to give that traitor just enough time to fear what's coming. Let's go. Why would Sado betray you? I accused him of stealing rice. Starving our people to turn a profit. You think he caused the rice shortages that hit Kuta? I could never prove it. But it was such a disaster. I knew he was trying to hide something. Bad men are good at hiding their true nature. Guards outside. The coward is hiding at the top. Sado! I've come for your head! You killed Hina! My brother! They died because of you! You should have died with your family! I wish I had! Damn you! You killed Sado. Masako. He helped kill everyone I loved. And for what? To satisfy his pathetic hatred? When the Mongols defeated the samurai, I wanted to die with them. I threw myself into a battle I knew I couldn't win. It was... easier. How do you survive? I remember that I have people to protect. And the dead to avenge. With Sado dead, Whoever is responsible will hear that I'm alive and hunting. They'll become afraid, make a mistake. Just be careful, Masako. You too. You are a part of this now. We'll find the other traitors on that list. But first, we must save my uncle. I'll be at Carneda Farmstead when you need me. Sensei, any word on Tomoe? Yes, but I'm not sure you are ready for her. You make her sound like a demon. That's not far off the mark. Tomoe is fearless. She is not samurai, but she is a born killer. I know the type. No, you do not. Come. Where are we headed? An archery range. The locals are Mongols training there. I suspect Tomoe was with them. If Tomoe is truly fearless, she'd make a useful ally. A starving leopard is fearless too. Leopards can't master your way of the bowl. Let it go, Sakai. She will never join us. Why does she turn against you? I took a risk sharing all I knew with her. When she betrayed my trust, I punished her. It must have been harsh. You saw what she did to the prisoners at Fort Nakayama. That was no mistake. That was a choice. And not the first time she's made it. We don't know it was her fault. You don't. I do. You said the only way up was to climb. No. I said you had to climb. It's good exercise. Arrows, 
Mongol and Japanese. If they were here, they're long gone. We might pick up their trail by the practice target. There is no target. Near that watchtower. Not bad, Sensei. Find out where they went. How many Mongols is Tomoe training? A severed head. Used for target practice. Sensei! Mongols here! Sensei! I could use your help! You knew those Mongols were still here? Yes. You didn't think to mention it? If you can't handle a few Mongols, what good will you be against Tomoe? This is war, not a test. And how many wars have you fought? I'll test you as I see fit. I can see why Tomoe attacked you. <laughs> now, where did she go, Sakai? I'll look around. A lot of tracks. A dozen men. Maybe more. Follow the trail. Look at them. They're practicing what Tomoe taught them. Murdering the innocent. Did you see a Japanese woman with these Mongols? I couldn't believe it. She was giving them orders. What did she say? Something about the sensei. And the hot springs. That's all I heard, my lord. Forgive me. I taught a monster how to hunt. They heard Tomoe giving orders to the Mongols. She mentioned Hiyoshi Springs. She's just getting started. Sakai, the way you fight, it's not your uncle's way, and it's not mine. We've never faced an enemy like this. I do what I must to defeat them. A samurai is a guardian, not a killer who darts around like a thief. You didn't see Komodo. I've seen enough! I know it was brutal. But I won't train another monster. I know. I won't let that happen. If Tomoe is going after Yoshi Springs, I need to prepare. So do you. I'll see you at my dojo, Sakai. Any news of Tomoe? Travelers have been shot dead on the roads in and out of Yoshi Springs. People are free to leave, or deliver supplies. You think that's our doing? Hmm. A few archers, a strategic points, can isolate a whole town. A tactic of yours when you were Clan Nagao's archery master. Tomoe was a good student. Too good? We're fighting your own reflection. We will turn that to our advantage. Come. How do you propose we find these archers? We think like Tomoe. We want to control movement in and out of Hiyoshi Springs. Where do we put archers? What else did you teach Tomoe? I held back nothing. Including why you left clan? That's no secret. It was time to retire, and the hot springs suited me. But you continued to teach. Not at first. What changed your mind? 
The bow is my life. When it down, felt like death. So I chose to live. But do you regret giving up a warrior's life? Mastery of the bow is mystery of oneself. That is the only victory worthy of a samurai. The rest is noise. Innocent travelers, murdered. Let's help their killers follow them across the Sansu River. Tomoya wasn't here. Keep moving. All those innocent, dead. Tomoya has thrown everything away. Betrayed her people. She is a traitor because the Mongols offer power, wealth, status. It was denied her by birth. Tomoe knew she was born to a lower station than she deserved. Now you're being too kind. Kindness can be useful, even to a warrior. Who told you that? Sun Tzu? My uncle. And he didn't tell me. He showed me. Mercy creates a debt. Your uncle showed mercy to people who pose no danger to him. A safe bet. How did Tomoe become your student? She showed up at my dojo with her father's makeshift hunting bow, and refused to leave. You didn't turn her away? I tried, but she sank arrow after arrow into my targets. I've never seen talent like hers. She must have had training. Her form was wrong. Would have been useless in a real fight. But she had no fear of missing a shot. She never hesitated. A warrior's spirit? No. A killer's. I didn't see until it was too late. Sensei Ishikawa! You know the name Ishikawa? I do. I have message. Speak. Sensei! All of Hiyoshi Springs will beg for mercy, like the victims of Hironori now. Silence! <laughs> Hironori Nagao. Didn't he die fighting bandits? It was decades ago. He was reputed to be a great archer. Did he study with you? No. Tomoe is spreading lies. But there's a seed of truth. She wants us to doubt each other. We are all that stands between Hiyoshi Springs and a bloodbath. Then we stand together. Hmm. We'll plan the town's defense at my dojo. Meet me there and be ready to fight. We must deal with Tomoe's threat against Hiyoshi Springs before it's too late. I don't understand a fixation on the town. I was born there. Destroying it proves her worth to the Mongols, and humiliates me. But the terrain works in our favor. Two skilled archers can hold off hundreds. Or we allow the Mongols to take it. Tomoe wins a victory and lets her guard down. Then we strike. Sacrifice Hiyoshi Springs for Tomoe. The sacrifice is worth it. Tomoe would agree, Sensei. Find the guy. She will attack from the north. We should focus our efforts there. Scout elevated positions, place arrows, and listen. Did you hear that? One arrow, one death. I wondered when Tomoe's new friends would visit. If the point was to kill us, she would have sent more men. Or the point was not to kill, but to delay. Hyoshi Springs, the attack is starting. This way. If I fall today, promise me you will keep hunting Tomoe. I promise, Sensei. She knows you're my student. 
Your death will destroy my legacy. Your way of the bow will survive with me. Where will Tomoe strike? In the back town, near the waterfalls, the most vulnerable point. If we get there before the Mongols, we can prepare a defense, but it won't be easy. It never is. You two, come here. What is it, my lords? Mongols are heading for Hyoshi Springs. Gather everyone at the inn and stay out of sight. We will deal with them. Yes, my lords. Good sight lines over here. The Mongols won't be able to flank us. We don't have much time. What can we use to our advantage? Not many options. We'll exploit the ones we have. Hornet's nests. Excellent distraction. Dry grass. Lure the Mongols in. We'll make sure you have flaming arrows. Those barrels could do some damage. Take these flaming arrows, and try not to burn yourself or me. Then don't get in my way, Sensei. Get ready. The Mongols will be here soon. They're getting closer. Good. Let's demonstrate the way of the bow for them. They're coming downhill. Take them. One arrow, one death, Sensei. main road. I've got them. That's Tomoe? Burning the Nagao banner. We can catch her. Oh, she'll be long gone by the time we get there. She's a coward. No. She's mocking me. She knows the last student I trained before her was Hironori Nagao. You said he wasn't your student. Which is it? I was young, prideful, callous. Hironori learned from my example. He led a rebellion to seize the clan and lost, but only after butchering Lord Nagao's best men. Hironori didn't die fighting bandits. That was a story to protect Nagao's legacy. There was no saving mine. As his teacher, I could never be trusted again. I was granted the mercy to resign my position. I convinced myself the way of the bow had to survive. But the truth is, I am a coward who should have ended it long ago. You told Tomoe all of this. I wanted her to understand what it meant for me to teach again. But like everything else, she turned it against me. You'll never redeem Hironori Nago, and you won't change Tomoe. But today, you save the people of Hiyoshi Springs. With my new student, I'll need you at Castle Canada. My bow is yours, but Tomoe isn't done yet. We must keep hunting her. We will, Sensei. Jin? Jin 
Sakai. Yuzo. You look like a scarecrow. You've looked better too. <laughs> Can I have my hat? You're a mercenary now. Professional warrior. Maybe you can help me. I'm looking for your leader. He died on Komodo Beach. You were there too. I lost a lot of friends. We all did. And we can avenge them if we work together. Help me save Lord Shimura. He's alive. The straw hats are hurt. Starving. I can't ask them to risk their lives for one man. Even if you can name your price? Once we free our home, Lord Shimura will pay you anything you want. My men might be interested. Your men? I look out for them. Someone has to. Do we have a deal? I'll think about it. Ready? Hold your ground. I always do. This is for Komodo Beach. Kill them all! Let them surround us! Your form has improved. And you... managed to grow a beard. Have you considered my offer? The Straw Hats can't save your uncle. We'll be lucky if we survive the week. It's that bad? We're starving. I was out here hunting for food, and I'm returning to my men empty-handed. But not alone. Take me to your camp. We'll figure something out on the road. <laughs> Just like old times. When was the last time we saw each other? Two summers ago. Lord Nagao's tournament. I looked for you after the tournament ended. Straw Hats saw our duel. They needed a new sword. It seemed like fun. Why didn't you tell me you were at Komoda? You were busy with the other samurai lords. I was sharing a drink with my men. I could have used a drink before that battle. Yeah, I'll bet. Another wagon. Might have something we can salvage. Empty. Samurai! Samurai! Was this your wagon? Yes, my lord. Mongols stole my horse, took my rice. You're lucky that's all you lost. Which way did the Mongols go? Toward Fort Ohira. Damn it. Take refuge at the Golden Temple. Warn others to stay off these roads. Yes, my lord. Let's keep moving. My camp's not far. <laughs> I meant what I said before. Help free Lord Shimura, and he'll grant you anything in his power. What's he got the power to give? He can declare the Straw Hearts a samurai clan, and make you their lord. On an island, conquered by Mongols. He will drive them out. Your name will appear in the Shogun's official records. You really believe that? I believe it's worth fighting for. I've always been a dreamer. It can't have been easy keeping the Straw Hats together after Komodo Beach. How did you do it? I convinced them nobody can save us but ourselves. That's true. I used to think so. But it's starting to feel like a lie. How many men do you have? We're down by half, but still enough to call ourselves a small army. Why? That peasant said the Mongols stole his rice and went to Fort Ohira. You think they're hoarding food there? Possibly. You have an idea? The beginning of one. Easy, Shinzo. It's me.
Ben, this is my old friend, Lord Sakai. Yuzo told me you're starving. I'm here to help. You didn't find food. We have a plan. Raid Fort Ohira and take back the food Mongols have stolen from our people. Raid a fort? They'll kill us! Give us a moment. Come with me, Jin. We should have talked about your idea before telling my men. I wanted to give them hope. That's my job. I meant no disrespect. It's fine. Through here, Jin. If you ride with the straw hats, you have to look the part. I've got a spare set of armor that should fit. You better not have lice. Never letting me forget that, are you? Spare armor's in the chest. <laughs> You're not as handsome as me, but... It's not bad. <laughs> we should check the fort's defenses. Look for weak spots. My men will handle that part. Then we have a deal? Get us that food at the Fort Ohira. And we'll get your uncle away from the Mongols. Thank you, Yuzo. Just remember who's in charge of the straw hats. I would never dream of replacing you, my friend. Give us a head start. We'll meet you at the old cemetery. See you there. Good. You're here. You ready to steal some food for us? Is this everyone? Just the men who can fight worth a damn. The rest are too hungry or sick. Let's hope we're enough to raid the fort. There's a better chance of seeing cherry blossoms in winter than getting that food. There's always a way. Preferably one that doesn't kill half my men. Scout's back. Come on. A lot of men inside, and a signal at the top of the tower. If they call reinforcements from the bay, we'll be trapped. They'll cut us to pieces. Find a place to watch for me. Once they destroy their signal, attack. They'll kill you. If they do, avenge me, and take their food. That's not funny. Signal the others. They'll see me like the brazier. It's time, Yuzo. Let's get your men something to eat. Where's all the food? I didn't see any in the tower. Did you find anything? Just a stack of Mongol papers on a dead officer. Let me see. You read Mongolian? If it's in Chinese, I can make out some of it. Since when? Since I had to read Sun Tzu. This was only a temporary depot. They're taking everything. Offshore. The boats are in the bay. We'll never get out to them. We got in here. You're crazy. What did you have in mind? Let's see what we're up against. The Mongols have small boats on the beach. We could steal one, but we'd have to cut through their army. Too many barriers and archers. A frontal attack would be suicide. I want my men far away from the enemy's line. 
flaming arrow might set off those explosives. That will get their attention. But we need them to look away from the beach. Put your archers on that cliff. The Mongols will focus on them while we steal a boat. All right, men. They don't know we took the fort, so they'll be waiting for reinforcements that aren't coming. Keep them busy long enough for us to steal a boat. Then retreat into the forest. Look for my torch. That's your signal to attack. Let's find a way down to the beach. You heard Yuzo. Let's move. We won't let you down. Watching you fight back there reminded me of Lord Nagao's tournaments. You did whatever it took to win. It was a competition. You fought just as hard. Did I? What are you getting at? Nothing. Just remembering our duel. We'll talk about this later. If we survive. Your men should be in position. Light the torch. Now. I knew they'd come through. Look at that fire! I never knew our duel bothered you so much. Now you do. You should have told me earlier. Life took us in different directions. It was a long time ago. Uh, no luck. Any sign of food? Not here. Hear that? It sounds like four or five guys. No way around. Surprise them. Greetings! Nice ship. We have to move fast. Ready? Got sky! You search here. I'll take the other. Be careful. To me! I would have had that Mongo if you hadn't shown him. I know. Did you see how big he was? That's where all our food went. <laughs> I promised my men I'd feed them, and I'm going back empty-handed. We'll find another way. But how many will I lose before then? I found something that might help. Mongol battle plans. Do they show supply lines? One page has a map. It's a start. Hand it over. We do this together. 
You've got your own problems, and I am the leader. I need this, Jin. I'll need you at Castle Canada. You'll have me. Don't let them see you coming. Just like you. Taka's counting on us. I love the kid, but this is too dangerous. It will never work. We'll make it work. This the samurai? You can call me Lord Sakai. <gasps> Forgive me, my lord. I am Kenji, upstanding merchant, renowned sake brewer, and the best swindler on the island. That's why he's going to help us rescue my brother from Azamo Bay. That town's a fortress. If the Mongols took it, we'll need an army to penetrate the walls. Or a single delivery of sake. <laughs> It'll never work. Get your sake ready. We'll discuss the plan on the move. <laughs> Let's have a drink first. Talk this through. Now, Kenji. When we get close to the town, you can hide in the cart with the sake. The Mongols won't search it? Not anymore. It's the same sake delivery I always sell them. They love my Dars. Dars, Mughal, give a Dars now! You've been doing business with the enemy. I keep the Mongols drunk, and they let me keep my head. All set. You sure you want to go through with this? Anything for Taka. How bad is the occupation in Azlomo Bay? A few people fought back. The ones left alive are prisoners. Or slaves. But you never saw Taka? No. But someone's been working the forge the past few days. Maybe it's your brother. How long have you two known each other? Since I was too young to know better. I was just starting to brew sake. Sold Yuna my first batch. <laughs> Tasted like piss. But it was cheap. For a while, I tried to get Taka's help selling it. Turned out he was too soft. People told him sob stories, and he'd give them sake, free of charge. Mongols. Damn, you two better get in the cart. There aren't many. I can handle them. No, Jin. Taka is so close. Please. All right. Search the car. You said they don't do that. The town gates? I've never seen them this far out here. My hands. Please. You can boy. Hey. You, let's go. Dars. Dars for Azamo Bay. Aha. Dars. Hurry up. Just a little farther. What was all that screaming? It doesn't matter. Keep it down. Is that what Taka's going through? Your brother's a skilled blacksmith. They won't treat him like that. You don't know that. We're getting close to quiet. Off the Mongols. They burned half the town. <sighs> this is where we part ways. Keep the Mongols drunk and distracted. I'll do my best. Stay safe, Kenji. And you, Lord Sakai. Taka's waiting for us. Let's go. Once we're done, I'll meet you at the crossroads behind town. We need a vantage point to scout ahead. This way. Remember, no alarms. We do this quietly. All the prisoners suffer. Got it.
Learn to be in the oil coin. What is problem? Your blacksmith, Taka. His work is shoddy. I think he's sabotaging you. I know it. Taka's here. He is only blacksmith. No. I'm a blacksmith too. And I'll do much better work. I cannot feed two. I get rid of him. But be ready to prove yourself. That bastard! He'll kill Taka! No, please. I need to rest. It's Taka. Please! <laughs> they do to you? You're safe now. We need to move. We can't. They'll catch us, just like the others. This is Lord Sakai. He'll protect us. I need you to trust me, Toka. I need your help. I'll try, my lord. There's a gate nearby. Then that's where we break out. Found the slaver. They'll kill us. We need to hide. No, keep moving. We can climb those crates. Where are we going? Kenji's waiting for us at a crossroads. Kenji's with you? If he made it out alive. Horses, they're coming for us. Get in the tall grass and stay down. Kenji! Taka! You made it! Were you followed? No, but we can't go back to my place. It's crawling with Mongols. We should go. We have to put some distance between us and Azamo Bay. Not... I haven't seen a Mongol since dawn. I think we're clear. We need to figure out where to go next. There's a place up ahead where you can see most of Izuhara. Everyone all right? I could use a drink, and some sleep. I can help with one of those. Taka, you've been quiet. First time in days, I haven't felt like I was about to die. My lord, I am grateful. But how do you know Kenji and my sister? I owe Yuna my life. <laughs> we have something in common. I'm not built for riding all night. Komatsu is just over that ridge. They have a forge. One of the best on the island. Good place to make tools. Maybe something to get gin over the walls of Castle Canada. What do you say, Taka? My lord, I'll do anything to repay you for freeing me. Thank you. Taka, Kenji, get some rest. We can't stay here long. How are you doing? I have my brother back. He's shaken up. Can you get him to Komatsu in one piece? With food and rest, he'll be fine. Your brother wasn't the only prisoner in Azamo Bay. You're going to save them. And make their captors suffer. Good. Word for Komatsu Forge. I'll join you when I can. Jin? Thank you. We're going into Azumo Bay. Help us fight! You'll endanger everyone inside if you start a fight. The Mongols are starving and beating our elders. Punishing them for a prisoner who escaped. Your elders had nothing to do with that. Where are they being held? One's near the shrine. We think the other two are in the houses. 
How are you planning to get in? The gates are sealed shut. There's an opening in the fence by the main gate. We used it as children to sneak out. I'll use it to sneak in. Stay out of sight until I've opened all the gates. Thank you, my lord. Hold still. Are you hurt? I'm fine. They wanted me to heal their sick. And you refused. Stay here until I've dealt with the rest. Please, free our blacksmith, Izumi. The Mongols are holding him in one of the houses. Please, get me out of here. You're going to be all right. You're safe now. I was sure they were going to kill me. They already killed one blacksmith. No, he escaped. You will too. But stay here until it's safe. You'll be free soon. Are you the headman? I am. The Mongols threatened to kill my people unless I accepted their rule. I was about to give in. You were strong to resist. Remain hidden until it's safe to come out. The Mongol warlord has taken over my home. Please, drive him out and free us all. Samurai! You tortured and abused my people. Accept Mongol rule, and your people will not suffer. You are a liar and a coward. You deserve nothing less than death. I will take nothing less than your head. Genji, what are you doing here? Something has gone very wrong, my lord. What did you do? Nothing! The Mongols have taken all our food. Rice, millet, fish, anything they can lay hands on. We're starving. You say we. This isn't your farm. I have been thinking about what you said. And I'm trying to help the farmers here. Where are the Mongols camped? Who knows, they show up every few days and pick up the food and cart it away. I could ambush them. It's not that simple. They've taken hostages. If we don't produce the food, it's... <gasps> there must be a way to find them. There is. You won't like it. I will decide that for myself. Come, I'll show you. They make us bundle the food and put it on the beach. All of it from this farm? The farm, scavenging abandoned homes, fishing and hunting, just to fill the bellies of the enemy. What brought you here in the first place? Once the Mongols connected me to you, most places got too dangerous. I thought an out-of-the-way farm would be safer. Food and drink for the Mongols, but the sake barrel is empty. Your plan is to anger the Mongols more? Not exactly. 
The barrel is very roomy. It could hold a heavily armed heroic samurai. You know what would fit better? A flabby, flexible sake merchant. The Mongols will take the barrel to the heart of their camp. Who could do more good there? Me or you? I don't know why I keep letting you hide me inside things. Because it works. It smells like your breath in here, Kenji. Well, that barrel didn't empty itself. Get ready, my lord. Here they come. Ludig and Pergendach. Yes, yes, all yours. Take, take. Faster, Morigov. No, no, no. <laughs> That's Miko. Uh, Miko is my horse. Mine. Nadamatat. Morbignik Borso. Ow! Kenji's plan actually worked. Take this food back to your farm. Give Kenji the good news. Kenji? Why would I give him anything but a punch in the mouth? What do you mean? He's the idiot who got us into this mess. He tried to cut a deal with the Mongols. Oh, Lord Sakai! That was amazing. Kenji! You suck his swilling piece of monkey dung! I'll handle this. Explain yourself. I might have sold the Mongols food, but given them straw and wood chips instead. To make a profit? To save the farmers' food. You didn't think the Mongols would notice? Mm, not so quickly. All of a sudden, it was punishment, hostages. Give us food or we kill you. I was wrong to encourage you to make yourself useful. What? No, no. No, you weren't wrong, Lord Takai. I can't do good. I just need practice. Try not to practice when people's lives are at stake. Yes, my lord. Yuna, is that you? Jin! You made it. What happened here? Where's Taka? Hiding with what's left of Komatsu. Mongols came a few days ago. They took prisoners, killed anyone who put up a fight. Now they're coming back to finish the job. These were just scouts. The main force won't be far behind. Then we have to go. Now. We can hold this town. What? We need Komatsu's forge. And it's people. If you need to, you can leave. No. I'm tired of running. Take me to the others. How many survivors are left? A few families. Mostly farmers and blacksmiths. Not worth much in a fight. 
You killed all these men by yourself? Good work. I've had some practice. Can you get more arrows? Used ones. Stuck in buildings. And bodies. They'll have to do. I was out here leading villagers to safety. One of them got trapped over here by the Mongols. She's alive. I is it safe? The Mongols are gone for now. We're going to the forge. You'll be safer with us. Is the forge working? Yes, but we can't light it. The smoke will give us away. Show the Mongols where to find us. We can use it to lure them in. Force a fight at a location we control. They won't be expecting you here. I prayed the gods would protect you. I appreciate it. But I came for your help. Yuna said you needed something. A new tool. To save Lord Shimura. He's held prisoner in Castle Canada, and I need to break him out. Quietly. With no one seeing. This town has a forge. And you're a blacksmith. The best. I might be able to make something. But there is no time. The Mongols! I won't let them take Kumatsu. We're staying. I need my assistant, Yukio. But we got separated. Where is he? I think he was looking for his wife. In town. I'll find Yukio. Yuna, be ready to fight. She always is. Stop! Yukio? Don't! Yes? Taka needs help with the forge. Follow me. Wait! My wife and her sister are by the river. Lead me to them, quickly. This way. Stay close and follow my orders. Who is that man? Who we'll ask him? So much blood. Don't look at it. Look at me. Yes, my lord. Stay here! Yukio sent me. He's alive. Follow me. Taka needs your husband. Mutsu! My love. Yukio, I thought I lost you. Are you hurt? That man fought like an animal or a demon. Keep quiet. We're going to the forge. Stay close. Yukio! He saved us, Taka! Thank you, my lord. The Mongols are here. Where's Yuna? She went to get a family from the house across the river. Hasn't come back. Damn. Don't light the forge until we come back. We're ready to light the forge. Taka said you're looking for a family? I was too late. The Mongols captured them just across the river. Those people took my brother in when he was an apprentice. Then we won't leave him behind. Let's go. Help! You... you saved us. This fight's not over. Can you make it to the forge? Yes. I think so. Everyone stay close to me. Where did he come from? It's a long story. The way he killed them. He's not human. Maybe you're right. Yuna! Thank the gods. Light the forge, Tucker. What about the Mongols? They won't risk destroying this place. That gives us a chance to kill them all. If they don't kill us first. Either way, this is where we make our stand.
I've never seen a samurai fight like that. It was nothing. You are more than a samurai. He is a vengeful spirit. Back from the grave to slaughter the Mongols. Where do we hide now? You don't. Fire up your forge. And get back to making strong Komatsu weapons. That's how we fight back. That's how we'll save Lord Shimura. Vengeful spirit? I think they liked it. I read that samurai follow a path of honor. It is none of the many differences between us. Mm. Then why have my men found their brothers stabbed in the back? Lord Sakai would never resort to such tactics. War brings out who we truly are. It has made you a dog, unleashed by your cousin Kublai to rape and pillage at his command. Your nephew strays from the warrior's path. He will become what you hate, unless you join my empire's fight for peace. You don't want allies. You want soldiers to overthrow the Shogun. Consider my offer. Help your nephew regain his honor before his cowardice goes too far. And before I bring you his head. I can't free my uncle until Taka finishes what he's working on. I should see if Yuna has any news. Spreading more of your stories? Just telling them what they want to hear. Some of them are calling you the ghost. After you put the idea in their heads. These people stay because they believe in you. They should believe in the samurai. To them, you're both. When Lord Shimura is free, they won't need to put their faith in folk tales. Maybe. Taka's sweating over the job you gave him. He doesn't want to let you down. Let's see how it's coming along. You are looking for warriors to help save your uncle. Any luck? Some. Sensei Ishikawa and Lady Masako Adachi are still alive. They're dealing with their own struggles, but when it's time, they've agreed to help. An archer and a noblewoman. You sure that's enough? That's why I hired the store hat Ronin. Turns out their new leader is an old friend of mine. Well, sounds like you have all the help you need. Will you join us? I don't know. Can someone help with this? I'll get it. Go see Taka. We'll catch up later. My lord, I just finished it. Thank you for your patience, my lord. An iron hook with a rope attached to the end. You can use it to climb walls. Swing over things. It'll hold my weight? I tested it myself. I call it a Kaginawa. It's perfect. I'm in your debt. No. It's a gift. I have my sister, my home, my life. That's enough. Thank you, Taka. Jin! Where are you? Do you so? The Mongols have captured my best fighters. I was counting on their help to free Lord Shimura. Jin, if we don't do something, my men are dead. And your uncle stays locked in captivity. Where are they? Caged near Fort Yatade. All right, Iruzo. 
Let's see what we can do. You said they're in cages near Fort Yatate. Where exactly? The cages are actually inside the fort. At the top of a cliff. How are we going to free your people from there? I still have a few men who weren't captured. They're waiting for us at a crossroads nearby. We'll need the extra swords. Lead the way. How were your men captured? Remember that map you gave me? Oh, the one showing Mongol supply lines. Did you find food? Yes. Very well guarded. Too many guards for your best men? The ugly bastards were all over us. I barely got away myself. And you're sure the men are alive? I heard them singing last night. Hmm. I'm surprised the Mongols allowed that. So am I. Are you good singers? Might be more pleasant than mercenary work. <laughs> I didn't choose this life. It is my only option after our duel. Oh, at Lord Nagal's tournament. We never talked about it. Before we spawned, I invited commanders from every clan to watch. You came at me like I was your mortal enemy. Almost broke my arm. I'm sorry. It was my first tournament. I got swept up in the excitement. Of course you did. Every samurai on the island wanted to meet Jito's nephew. I never thought of it like that. You were born at Lord Sakai. That tournament was my one chance to gain attention. To enter the service of the Lord, become a samurai. You should have come to me. I would have hired you. Because no one else would? No. I needed to prove myself. I wish you told me this earlier. Maybe I should have. Someone in Komatsu called you the ghost. Was Lord Sakai not good enough? What's wrong? Afraid I'll get more famous than you? <laughs> <laughs> Running off. After all I did to keep them alive. We still have enough to save your men. I've worked with less. I've lost men to Mongols. Sickness. Hunger. But never this. They're weak. It's not your fault. Anyone else want to leave? That's it. Nice and easy. It'll be dark soon. Ready to ride the fort the other day? We'll figure out how to free your men on the way. Hats. Drive! The bastards are holding my men. What's your rescue plan? My plan? You're the one who got us onto that Mongol ship. Hmm. There's only one road into the fort, and it'll be heavily guarded. I need to get inside without being seen. The Mongols won't be watching the cliffs at the back of the fort. I'll climb up. Go over the wall. How? Are you half-monkey? <laughs> I have something to help me. I'll free your men. Once they're with me, I'll set off one of the alarms. That's your signal to ride in. And crush the Mongols between us. See? I knew you'd have a plan. I'll find a way up the cliff on this side. Stay hidden until you see my signal. Good luck. Don't fall. Ready for you. Time to open the gate. Die, you bastards! This is it! Fight for your freedom!
We place bets how long it'd take you to free us. I lost! Hope you brought some sake. <laughs> You're not gonna believe this. It doesn't make any sense. What doesn't? My men said the Mongols didn't hurt them. They fed them. Good food, too. No wonder they were singing last night. Just be grateful they're safe. Why in all the hells would the Mongols feed them? Maybe they expected something in return. Thank you, Jin. My men. They're everything. Welcome back. You're still here. Disappointed? I thought you'd leave as soon as I had my grappling hook. Try to find a way to the mainland. As tempting as that sounds, you saved Taka's life. My debt's not paid until your uncle's free. I'm glad to hear it. Send word to the others. What should I tell them? We're going to break into Castle Canada and free Lord Shimura. Told your nephew stalks my men, tears them apart like a beast. I'm certain you've done worse. <laughs> oh, you pretend we are different, but we fight for the same thing to create a legacy that outlives us. I won my legacy with duty and honor, brought order to my home, and justice for my people. You are nothing like me. Neither is your nephew. But his name is bound to your legacy. A legacy is more than a name. Ah, true. Your family has lived here for generations. Your ancestral castle lies to the north, yes? I look forward to visiting it. While I leave you here to starve to death, alone, without honor. Damn it, Rizzo. Where are you? Everyone's here. Shall we wait for the Straw Hats? No. I'll meet you at the farmhouse. Jin. Thank you for coming. Lord Shimra will be grateful. My family's killer can wait a few hours longer. As can my hunt for Tomoe. Our island needs its leader restored. With your support, he'll be free by sunrise. Prepare yourselves. We'll attack soon. Give the word. We'll be there. Your own student, fighting for the enemy. Taka, fine work on the grappling hook. I'm glad it suits you, my lord. Yuna wanted me to stay behind, but I had to come and wish you well. What's your excuse, Kenji? I don't like drinking alone. Then save your finest sake. If we rescue Lord Shimura, we'll have much to celebrate. Only the best for the Jito. Can't wait till this is over. Today we free Lord Shimura. I was told we'd have straw hat reinforcements. They're not here. And we can't wait any longer. What's the plan, Lord Sakai? I'll use my grappling hook to infiltrate the castle. Once I silence the alarm, the rest of you can safely breach the front gate. The Mongols are likely holding Lord Shimura in the main keep. If they sound the alarm, they may execute him. We can storm the front gates, take them by surprise. No, we do this quietly. We'll carve a path to the main keep, rescue Lord Shimura, then fall back to the main gate and make our escape. <sighs> Sounds like suicide. Only if we attack head on. We can do this if we sneak in and catch the enemy while they're sleeping. I'm like a thief. Or a ghost. Lord Shimura is counting on us. 
Let's head out. Sensei, you and Kenji secure the front gate. Consider it done. Yuna, can you clear the path along the cliff? I'll handle it. Good. We'll meet up at the bridge. Forgetting someone? No. You're with me. Can you operate the Huacha? I'll figure it out. When I free Lord Shimura, we'll be chased by Mongols. Take them down. With pleasure. Be safe, Jin. And you, Masako. Those men were starving. They may have turned against him. War turns desperate men into animals. Gates locked. Hold the bridge. I'll find another way over. I could use Yuna's help. This area. I'll find Lord Shimura. Good luck, Jin. Ryuzo. The Khan put a bounty on the coast. Anyone can claim it. You wouldn't. My men are starving, Jin. Help me save my uncle, and he will reward your men. He will make you samurai. Then <laughs> he'll send us to die. Just like he did at Komodo Beach. Juzo? He's your family, Jin. I need to protect mine. Save our home. It belongs to them now. Buzo. He's here! The samurai is here!
knew you would come, my boy. Your father would be proud. I live to serve you, my lord. We have to leave. Not yet. Kotun Khan is marching north to conquer Toyotama. He left some guards here. But there'll be no match for two samurai. I brought allies. We can retake the castle. They will sing songs of our victory. Lord Sakai, we pull them to us. I'm with you, my lord. Sensei, Lady Masako, you've survived. With your nephew's help. He insisted we could save you. I thought it impossible, but I'm glad he proved me wrong. It won't be the last time, Sensei. I'm glad you're all here. We've lost too many friends. And family. Lord Adachi died with honor, Lady Masako. Now we avenge him. And all the fallen warriors of Tsushima. There's more coming! We will face them, together. All the fallen warriors of Tsushima! Lady Masako! Lady Masako! Let no one retreat! <laughs> <laughs> Well fought, all of we you. We did it. The castle is ours. You've led us to victory, my lord. With your help, Jin. Together, we will break the Mongol spirit and bring Kupun Khan to his knees. We will win this war as samurai. Have an impressive home. Won't you welcome me inside? Your people are tired, hungry, cold. Open the gate and save them. Open the gate! Open the gate! <clears throat> Your uncle's looking for you. I heard the Khan took his castle. I never should have trusted you so. He fooled all of us. I thought you'd be gone by now. 
So did I. Let's talk to my uncle. See about getting your reward. Lord Shimura is in the main keep. Do you still want to leave Tsushima? There's nothing left for me here. I could use your help in the fight ahead. You have your uncle, Jin. You don't need me. I need every ally I can trust. Good luck with your uncle. So, mount their heads on the battlements of my castle. But I can't do this without you. You have me. I heard of your exploits while I was imprisoned. Your methods were brutal. Impulsive. Without honor. I did what I had to. For you. I know, Jin. And I will be forever in your debt. But you can't continue down this path. The whole of Tsushima looks to us for guidance. We must save our home together. As samurai. What about Yuna? She saved my life, and helped free you. All she wants in return is safe passage to the mainland. I will grant it when the seas are clear. But only if she helps me retake my castle. Thank you, Uncle. We ride within the hour. Yes, Lord Shimura. Lady Masako. Any news on your family's killers? My hunt continues. I've tracked several of the names to Toyotama. You won't have to find them alone. But when the time comes to retake Lord Shimura's castle, can I count on your sword? I'll be there, and we will destroy our enemies together. How are the defenses coming? Uh, slow. But they'll pick up once we get the forge going. <laughs> Good work, both of you. Anything to help, Lord Sakai? You fought well yesterday. Your bow made that easier, Sensei. Any news on your fallen student? I heard rumors of a Japanese archer helping the Mongols in Nakashima. It has to be Tomoe. I'm heading to a camp for survivors near the coast. I may know more. I will find you there, Sensei. You have my word. What did your uncle say? Lord Shimura will grant you passage to the mainland. After you help us retake his castle. Oh, this isn't my fight, Jin. This is everyone's fight. Prove your worth to Lord Shimura, and he will reward you. I promise. Lord Sakai, it's time. Typical uh. samurai. Squeezing people for everything they're worth. We ride for Toyotama, Lord Sakai. The bridge is out. The Mongols don't know about the old forest path. This way. Uncle, I'm sorry I didn't free you sooner. You have nothing to apologize for, Jin. I've seen what Mongols do to our people. I can't imagine what you went through. <laughs> it takes more than a bloated Mongol warlord to break my spirit. He learned our language, kept you alive. What is he after? He wanted me to aid his conquest of our mainland. Offered me wealth, power, wives. He thought you'd turn against your own people? For that insult alone, I will kill him. Tell me about this woman who saved your life. Yuna is brave, loyal, and good in a fight. Ishikawa said she's a thief. She can be a little rough, but she has a good heart. Take care where you place your faith. You were friends with Juzo, too. The battles ahead will be difficult. 
I need to know I can rely on my people. You have my full support. And Yunus. Long ago, chaos ruled this island. It was the samurai who brought order and unified all of Tsushima. We must show our people that honorable samurai still fight for this land. It is time you return home and reclaim the armor of Clan Sakai. It has sat empty since my father died. The past cannot hurt you, Jin. You smell that? Burning wood and bodies. Raided farms to the south. But never like this. This is the Khan's revenge for my escape. He must save any farm left standing. Without them, we won't survive the winter. I'll see it done. The Mongols have taken our lighthouse. We will relight the flame. Show the Khan we're coming for him. And give our people hope. We must find our lighthouses and rekindle every last one. They deserved worse. Reinforcements. They want to trap us. You know what's she doing here? A war band's right behind you. They have explosives. We can use that against them. Ready your bow. Cut them down. Kill them all. Ready to fight for our cause? I need to get off this island. So does Taka. We're not finished yet. To the lighthouse. We'll rekindle its flame. Show the Mongols our victory at Castle Kaneda was only the beginning. And tell the Khan we're coming for him. Yarikawa has plenty of warriors. If their walls haven't fallen. I put down the Yarikawa rebellion. Its people have no love for me. I know. I grew up there. Is that where you learned to steal? Yuna has great admiration for you, Lord Shimra. She can convince her people to fight under your banner. Very well. Help Lord Sakai raise this army. And you will be on the first transport to the mainland. With my brother. Wait for me in Ord Yarikawa. Thank you, Jin. Khan sees this. He will. We will take back your castle, uncle. And destroy the Mongols. As honorable samurai. Return home and claim your father's armor. Recruit the peasants of Yarikawa. I will petition the Shogun for reinforcements. How we get a message to the mainland? I have unsavory friends of my own. A pirate named Goro in Omugi Cove owes me a debt. If he's alive, I'll find him. 
Bring him to me at our old hunting camp. We will meet again soon. Until then, travel safely. I cannot lose you again. My lord, we freed a Mongol prisoner here. A warrior monk. He wants to speak with you. A warrior monk? I'll find him. Lord Sakai, my thanks to you and your companions. Where do you serve? See the temple. Our warrior monks rode south to fight the Mongols after we heard about Komoda. But our journey ended here. I'm sorry. What happened? We were ambushed and taken captive. Shoved into a covered pit. No food. So dark I couldn't see my hands in front of my face. I think they took Jogan out first. We heard him struggling and shouting. Then shouts turned to screams. We could smell... burning. But we refused to submit. There were only three of us left when they took my brother. Enjo. Enjo? A guardian? I'm sorry, he's gone. He was a great warrior. An even better brother. What's your name? Norio, my lord. This is where they held us. That hole would barely fit six men. I promised it holds double that. Walk with me, Norio. I want to show you something. You rode from Toyotama. What was it like? Kushi Temple was spared, as were the healers of Akashima. I hear the pirate's nest of Umugi Cove still stands. Let's stop here. There must be thousands of invaders. Now that Lord Shimura is free, he can lead us to victory. I hope you join our fight. The monks of Cedar Temple can help. They're all within a day's ride. Support them, and we'll sweep the Mongols back into the ocean. We will avenge your brother, Norio. All the monks who died here. I don't seek revenge, but I will fight for peace. I'll ride to Akashima village to support our healers. If we're going to fight back, we need their skills. I can introduce you to Hochi. My brother always said he's the greatest healer of us all. Then I'll see you again in Akashima. Halt, Ronin. State your business. I'm not a Ronin. My name is Jin Sakai. A samurai? Lady Sanjo will want to see you. She's in charge of Omugi Cove. Please, come with me. This way, my lord. It's important you speak to the lady. Well, the Mongols were going to kill us at Hotia. Lord Sakai. This is Lady Sanjo. Welcome to Umugi Ko. I see the Mongols haven't found this place. Thankfully, no. There hasn't been bloodshed here for many years. Anyone who draws a weapon answers to my men. Your safety is assured, so long as you abide by that same rule. Now please, tell me how I may help you. I'm looking for a smuggler named Goro. Interesting. He is downstairs, having his third bottle of sake. Enjoy your visit with him. Thank you. Come see me again sometime. I think we can help each other. Jin, over here, quickly. Masako. 
How long have you been here? Not long enough. You need some rest. What I need is justice for my family's murder. I'll be one step closer once I catch the snake named Umara. One of the conspirators on the list. He supplied the weapons that butchered my family. Then we will find him and make him talk. We need to get out of the open. This way. Omada's rumored to be traveling to Umugi. I just don't know when, so I've been camping out, waiting. We can keep watch from here. Do you know what Omura looks like? I'm not sure. I haven't seen him in 20 years. You knew him? He supplied our clan, but he cheated us. Then tried to blame my husband for not paying him enough. Was he right? Of course not. Now please, watch the road. And get comfortable. We might be here a while. Masako, there. Men on the walkway. They look just like him. Exactly like Omana 20 years ago. They must be his sons. Were they both involved? I'm taking the canyon. There are people I need to speak with. People you need to boast to. Excuse me? <sighs> Never mind. I'll see you in a movie. They're splitting up. Let's follow them. See what we can learn. I'll take the left. You take the right. The canyon is narrow. Stay high to avoid being seen. Jin, over here. The one I followed was involved. He spoke of revenge against Clan Adachi. And what are we waiting for? He's on his way to meet the man who hired him. The man who ordered my family murdered. Let's get closer. Hear what they're saying. This way. I want help. You're just getting caught. It's not right. What a Dutch hit a father isn't right. Our family ending up in the street. Father's drinking. He stole from Adachi. And father was always a drunk. Listen, we pulled this off. And you can use the money to escape. Take your family and leave the Mongols behind. Let's get this over with. He said he was coming along. I'm sure these men are just for show. He is a lord, after all. These fools are walking into a trap. Let's wait. See what happens. Something's not right. Let me do the talking. I hope we haven't kept you waiting. Which one of you is Omura? That would be me. You have the pain? We do. No! Omada's mine! Damn! The fool's dead! I heard him talking about a letter. He might still have it on him. I'll look. I'll check the bandits. See if they're holding anything. This note bears the same clan emblem that was on the list from the inn. This was a setup. Whoever killed your family, lured Omura here to silence him. A coward is covering his tracks. Judging by this note, it's clear he's desperate for money. He must not lead a wealthy clan. Or he has no clan at all. You think my family's killer isn't a samurai? Maybe he wants to become one. Start his own clan. And he's scavenging the corpse of Clan Arachi to fund it. Few people have the ambition for such a plot. I can use this. Narrow my search. First, get some rest. This hunt is killing you. Until I find the man responsible, there is no rest. One of my family's killers walks free in Kubara. Find me there when you can. You're mistaken. That does not sound like Kajiwara. Then you're a bigger fool than I thought. Jin, a word, please. Ignorance 
Masako, what's wrong? A man named Kachiwara recruited the men who killed my family. His name is on the list. He lives in this prefecture. That monk knows where, but he won't tell me. Junshin means well. I'll talk to him. It's like Agyo himself. Junshin, it's good to see you. And you, Lord Sakai. Lady Masako and I are looking for Kajiwara. You know where he is. She accused him of terrible things. I fear for his life if she finds him. Asako has good reason to believe he recruited the men who killed her family. Hmm. He would never do that. He is a humble fisherman, a loving husband and father. I think she is blinded by rage. Jushin, I need to talk to him. As long as it is just talking. Take the road from here to the coast. Kajiwara's hut is on the beach. Well? We'll take the road to the coast. Thank you for your help, monk. Peace be with you, Lady Masako. I can't imagine what you said to Junshin that I didn't. He doesn't even try to hear me. It's like talking to a stone. I think he's afraid of you. Afraid? Why? You can be intimidating. In our world, that is not a bad thing. We're hunting a cruel and vicious man. He was a retainer for our clan. Dependable and skilled, but quick to anger. We excused his behavior until the day I caught him beating his wife and daughter. A coward. Hurting his own family. I dismissed him. Immediately. I offered his wife and daughter refuge in our house. Within a day, they'd gone back to him. It's not always easy. Especially when you think they'll change. This path should take us to the beach. We'll leave the horses to avoid being seen. We should approach with caution. I don't want to put Kajiwara's family at risk. That must be Kajiwara's fishing hut. The Mongols found it. They may have already killed him and his family. There's a chance they're still alive. Let's go. I don't see any more Mongols. Let's check the house for Kajiwara and his family. New rolls of cloth. Not cloth. Silk. More than a humble fisherman could afford. This blade is covered in blood. It doesn't look like a Mongol weapon. It's a fisherman's tool. This must be Kajiwara's wife and daughter. I always feared this would be their fate. Maybe the Mongols killed them? Then where is Kajiwara's body? Kajiwara! Lady Masago! The Mongols attacked! My wife and daughter! Quiet, snake! We know you killed them. Out of love. Better me than the Mongols. It's what they wanted. You sick Jin! You recruited the assassins who killed my family. Who hired you? Tell me and I will end you lovingly. Like you did your wife and daughter. All I know is he understood. Understood what? How it feels to be ruined by you. How I was driven to poverty. The toll it took on my family. How I couldn't stand to hear another word. Everything he said was a lie. Except about being ruined by me. I know Sadao felt the same way. The conspirators are bonded by hate. The attack on your clan was personal. Organized by a rival samurai with a deep grudge. But I can't think of who. You'll find him. Junshin, what was that about? Lady Masako is looking for someone. She is angry I couldn't help. 
Like you helped with Kajiwara, the fisherman? Did you ever find him? Yes, after he killed his wife and daughter. How could I be so foolish? My friend can be harsh, but she speaks the truth. This time, I truly do not know who she's after. You have nothing to fear. I'll speak with her. Thank you, Lord Sakai. And also for ridding this farmstead of Mongols. Now we can rebuild. These people are lucky to have you. Be well. Did the farmers know who you're looking for? Someone on the list. A thief. I'll help you find them. I need to handle it myself. The farmer said they left with armed men. Mercenaries. Professional killers. They could complicate things. I can use your help, but I need your discretion. You can count on it. The farmers said they went toward the bridge outside the farmstead. It's this way. <laughs> Who is this thief? She looted Clan Adachi's estate after the attack. Stole valuable heirlooms, personal items. What makes it worse is that Mai was our former servant. Three years ago, my husband caught her stealing. He wanted to have her flogged. I did what I could for her, but she had to go. It almost sounds like you miss her. She was a dear friend. Her betrayal stings more than the others. I'm going to sell everything. I'm just waiting for the right time. Too late. He'll sell those heirlooms himself. Now take us to them. I'll pay you to leave them with me. <laughs> you have no money. I have this comb. It's gold with pearl inlay. That was a gift. It might fetch a fair price. No. It have our heads. Enough of this. Take us to the heirlooms. We don't need the mercenaries alive for questioning. Just her. The more of them we eliminate, the easier it'll be to recover what's yours. Just don't be seen, or they might hurt her. I'll take him. to speak with Mai. I'm here if you need me. You stole my family's heirlooms for those murderers. How could you betray me? I didn't. You betrayed me. Turned me away. I saved you. My husband wanted you flogged. He knew. Then you should have left with me. I was the lady of Clan Adachi, and you were a thief. I still love you. Then tell me who you serve. He killed my family, and he'll kill me. I won't let him touch you. I'll take you to your family's things. We know the man you work for is a samurai. I don't know his name. Never saw his face. He communicated only through notes. He knew about us. 
my lady. How? I don't know. He said he knew what it was like to love you. That he understood my pain. Masako. My was my only... Has been the only... He was anxious about the heirlooms. Concerned they get broken. He's eager to sell them. Their value is purely sentimental. He won't get the money he seeks. Then perhaps he has no intention of selling them. It's possible they're personal to him too. He was possessive in his notes. Spoke as if they were his. The heirlooms belong to no one but my family. I am the only one who remains. Your heirlooms are in the brush, Jin. Will you gather them? I need to say goodbye. Thank you. Where's Mai? She's gone home. Jean, I want you to know, I'm not... You don't owe me an explanation. I cared for my husband. But I cared for Mai, too. You still do? I think I always will. The man we hunt has feelings for you. Other than my husband and my, I've had no romances, no admirers. He could have been lying, feigning sympathy to gather recruits. I just don't know who would do that. You'll keep searching. It's only a matter of time. When that time comes, we'll make him pay. Speak, monk! Please stop! Where is Junjin? Masako, what are you doing? Helping this monk find his tongue. My lord, help! Masako, let me handle this. Fine. I was just looking but if you can't make him talk, I will. Do whatever you want. I, I thought she was going to kill me. No harm will come to you. What do you know about Junjin? Junjin was helping survivors at Red Leaf Temple. But I hear the Mongols raided it. Then he's in danger. We will find him. What do you want with Junshin? He conspired to kill my family. He's been saving refugees. And his name wasn't on the list we found. Someone left him a note at the temple. It's identical to the ones the conspirators carried. Junshin was promised supplies for his relief camps. In return, he was to provide information on my whereabouts. It's just an offer. This proves nothing. It proves he had contact with the person who killed my family. We will get to the bottom of this. By talking to Junshin. You have my word. He was last seen at Redleaf Temple. Let's go. Wait for me. Keep up. When we find the monk, let me deal with him. Remember, we agreed to talk to him. The men who killed my family talked with their swords. Masako. You will not kill Junshin until we're certain of his guilt. Your father was murdered. Did you talk with his killer? Lord Shimura tracked him down and collected his head. You've had your vengeance, Jin. Don't stand in the way of mine. Reinforcements. 
I need to get Junshin. Masako! Stand aside, Jin. You betrayed my family. Run! If we fight, the Mongols win. They already won. You were my friend. Give me the monk. No. You call that fighting? You are defending a murderer! We agreed to talk to him! Talking never works! You promised me! My promise is to my family! Hear them coming? They are the enemy. You gave me your word. When I looked at Junshin, all I saw were my dead grandchildren. Their faces after being cut down, and you were protecting him. So you tried to kill me? Have you lost your mind? I have lost everything! No, you've sacrificed everything. For revenge. And what do you feel when you think of Yuzo? Can't let anger consume us. Or blind us to our friends. You still trust me? Junshin won't get far. We can track him down. Masako! Don't ever try to kill me again. I won't. I promise. Look for his tracks. Jinshin went this way. Looks like he ran into the woods. Let me find Jinshin. Perhaps I should speak with him first. So you don't trust me? It doesn't matter. Jinshin won't. And we need him to talk. Fair point. But remember, Jin, he only needs his tongue to talk. Who offered you supplies in exchange for information about Masako? She called herself L Lady Hana. Liar! Masako, wait. Who is Lady Hana? My sister. She was massacred with the rest of my family. She visited me two nights ago. 
wore a crimson kimono with a golden sash. I remember. She smelled of chrysanthemum. <laughs> no. No. I never told her anything about you. I swear it. Leave us. <laughs> My sister's alive. She murdered the children. Why would she want to destroy your clan? I don't know. But I am going to find her. You don't have to do it alone. Meet me in Kamiyagata. I'm looking for a samurai, an archer. The sensei headed toward the coast. He said you should catch up with him to join the hunt. And you'd know what that meant. Sakai, over here. Keep your head down. You're wounded. I'll survive. You should have waited for me at the camp. I had a lead on Tomoe. I couldn't risk losing her. Were those her archers? One of them shouted my name. More on the way. Tend to your wound. I'll take them. Had you surrounded? Tomoe taught them well. That's not why they outmaneuvered you. If you have an insight, share it. You didn't notice them because you were too focused on finding Tomoe. Even I make mistakes, Sakai. No, you don't. Except with her. Hmm. We should get moving. Hey what do you know about the camp? Archers, for the most part. Tomoe has been seen with them on raids all over Akashima. She won their trust. She's a useful tool to divide and conquer, for now. Tomoe betrayed you before she sided with the Mongols. But you never told me exactly what happened. She used my teaching to help a band of assassins. They did well. It still doesn't explain why she attacked you. Sakai, how does a samurai deal with an assassin? You retaliated and attacked her. I dealt with Tomoe as I would any common murderer. She was your student. I don't make exceptions, Sakai. First, Hironori Nagao. Now, Tomoe. Don't be the next to disappoint me. What's that ahead? They hunt people for sport. Not sport. Practice. They're ruthless. Indulging violence weakens the warrior. Like too much food or drink. You said Tomoe traveled to your dojo to study. What did she do before that? Her mother belonged to a merchant family in Umugi. She never knew her father. Why do you ask? Killing is not learned overnight, even for a prodigy with a bow. She was born with a taste for bloodshed. More of Tomoe's work. Their archers hunt the people of Akashima like dogs. Tomoe and her allies are too hungry for violence. A killer masters a weapon. A samurai masters himself. You've devoted your life to mastering the bow. To the bow, yes. But not to killing. Now you're splitting hairs. I've tied a wounded man to my horse with a bowstring. Used an arrowhead to cut meat when I had no knife. 
You're saying a bow is more than a weapon. And a samurai is more than a killer. If we can't win Tomoe back, we have no choice. We have to kill her. I trained her. I share the blame for her actions. I will end this. You only share the blame if you encouraged her thirst for violence. I made her my student. I should have seen the darkness in her. You didn't see it, and that scares you. Uh, it bothers me. We're nearly there. We'll approach this like Fort Nakayama. Observe the camp, look for weaknesses. Make a plan of attack. That's right, Sakai. Look twice and shoot once. Supply list. Japanese bows and targets. Delivery locations all over Toyotama. She's setting up more training camps. One in Otsuna, another in Kushi. And more planned. A message. In Japanese. What does it say? Great Khan, conqueror of Tsushima. Before the year is over, your archers will know all I do about killing samurai. And I would deliver the heads of Sensei Ishikawa and Jin Sakai. Tomoe was here. I gave her everything. And she threw it away. She's a threat. There is only one way this ends. I know what must be done. Knowing and doing are different. You are questioning whether I am samurai? Tomoe was my greatest achievement. But if I must, I will destroy her to save this island. That is my duty. The list we found. We will use it to track down the other camps. And we will end Tomoe's treachery. Sakai! You are a fine warrior. You could become a great leader. But do not question my integrity again. Ah! The coast! Don't kill me! What's going on? Take whatever you want. I'm not a thief. Huh. Everyone knows you're attacking caravans. The ghost and the demon Sensei. Sensei Ishikawa? That's a lie. I've heard you myself. Heard us? When? Not long ago. Tearing up the road like starving wolves. <laughs> Quick, hide! About time you showed up. You're welcome, Sensei. You're the ghost. What happened here? His caravan was ambushed. Lots of attacks lately. People say you're stealing supplies, or sided with the Mongols. Rest easy. I'll discuss this with Lord Sakai. Tomoe is behind this. She sows paranoia and fear. Attacking caravans, blaming us. I caught up to his group too late. Saved him, but not the others. Where was he ambushed? Close. Why? Find the ambush site. Track the rest of Tomoe's group to their camp. That makes sense. What's wrong? Nothing. She has me off balance. We'll put an end to that. Rest here. Eat the food I gave you. And wait a while before you leave. Thank you, Sensei. Show me where he was ambushed. How did you find me? Someone heard a convoy being chased. People avoid the roads because of Tomoe. When I caught wind of a merchant chancing a supply run, I followed. Why would Tomoe attack supply runs in Kushi Prefecture? There's no strategic importance. No. But Kushidera Temple inspires people. 
could be a Mongol effort to break morale here. You don't sound convinced. I think that's part of it. Not all. Tomoe betrayed everything I taught her. Then she betrayed me. And after me, her home. And I'll hunt her past the horizon if I must. There's the convoy. And more victims of Tomoe. Let's see what we can learn. It's a warning to the people of Kushi. From Tomoe. From Lord Sakai and Sensei Ishikawa. No travel is permitted on these roads. On pain of death. Crude, but effective. Why is she here alone? I'll cut her loose. Over here! Hold still. Oh no! No, please! No! We're here to help. She said... She said... Tomoe? What did she say? She said... I could live... Until the samurai came. No! On the net! Don't show! Don't show! Us, and we walked right into it. I spoke with her two days ago. Tomoe? The captive. Heard her talking about a Japanese woman she saw with the Mongols. I asked her to find out where they were camped and report back. You did what? It could have gone the other way. We'd be standing over Tomoe's body instead. You talk about what it means to be a warrior. How Tomoe undermines that. But you and she are the same. You expect us to be perfect. Your uncle, me, Masako Adachi. But only a child expects perfection of his elders. Finish your thought, Sensei. We all carry weapons. We all choose between life and death. And you're too comfortable with that power. And if I weren't, I would be dead. And so would you. Ghost. Not everyone can be a samurai. But we're all killers. We still have a camp in Otsuna to deal with. Lan is the one who saw their camp. That's right, Sensei. Sakai. Sensei Ishikawa, is all this Tomoe's work? She and her mongos have been busy. A woman here named Ran knows where to find her. Lead the way. <sighs> yes, my lords. The mongos who did this to you, they were led by one of our own. Tomoe, I'll never forget that face. She used to ride with a group of thieves who lived here. That's not possible. Tomoe is from Umugi Prefecture. She found her way here. Her bow terrorized Utsuna for years. People used to say she could knock a falcon from the sky, blindfolded. This camp you found, where is it? In the forest, southwest of here. The... between the river and the western shore. Tomoe never told you any of that. Before we fought, I offered to adopt Tomoe as my daughter, make her samurai. For someone like her, that's quite a change in fortune. And I took it away. Because she's a hired killer. Because her sensei failed her. She fell back into the life she knew. It's one thing to wreck your chance at a better life. 
but to terrorize your own people. I am aware, Sakai. Are you? Can I count on you to do what needs to be done? We have a camp to find. We need to stop Tomoe before she takes more lives. Let's go, Sora! The good news is Tomoe fell back to a place she knows. Because she's desperate. She has the Mongol Empire on her side. The more we damage her efforts, the more likely the Khan withdraws his support. We could use that to our advantage. Drive a wedge between them. But if we did, then Tomoe abandoned the Mongol cause. If she was willing to fight back against the Mongols, we could use that. Well, that would be useful. Until the moment she put an arrow in your back. The woman we spoke to said Tomoe terrorized people here. It must have been years ago. Tomoe would have been young. In her teens. And holding her own among bandits. Hmm. Difficult for someone twice her age. And you never suspected anything. When she began her study with me, she hid a small blade in her sleeve. And she secretly hoarded food. I can see how you could overlook those signs. Yeah. There were others. I wanted to make her my heir so badly. I blinded myself to the truth. The camp should be nearby. Perfect terrain for archers lying in wait. Keep your eyes open. Dismount here. Sensei, over here. Could be Tomoe. The Sensei and the Ghost. I'm getting tired of you two. Your archers are dead. It's over. Ambush! Go after Tomoe. I'll hold these fools off. Where's she going? Tomoe! So you're old Sakai. The sensei's new pet. And you're a gifted archer who had a chance at a better life, and threw it away. Is that what he told you? Tomoe, why are we talking? So I can warn you to watch your back. My sensei tried to kill me. He'll try the same with you. Thanks for the warning, but I'm here to end this. It's already over. I have nothing. No one. Put the bow down, Tomoe. Has she lost her mind? No sign of her. I should tell Sensei Ishiko. Tomoe could have killed me, but she didn't. You let her get away. She jumped off a cliff. I saw her. You saw what she wanted you to. She sounded desperate. She is. Because of us. Why does she think you'll turn on me? She doesn't. She's trying to drive a wedge between us. And it's working. No. It's not. Good. But the next time you wonder if I can do what's needed, ask yourself first. Thank you for your help. What are you doing here, Masako? Looking for my family. I already found my husband. But I've yet to find my sons. They died as warriors. Defending our home. Did you see where they fell? No. The battle was chaos. I could barely keep eyes on my uncle. Let me help you find them. Look, over there. One of your soldiers? Yes, but alone. Do you think he deserted? When your husband fell, your clan surged forward to avenge their lord. 
No one fled. It's a comfort to know they were loyal to the end. Keep your eyes open for more of our banners. He was riding down the beach. Then we will continue in that direction. Kikuchi banner. I don't recognize him. My sister's husband fought for Kikuchi. Your brother-in-law could be close by. Should we look for him? Right now, I just need to find my sons. One of our banners. My horse. I almost died with him. What happened? My uncle saved me. We will return the favor. The important thing is, you endured. Who is he? This is Masanori. He was too young for battle. But his father was old, so he went in his place. Not only a brave soldier, but a good son. Yes, but where are mine? Nagao warrior. The Nagao archers fell many Mongols. Their skill was unrivaled. If only Sensei Ishikawa had been with them. Your uncle's banner. During the battle, when I saw these colors on a fallen man, I feared it was my uncle. Only fools have no fear of death. They lead up through the rocks. Our banners. Uchikage, a close friend of my son's. He would have stayed by their side. They must be near. This way. And left their dead to rot. Like discarded trash. They should be with our family, buried beside their wives and children. The journey to Ariake isn't safe. Is there someplace close we could bury them that would honor their sacrifice? The lighthouse. They played there when they were young. But it's been overrun by Mongols. Then we take it back. They loved climbing that tower. If they didn't come home at night, I could always find them there, gazing at the stars. You are a good mother. I used to think so. But my children are dead, and I am alive. There is no greater failure. I felt that way when my mother died. That I'd failed her. But you were so young. And she was ill. There's nothing you could have done. Even if that's true, it's a cold comfort. I know. There they are! Mongol swine! Stay ready, there could be more.
I never let them spend the night here. Even when they grew older. I always called them home. That's what I missed most after my mother passed. A voice calling for me. Take comfort in knowing she is at peace. They all are. You have been a great friend, Jean Sakai. Thank you, but for now, I'd like to spend some time with my sons. I understand. Be well, Osako. I thought you were in Yarikoa. I can't go back yet. Who did this? Mongol warlord, Altan. I heard stories coming out of Otsuna. He's terrorizing everyone, stealing food, medicine, slaughtering families. If anyone fights back or tries to run, they get butchered like animals. An old friend of mine runs the Ian down the road. I can't leave her with them. We'll find your friend. Put an end to this warlord. This way. Who is your friend? Her name's Ichi. I've known her since I was a child. She taught me how to survive. Have you seen her since the invasion? No. I haven't seen her in years. We should scout the inn. We'll have the best view from over here. That man might tell us what to expect inside. Better talk to him before they come back. to help. You shouldn't be here. If they see me... We're looking for Ichi. She runs this inn. Have you seen her? God, help! Sasha! Sasha! Ichi! Ichi, where are you? Ichi, you're alive. Why are you here? We came to save you. You've killed me, Yuna. I was keeping the invaders drunk and distracted. But when Altan hears about this, about what you've done... You were working with the Mongols to survive. You should have fought back. And you should have run away, like you always do. She risked her life to save you. Do yourself a favor, my lord. Keep away from that one. Ichi, we can protect you from Altan. Just tell me where to find him. No one knows where he is. Not even his men. But if you really want his attention... Tell me. Find his most valued allies. The Japanese slavers who do his bidding. Make an example of them. And Altan will find you. Who are these slavers? Ask Yuna. She'll remember. I don't know what happened between you in the past, but she only wants to help. Yuna had her chance. What did she tell you? Not enough. If we want to draw Altan out of hiding, we have to earn his attention. The ghost can manage that. Where do we start? We hurt Altan's closest allies. Japanese slavers. The Mamashi brothers. Ichi said you know them. I bet she did. Those three bastards run far up near the river. When you're ready, meet me there. We'll do this together. I will. Thank you, Chief. Looks like a fortress. The Mamashi brothers don't want anyone to see what goes on behind those walls. They're running a slave camp. You've been inside. Taka and I are the only ones who ever escaped. When were you imprisoned here? A lifetime ago, 
Tak and I were still children. Do you remember what happened? Every moment. Kichizo's beatings. The stink of Manzo's breath. And Taizo's filthy little hands. If we kill them, we'll send a message to their master. Draw Altan out of hiding. Jin, I... I can't do this. I just... I can't go back in there. You don't have to. Stay here. I will deliver your vengeance. Make them suffer, Jin. Taka. For every scar they gave us. For every head they collected from the tired workers who just asked for more water. Make them suffer for me. I can repay their cruelty and take their heads. That won't be enough. Not after Altan pushed them to this. I will kill them where they sleep, without being seen. Show Altan that no one is beyond the reach of the ghost. The Mongols won't sleep for a week. Do it. Jin, if it goes wrong in there, don't let them take you alive. Shut up! I've had it with your constant weeping, like a sick dog. You know what we do with sick dogs, don't you? Is that what you want? I heard something. You deserve worse. Now for your head. The Mongol forces. We could overtake the main roads. Dominate the trade routes. <laughs> Don't give me that look. Your head for your cruelty. Work faster! Our Mongol friends are hungry and dead. If you can't produce today's rations, I'll feed them another way. Remember your friends, Shizu? Birds pick the bones, but her guts are deep inside. the rest for the insects. Is it done? They'll never take another slave. Tell me they suffered. Not as much as they deserved. But all of Otsuna will know what became of them. All the horrible things they did. For years. And I knew, but I never did anything. We can do something now. It's time we sent Altan a message. Written in blood and covered in flies. Let's draw the Mongols out. Send our message. I want to watch. We'll hide in the tall grass.
انكسر هرار شو الكل Look at them, running like scared dogs. Altan will hear of this. It won't be enough. All the slaves in that bar came from one man, Black Wolf. Then we'll hunt him down and bury another one of Altan's friends. I'll find the Black Wolf along the coast, near his old hunting grounds. Look for me there. Altan's closest allies, Japanese slavers. The Mamashi brothers. Ichi said you know them. I bet she did. Those three bastards run a farm near the river. When you're ready, meet me there. We'll do this together. I will. Thank you, Chief. You made it. Looks like a fortress. The Mamashi brothers don't want anyone to see what goes on behind those walls. They're running a slave camp. You've been inside. Taka and I are the only ones who ever escaped. When were you imprisoned here? A lifetime ago. Taka and I were still children. Do you remember what happened? Every moment. Kichizo's beatings. The stink of Manzo's breath. ...and Taizo's filthy little hands. If we kill them, we'll send a message to their master. Draw Altan out of hiding. about escaping. Mamashi brothers were always cruel. Never like this. Our tongue brings out the best in people. Jin, I... I can't do this. I just... I can't go back in there. You don't have to. Stay here. I will deliver your vengeance. Make them suffer, Jin. For every scar they gave us. For every head they collected from the tired workers who just asked for more water. Make them suffer for me. I can repay their cruelty and take their heads. That won't be enough. Not after Altan pushed them to this. I will kill them where they sleep. Without being seen, show Altan that no one is beyond the reach of the ghost. The Mongols won't sleep for a week. Do it. Jin, if it goes wrong in there, don't let them take you alive.
with your constant weeping. Like a sick dog. You know what to do with sick dogs, don't you? Is that what you want? I heard something. You deserve worse. Now for your head. Safe here until I deal with your captors. Hun, <laughs> Forces. We could overtake the mere roads. Dominate the trail roads. <laughs> Don't give me that look. I know how to kill your head for your cruelty. One brother left.
Our Mongol friends are hungry and fed. If you can't produce today's rations, I'll feed them another way. Remember your friend Sifu? The birds pick the bones, but her guts are deep inside Mongol men. <laughs> the rest for the insects. That's the last. Now to get back to Yuna without being seen. Is it done? They'll never take another slave. Tell me they suffered. Not as much as they deserved. But all of Ortsuna will know what became of them. All the horrible things they did. For years. And I knew. But they never did anything. We can do something now. It's time we sent Ortsuna a message. Written in blood and covered in flies. Let's draw the Mongols out. Send our message. I want to watch. We'll hide in the tall grass. Look at them, running like scared dogs. Altan will hear of this. It won't be enough. All the slaves in that bar came from one man, the Black Wolf. Then we'll hunt him down and bury another one of Altan's friends. I'll find the Black Wolf along the coast, near his old hunting grounds. Look for me there. child's doll, stained in blood. The Black Wolf enslaves children? Yes. Then he sells them to the Mamushi brothers. Where is he? His camp's down this path. It's crawling with Mongol guards. Then they will die with him. I need to be the one to kill the Black Wolf. I had a chance a long time ago. But I... Couldn't. I can help you. We'll attack head on. Let him know we're coming. I want him to feel helpless. Paralyzed. He will. And by the time we're finished, Altan will feel the same. You can use that robot. Quick. Where is he? 
Mongol screams will draw him out. Slave children! No, I... You've done it for 20 years! You held me and Taka captive. Sold us to the Mamushi slave farm. Taka... He was my favorite. But the way I remember it, you brought him to me. I didn't know. You know, he's yours. <laughs> <laughs> Get off this boat. Altan will see this and know we're coming. He'll be forced to act. Jin. What the Black Wolf said was the truth. What do you mean? I met him when we came to Otsuna. He offered me food and a place to stay. I asked if I could bring my brother. He got us drunk. And then... <laughs> Taka doesn't remember. But I do. I was frozen. I could have killed him. Saved Taka. But I was too scared. It's not your fault. Because of you, he'll never hurt another child. I need some time. I'm going back to the inn. I'll see you there. Altan got her message. This was his answer. He said to meet him at a camp near the Kushi border. You'll pay for this. We will bring him to justice. You've brought nothing but death. It is our duty to exact revenge. We'll take it from Altan or die trying. That's the duty of a samurai. Yuna's just a thief. And thieves have no honor. We'll make this right. I swear. Your promises are just like you. Worthless. Let's get the horses. You know we're riding into a trap. I know. But I owe it to Ichi. Our focus has to be Altan. Whatever happened between you and her, they can't get in the way. You don't understand. Ichi was a slave at the Mamushi farm. It's where we met. She looked out for me and Taka. Shielded us from the worst. She's the reason we escaped. She chose to do that. You don't owe her anything. That's not all of it. We swore to get out of that place together. One moment, we were all running. The next, Ichi was screaming. And I kept running. I abandoned her, Jin. I owe her my life. You were right to run. I saw what kind of men those brothers were. If you tried to fight them, they would have killed you. Is running part of the samurai code? You were children. Sometimes running is the only way to survive. What's done is in the past. 
You have to let go of your guilt. It will only get in the way when we face Altan. I don't let anything get in my way. This is it. Be careful. We don't know how many men Altan brought with him. But where are the bastards hiding? It's him! Altan. With another pack of dogs. Altan. Face judgment for your crimes. You cannot judge me. You murdered your own people. The Mamushi brothers and the Black Wolf are traitors. Is that your excuse? Your reason to become the ghost and kill? No wonder the Straw Hat Ryuzo turned on you. Enough! It's time to finish this. I kill in service of the great peace. You kill in service of yourself. No more lies, Altan. I know what you are. You killed Altan. But our people know what you did to the others. Now they're afraid the ghost will come for them next. Good people have nothing to fear from me. What do you believe, Iti? Are we monsters? I think... You did what you had to. Goodbye, Yuna. Don't let what Ichi said bother you. I don't want our own people afraid of me. You can't expect everyone to understand what you're doing, or why. No. But I wonder if I've crossed the line. If we have. We are on the right side of it. Genji, what are you doing? You have stumbled on a perfect opportunity, my lord. Down this road lies an enemy camp stuffed with supplies to feed, clothe, and heal dozens, hundreds, and the Mongols left! <laughs> it's a ripe plum just begging for it! What are you not telling me? This is a simple situation. No Mongols, lots of stuff. Help ourselves, help the people. <laughs> On the slim chance some good comes of this. Lead the way. I knew you'd understand, Lord Sakai. How did you find this camp? I've been following these guys for a while. They're so arrogant, they leave their camp unguarded when they go on raids. Then who are you waiting for on the road? Who? Who me? Uh, 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 nobody. Oh, I was on my way to the camp when you happened by. There are survivors taking refuge near the Yarikawa stronghold. They need supplies. That's exactly the people I'm trying to help! Uh... Anything valuable there? Precious metals, rare woods, a nice rug? How about food? The kind of people trying to survive a war could eat. Oh sure, that too! A sake barrel. Know anything about this, Kenji? You think 
I'm the only one on this island who sells sake to the Mongols? Yes. My lord, I'm hurt. Kenji, there's food and medicine over here. Clothing, leather, silk. This can help a lot of people. I told you this was a good idea. Plenty of food here. Fish, vegetables, rice, and millet. Japanese, not Mongolian. They're learning to like our cuisine. I already checked the yurt. Nothing in there. Just a bunch of junk. I better check the yurt. Kenji! I'll kill you! Who are you? The man who's going to end Kenji's life. You left me here to die. No, not true! I brought help! Meet Lord Sakai, also known as the Ghost. One of you explain what's happening, now. Kenji set me up is what's happening. It wasn't a setup. The Mongols were supposed to pay for this stuff, only they didn't. And then they took my friend Nato here hostage. They were supposed to pay for this? Hear that? They're back! Please, cut me loose! Where did you get these supplies? We stole them from Straw Hats. <sighs> Lord Sakai, can you distract the Mongols? So you can escape? Not exactly. I have an idea. Trust me. No more ideas, Kenji. Just take your friend and go. Kenji! Kenji's friend! You can come out now. It's safe. Over here! We are locked in! Lord Takai! Get us out of here! Thank you, Lord Sakai. Yes, thank you! You know what happens now. <laughs> I'm going to ride that sake barrel all the way to... Kenji, I think he's angry. Lord Sakai, our intention was always to gift our gains to the survivors who need it most. The camp outside the town of Yarigawa. Mm. Gather everything you can. And when I visit that camp, I'm going to find it overflowing with food and medicine. Correct? Yes, my lord. Yes, my lord. What are you doing here? Lord Sakai! My prayers have been answered. That remains to be seen. What's wrong, Kenji? Uh, I owe money to a bandit, um, Gon the Butcher. Then you should pay him. I will. I will, but uh, he wants to meet me in the middle of nowhere so he can cut my throat. What did you do to deserve that? He paid for a delivery of sake and medicine, and I might have skimmed some to help survivors fleeing Izuhara and... didn't think he'd notice. <laughs> there are better ways to help people, Kenji. My lord, I'm an idiot. And you want me to clean up your mess? Couldn't you just watch from the shadows in case Gon tries anything? If you scare him off, he'll just put a price on my head. Your intentions this time were better than usual. I will help. Thank you, my lord. <laughs> Where's the money to pay your bandit friend? I brought it, don't worry. Um, go and set the meeting at the bridge. It's, it's not far. Lead the way. Every time I get in a mess like this, I'm as scared as the time before. You want to help your nerves? Stop stealing from killers. But the first time Gon caught me, he wasn't even angry. How many times have you cheated him? Three. 
Why did you get mixed up with this butcher? I owed Red Hand Taro for misplaced Wagyu's ashes. Eh? And Gon needed sake for a festival. So, I charged him premium prices for Cheap's will to cover Red Hand's losses. <laughs> Butcher must have loved that. Oh, he didn't notice that time. But when I did it again, that's when he got angry. And what became of Red Hand? I told Gon I got the bad sake from him. But I didn't think Gon would kill him. You're a busy man. I know, my lord. Trouble follows me everywhere. You follow trouble, Kenji. You should ask yourself why. Go to the bridge. I'll find a spot with a clear view of Gong. All right. And if anything goes wrong, I'll signal you. I'll shout, I'm so happy to see you. As you wish. Before the ghost attack, there was a vendor in town giving sake to the Mongols. <laughs> Ghost, and you need to get in and out fast. So you think the ghost goes around disguised as a sake vendor? No. What is he? Something Where is he? Your friend, the ghost. I assume you brought him with you. You think? <laughs> That's you. Keep laughing and I'll take your tongue. I'm so happy to see you. What? I'm so happy to see you. He knows. I'm so happy to see you. Lord Sakai. You owe me more than that. Whatever you want. A sake, a saddle polish, a nice... Kenji, why risk your life over trifles? Not trifles. I need food, money, a warm fire. You helped me save Taka. Delivered medicine to people in need. Yeah. <laughs> that was heroic, wasn't it? You have a talent, Kenji. It's time you use it, for the sake of our island. Of course. Honor is my specialty. Welcome. May I offer you tea? You want to share a drink with me? Mm. Not really. I'm just being polite, but I do want your help. A map was stolen from me. I need it back. Kenji speaks very highly of your skill. I won't commit skill. crimes for you, Lady Sanjo, even if Kenji is a friend of yours. So we're clear. The map marks the locations where food is stored. This is how I feed Toyotama's people. So you need me to find the thief? Oh, I know where he is. Hiding in a gambler's den by the Three Paths Well. I just need you to retrieve the map. I'll see what I can do. But if you're lying to me... Lord Sakai. I am nothing if not honest. Just ask the last man who questioned my sincerity. You'll find his head covered in flies out back. Be careful. Many people know the thief who took the map, and the lengths I'll go to get it back. Hello? The map is mine. Go away. I am Jin Sakai. Open up. And I'm Amateru. God of the sun. No. There has to be another way in. You must be Amaterasu. Where's the map? Forgive me, my lord. I don't have it. Ronin put me up to this. Wanted me to lure you inside. A trap. They know Lady Sanjo sent you. They want to trade the map for money. Stay here. Yes, my lord. 
I don't bargain with thieves. Maybe. But you'll run errands for them. Give me the map now, or I'll take it from you. <laughs> and I heard you had no sense of humor. You're outnumbered. You want the map? Pay us. I won't ask again. Kill him! The map must be on one of these three. Here it is. I have your map. I hope it wasn't too much trouble. Not to feed the people of Totama. Which is what you'll do. Isn't that right, Lady Sanjo? I told you. This is my home, and these are my people. They are starving. I can feed them, and so I will. Then I'll leave you to it. Thank you, Lord Sakai. Hochi and his followers came down from Cedar Temple to train healers in the village. Mongols kidnapped them. They took nothing else? Hochi went peacefully, so they spared the village. Slaughter those who resist, reward submission. Cotton's favorite tactic. He should not have gone along with them. He gave himself up for the village. The Mongols will be back. All he did was delay the end. Then it's a good thing you and I are here. Any idea where they went? They rode out past the tea fields. Let's pick up their trail. We can't let them harm the monks. The Mongols will keep them alive for their medical skills. I'm sure of nothing when it comes to the invaders. They came this way, past the tea fields. Look for tracks. There they are. Stay here, Noryu. I don't want the monks to get caught in the middle. You're going to be all right. Please, no. Are you the samurai who rose from the dead? Is Hochi with you? Hochi? No. But one of us broke loose. The invaders chased after him. They'll be back any moment. Road Sakai! Mongols up the road! Norio? You're alive! Is anyone hurt? We're all right, my lord. Where is Hochi? A different group took him. Norio. They knew Hochi's name. And they mentioned Sira Temple. Lord Sakai. Why would they separate Hochi from the rest? He's the most skilled healer. They might have plans for him. He also likes to argue. You think he angered them? Knowing Hochi? Yes. Don't jump to conclusions. First, we need to track him down. 
Give me time to figure out where the Mongols took him. I'll meet you at Akashima village. We'll find him, Norio. We've all been worried about Hochi. They need a break. Such moments are rare these days. I used to be like them. I'm not the same man I was the night before Komoda. How bad was it? Komoda? Bad. We lost everyone. The beach was soaked with so much blood, it was like... paste. Be grateful you didn't see it. We rode south all day, into the night. A bad storm slowed us to a crawl. Stopped at a farm to sleep a few hours. I woke to screams. The main house on fire. Mongol raiders. They took us to Kaneda in chains. After that, I wish I had died fighting. I think I know where they took Hochi. You want to go now? Yes. Where are we headed? A camp on the coast. Mongol ships stopped there for supplies and prisoners on the way north. If they put him out to sea, we'll lose him. Road Sakai, when this is all over, what will you do? I hope one day I can return home, find a way to rebuild. I wish I still felt that way about my temple. Most of my life, my course was clear. Follow the Eightfold Path. There is a family. Serve Sita Temple. We can still do those things. I joined the temple because of my brother. And I always imagined my children and Enjo's children growing up together. Our wives would be friends. The Mongols haven't taken everything, Norio. One day they'll be gone. And you'll still have a life to lead. But I don't feel it's mine alone. I have to live for Enjo and the other monks who die. Do you ever feel that way about the samurai of Komoda? Like you owe them a debt? Sometimes. Like my life has to count for a hundred samurai. But that doesn't feel possible. Maybe that's the point. Life before the invasion feels like it happened to someone else. Or like childhood. Maybe twenty years from now, you'll look back on this moment the same way. Lord Sakai! I told you Hochi strongly opposes violence, right? You said he disagreed with the warrior monks. He hates all weapons, including yours and mine. He can lecture me all he likes once he's safe in Akashima village. <laughs> I need to get a good look at the whole camp. What about that granary? Good, quickly. We have to find Hochi. The Mongols are holding someone there. Hochi. Has to be. If I go alone, I can reach him without the Mongols knowing. A Mongol signal cannon. I could set it off. Draw their attention. While I get Hochi out. After I find Hochi, we'll meet there. Don't wait for me if I'm late. Get Hochi back to the village. I can handle myself. I'll meet you both back in Akashima village. Set off the signal cannon. I'll get Hochi. Take refuge in Amida Buddha, my lord. What's happening? Who are you? A friend. We need to go. I can't leave. The Mongols are returning me to see the temple. The people there need healers. Badly. There's no time for this. I'm sorry, but I must remain here. Jin! Hochi! Norio? What are you doing here? The alarm drew a raiding party nearby. They're almost on us. Uh, damn it. Stay back, Hochi. We won't let them near you. Norio, radio blade. Lesson in 
Everyone is gone. It's just me now. I'm sorry. I wish we could end this bloodshed. The Mongols were searching for me. I gave myself up to save lives. How did they know where to find you? They knew I was an Akashima. And they wanted to return me to see the temple. They need a healer. You're willing to treat the enemy's wounded? Mongol or Japanese, we all suffer. Some deserve it. But this means... Has Cedar Temple fallen? I don't know. Norio, take Kochi back to the village before reinforcements arrive. They will seek revenge. I'll meet you there to plan a defense. What's the problem? Mongols are gathering nearby, preparing to strike. We should evacuate to Castle Canada. Evacuate and the Mongols will hunt you down. Not one of you will live to see Canada's walls. But we won't have blood on our hands. Go tell the village your plan for them, Hochi. I'd like to see that. <sighs> Norio, I wish you cared about the Eightfold Path more than others' opinions. First you follow Enjo around, now Lord Sakai. Do you ever think for yourself? Wash my brother's name from your mouth. Enough! Norio and I will do the fighting. Everyone else can go hide. I refuse to hide. I don't take lives. But I am not a coward. Take them to the temple. I won't let you fight alone. If the Mongols go to the temple, who will protect these people? I'll do as you ask. Keep your Naginata ready. I'll owe you a jar of sake for putting up with Hochi. Norio! What happened, Norio? I was fighting. A Mongol snuck up behind me. Hochi threw himself at a blow meant for me. You're both braver than many samurai I've known. Get away! I didn't know he was behind me until I heard him cry out. By the time I turned around, he was dead. It's not your fault. Norio? Every time they lifted the cover on the pit, the daylight would blind us. This time, one of them stank like sake. I felt their hands pull me up, but my brother threw himself at them. He was starving, wounded, but he fought them. He fought them so hard. Norio. You don't have to. Yes, I do. <laughs> they gave up on me and took Enjo. They took my brother. Everyone who rode south from Cedar Temple. All gone. Except me. They deserve to live. I'm the one who should be dead. I thought the same thing after Komoda. Many times. I don't know why we survived, Norio. But we did. And these people are counting on us. We're all they have. 
people of Akashima are alive because of you. Don't forget that. Because they won't. Norio! Lord Sakai! My lord, look what they've done! Kushidera Temple deserves reverence, not bloodshed. Centuries of wisdom lie within those walls, and the Mongols were ready to torch it all to the ground. They attacked for a reason. The temple gives people hope! The abbot's been telling people to pray for a great storm to wash the invaders from our home. Now the abbot's missing. And the brutes stole the most sacred relic in Toyotama, a statue of Buddha, carved at the temple's founding. My brother would have recovered them. He would have given these monks hope before they ran for the hills. Then we honor his memory and restore the temple. The Mongols stole the statue of Buddha from the main hall. And the abbot? He and his closest followers fled. I'm hoping they found shelter. The abbot is from Cedar Temple. Why did he come here? To help resist the Mongols in Toyotama. But when they attacked, he escaped. The battle was chaotic. Might be difficult to track them. There's a farm nearby that supports the temple. We'll start there. I was there. The Mongols had taken it over. And I put an end to that. Then the abbot must have found shelter. This reminds me of another time Abbot Kome went missing. The temple was divided by a feud between our senior monks. What were they fighting about? I don't remember, but it seemed important at the time. The abbot disappeared for a week. We dropped everything to look for him. What happened to him? He hid from us on purpose, and we stopped fighting in order to find him. Didn't that just make things worse? He got us to see that our fight was less important than we realized. He could have just told you that. The abbot likes to say that when people don't listen, he talks with actions. The abbot is the only one holding Kushidera Temple together. If something happens to him, the monks will abandon Kushi. I'm sure we'll find Abbot Kome there. Fire! Coming from the farm. He's dead. Burned alive. Norio. Is it the abbot? The bastards love their fire, don't they? He's not the abbot. Just one of his followers. Keep searching. Water barrels. Tipped over. Straw bedding. Hmm. Damn. Could the abbot have saved himself? He protected himself with wet bedding. Escaped out the back. Maybe he survived. Whoever survived the fire went this way. Then there's still hope. Footprints are heavier, farther apart. He was running. They 
were searching near the waterfall's edge. No blood. He jumped down. Blood on the rocks. Is that a cave? No. Is he? I'm sorry, Ariel. Without his leadership, the monks will leave. And the temple will fall. The Mongols won. What's that next to him? A Lotus Sutra. Written in the abbot's blood. His final act. Like a samurai's death poem. The point of this sutra is that we can all be Buddhas. From the lowest peasant to the greatest noble. Written with his dying breath. Not for himself, but for those he left behind. Show the sutra to the monks. If they see the abbot's devotion, they might stay. And this is the sutra the abbot wrote in his own blood. A final act of devotion. A call to stand up to cruelty. A call to stay and not surrender. We will honor the abbot's sacrifice, Norio. We must not let Kushi Temple fall. Enjo the Guardian saved us once. Now his brother and Lord Sakai have saved us again. And together we can defeat the Mongols. The statue is here. Yes, my lord. The Mongols stole our sacred Buddha and rode off toward the coast. We'll return the statue and save this temple. Not even your brother could keep that promise, Norio. What was that about? My brother fell to a Mongol blade. Enjo the Guardian dies, and these monks are willing to give up everything. They're cowards. They're people. Enjo feared nothing. He wasn't even 20 when he saved this temple from bandits. Now it's up to us. You're angry. How can you tell? You're not talking. Ha! It's that monk. He doesn't know the whole story about my brother saving Kushidera. I heard Enjo acted alone. That's the legend. In reality, he ordered three of his bravest monks to challenge the bandits. A distraction. A sacrifice. They died in battle, but only after giving Enjo enough time to flank the bandits and save the temple. What happened? I was following the Mongols. I begged them to give back our Buddha. Where did they go? Out of the forest. To the hills. May your next life be more peaceful than this one. He gave his life for his temple. Like my brother. You will do the same. Carved from a star that fell from the heavens centuries ago. Beautiful. There's nothing else like it on the island. Let's get it back to the temple. The Buddha will not smile fondly on you. Enjo became the guardian when bandits attacked the temple. They came for this statue. It's priceless. Probably survived many such attempts. How many more people have to die protecting it? You want to let it be stolen? <laughs> no. But the temple is filled with treasures. It provokes greed and envy. Lord Shimura brought me to see it when I was a boy. I was sure the sculptor must have met the Buddha in person. When I was a boy, my family traveled here to make an offering for the new year. That's when Enjo and I decided to become monks. I, 
I used to know what I fought for. We fight for a home. Maybe so. Norio, have you spoken with the monks? Their resolve is growing, but they still fear the Mongols. As they should. Where is everyone? At the river, bathing, washing clothes. Who's that coming to the temple? Look, a Mongol who wants to die. He's alone. See what he wants first. The ghost and the brother of the guardian. I have a message for you. Speak. The ghost and the monks have defied the Khan's will. Surrender, and we spare this place. Refuse, and all will burn. We will never surrender. Then you will die. by the river. They don't have time to reach shelter. Then we'll be their shelter. Oh, I can't. The Buddha, the Abbot Sutra. Are they worth more than the monks' lives? I can't save them alone. Centuries of learning reside in this temple. I can't let it burn. But you'll let the monks burn. I will die for this temple. Do what you have to. And stay here. I'll find the monks at the river and bring them back. Mongols coming! Get away from the river! Temples undefended. Temples can be rebuilt. Lives can't. We'll defend the monks at the pagoda. Lead the way! All of you, come with us! Mongols lost badly here. They won't be eager to return. The monks will never forget what you did for them. I didn't fight alone, Norio. No, but if I had not listened to you, many more would be dead. What will you do now? It's time I return to see the temple. We still need your Naginata to drive the invaders from our home. You'll have it. And my temple will be a strong ally to you in the north. I'll join you there. My brother earned the name Guardian when he saved this temple. I wish we could have saved the statue. The statue's final lesson. Save what we can, but know that everything passes away. It's a worse statue when it's broken, but a better teacher. <laughs> Where is it? How dare you! Oh, young master. I feared you were dead. <laughs> I came as soon as I could. It's 
Good to see you, Yuriko. You look tired. Are you hungry? Not now. Thank you. The Khan's army must have marched past here. Have you had any trouble? A few bandits. Nothing I can't take care of. I've come for my father's... my armor. You refused to wear it at Komoda Beach. A lot has changed since then. I hid it somewhere safe. I'll get Taichi to help me fetch it. He's at the cemetery. What's he doing there? Tending the grounds. Gathering plants for my poisons. Keeps vermin out of our food stores. I'm glad you're not alone. What about Lord Shimura? Alive. The Mongols captured him at Komoda. But we freed him. Oh. Others survived. And they're helping you? A few. Lady Musako. Good. She's been fighting alongside the boys since she was knee-high. <laughs> You'll have to tell me more about that someday. But it's just the two of you? A few others. Sensei Ishikawa. I haven't seen him in years. Does he still act like he's the only one who knows how to do things? Half the time he's right. But his aim is unmatched. He would certainly agree. Lord Sakai, you're back! I wish I could stay, but I hear you're taking good care of Yuriko. You've got that backwards, my lord. Taichi, help me get the Sakai armor. Go. I should pay my respects. to meditate here. This old tree lives on. Master? Are you all right? Yes, just lightheaded. For a moment, I thought you looked. Face us, coward! Get inside.
Yuriko! Are you alright? You butchered them! Is Yarikawa giving us trouble again? The Yarikawa Rebellion was 20 years ago. Those men were with the Mongols. Of course. Seeing you like that, I'm still shaken up. I need to catch my breath. By the lake. Your favorite tree. Yes. Come. You said earlier you've been making poisons. Keeps the vermin out of our rice. Can you make it stronger? Enough to kill a man? No one deserves that. Can you do it? The effects in larger doses are ugly. Good. Oh, my lord. Sit with me a moment. Poison has never been the Sakai way. No Sakai had to fight the Mongol Empire. I need every weapon we have. Tsushima can't afford anything less. The Mongols have changed you, young master. The world has changed. My mother taught me about plants that heal, others that harm, even kill. But they must be consumed. How will you poison the invaders? A blowgun and darts. I've read of their use by a Genji warrior who studied with monks from the west. Will you help me? Promise me you'll remain the good man I know. I promise. I've looked after your every need since your mother carried you. I won't stop now. All I need is something to make a blowgun. Mm, used to be a lot of reeds on the other side of the lake, where the old fishermen lived. Remember? You and your little friend gathered them to make little boats. Yuzo and I. We spent all day reenacting the Battle of Dunnoda. Be careful, Jin. I've seen fires over there at night. Not sure who it is. Don't worry. I'll be back soon with reeds. Excuse me, young master. You caught me thinking about Lord Sakai. I try not to do that. He loved you in his way. Enough of the past. We have a blowgun and darts. All I need now is the poison. Of course, young master. Come with me. I have a small camp where I gather plants and herbs for ointments. And poison. It kills vermin within moments. Make it strong enough for the invaders. Nice to ride with you again. You and Lord Shimura taught me to ride. <laughs> On that runt pony. <laughs> you sat so tall and straight in your little saddle. Like you were the Shogun himself. Oh, no, little Jin. 
What's so funny? I just remembered it was out here you nearly killed your uncle. What? You were three or four? The poor man was trying to teach you how to hold your wooden kodachi. You wanted to chase butterflies. I know the story. My uncle's black eye took weeks to heal. <laughs> Lord Shimura and your father laughed so hard, I fear they'd both choked to death. I don't remember my father's laugh. He lost his humor after your mother got sick. But you have your father's laugh. Here we are. I'll go on that and a campfire. You sleep out here? <laughs> Only when I spend the day foraging for plants. <laughs> I'll look for the flowers we need. Rest, Yuriko. I will get them for you. Your plants. Good. We extract the seeds, crush them, make a paste, and dip the needles. Make sure the dose is strong. It should do what you need. It's done. You're sure he came this way? The old woman has a camp around here somewhere. Listen. Someone's coming. Stay there, Yuriko. Let's see if this poison works. He will regret what he did to Sadamune and the others. I just want his head. And the price that goes with it. How much farther? It's around here somewhere. <laughs> Are you hurt, young master? Don't worry. I dealt with them. <sighs> sometimes I forget you're a grown man. I forget sometimes, too. We should get back to the estate. I'll stay. I need to straighten the place up. Don't push yourself too hard. Hush! You are not a child, and I'm old enough to take care of myself. What other kinds of poison can you make? Always so impatient. There is another. It causes confusion and rage. But the ingredients... What were they? Try to remember. It sounds useful. Young master, would you like something to eat? I'm fine, Yuriko. I just need the poison. You are trying to remember the ingredients. They were flowers. You remember them, don't you? The ones I planted at your family cemetery. I remember washing the graves. Father made me hold buckets of water from the lake. He knew it would make you strong and teach you to respect your ancestors. Don't you remember the flowers, Jin? Spider lilies. That's right. With enough spider lilies, you can craft a poison that makes rats go mad. Tear each other to pieces. It's awful. It's for a good cause. Just make it strong enough to work on men. If you think it's necessary, I know exactly where to find what we need. This way. This part of the forest. I was here when I was a child. After your mother passed away. I refused to believe she was gone. So I ran from home and came here. Your mother loved to take long walks here. I searched until sundown. I kept shouting for her. But she was gone. And I was lost. You were missing for three days. Nearly dead by the time your father found you. I've never seen him so angry. Angry at himself for failing to protect you. I've seen your father before countless battles, and he was never more worried than the sleepless nights he spent searching for his only son. Not much farther to the cemetery. I wonder what your father would make of the ghost. He would disapprove. 
Like my uncle. Don't be so sure. They argued often. Kazumasa thought your uncle too rigid. Willfully blind to possibilities. Kazumasa had imagination. Imagination? My father? You're like him in more ways than you know. Careful. Disrespecting the dead. Stay here. Who will face me first? El Dei Ashiglach, Samurai! Yes, it's safe to look for the spider lilies. Why would we look for them here? Isn't this where you used to plant them? Oh, uh, no, not here. It's been so long. They're in another cemetery. Your great aunt's branch of the family. It's not far. Yuriko, do you remember? I was five or six. I had a nightmare about this forest. A fight. It wasn't a nightmare. I told you it was to keep you calm. That was real? I remember men shouting. Our retinue was returning home late one night. We were ambushed by Ronin. The Ronin must have been dangerous. My father's samurai were frightened. Not of the Ronin. Of Kazumasa. Of my father? Why? He and his samurai drove the Ronin off. But Kazumasa pursued them on foot. You could hear their screams. He returned to us just before dawn. Covered in blood. Some of his own men mistook him for a demon of the forest. Do you recognize this lake? We used to meditate here. <laughs> How you'd fidget. You told me to pretend I was a rock, and all I wanted was to swim. <sighs> the view's much better from the shore. Join me, young master. These old bones need a rest. Some of my favorite memories happened at this lake. Stopping a child's visiting? Your mother and I would come here when she was pregnant with you. We should keep moving. <laughs> a grown man, and you still can barely sit still. We can meditate again, after the war. Yes, young master. Cemetery isn't far. Feels much closer when you're not carrying water. They may break stone, but they cannot erase the memory of these warriors. Please gather the spider lilies. I can't bear to look. This is all I could find. It is enough to make the poison, but I don't want our time to end. The Shimura Cemetery isn't far. With a view of the waterfall. Let's go, my lord. <sighs> Kazumasu. I do enjoy our rides together. Did you say Kazumasa? <laughs> Did I? You ride with your father's grace. Did you often go riding with my father? Lord Sakai taught me to ride a horse. Hey Careful, Mongols ahead. Wait, I can mix the new poison. How 
does it work? Oh, it's terrible. Causes madness. They'll turn on each other like wild beasts. Good. Make it. Quickly. The poison is finished. Take it. I'll stay here. Just for now. After the Mongols are gone, I won't need it. I thought we rid ourselves of those bandits. Not bandits. Mongols. Oh. I couldn't see them from here. After all this, I'm worried about the Shimura Cemetery, my lord. Would you check on it with me? Of course, Yuriko. Let's have a look. Are you tired, Yuriko? No, Lord Saka. This is the best day I've had since our afternoon at Lake Onu. I don't remember that. You are sure that was me? It, it was so long ago. You must have forgotten. hasn't touched this place. Do you remember, young master? We pay our respects to the Shimura warriors buried here, then spend the afternoon writing poems. I remember, Yuriko. Let's write one now. Well said, my lord. The proud do not endure. The greatest of us fall in the end. We should return to Omi. I'll stay a while. I know better than to argue. Good. You learned something today. Kazumasa used to say Lord Shimura was too concerned with that castle. The strongest point on the island. He equated strength with the, the huge, the immovable, like a mountain. He had a point. Doubt and indecision have destroyed armies. In the midst of battle, true leaders must stay rooted, stand firm. But look at that waterfall. All that immovable rock yields to water. The strength we need is all around us. I have one more place I would like to visit them. when you're ready. <coughs> Excuse me. The cold wind is getting to me. Yuriko, you're not well. Oh, nonsense. Let me take you to Akashima. They can treat you. We have to visit someplace special. Where? It's not far. After that, I promise we will see your healers. Fine. But if you start feeling worse, we go straight to Akashima. Of course, my lord. Always so stern. <laughs> oh, isn't it beautiful? 
Very. Why are we here? Are you upset? I hope it's not wrong of us to come. I don't understand. Oh. It's so painful to see you weighed down by sadness with Lady Sakai and the little one. Oh. Yuriko, are you all right? It's nothing. I just felt a little faint. When did you last eat? Yesterday, I think. Wait here. I'll find us something. I'm not a child. Please, Yuriko. Rest here a moment. As you wish. Since you ask so sweetly. I'll be back soon. Maybe. Yuriko! My lord. Yuriko, are you hurt? No. I was just... I got lost. Where were you going? I saw my mother. She waved but kept walking. I had to catch up. I'm bringing you home. No. My mother... I have to make an offering. You do not. Please. For all the times I've done as you asked. Come with me. Let me pay respects to my mother. All right. But don't push yourself. Thank you. My mother would take me on long walks in these caves and teach me about the plants. Maybe that's why you saw her. After all that time in the forest, we had already lost Lady Sakai. Kazumasa, are you listening? I'm listening. I made him drink that remedy my mother taught. We sat by his side the whole night. You held my hand. Do you remember? Yes, I remember. That night, I was so scared. So sad for little Chin. But I was so happy. Does that make me a bad person? No. When he recovered, when you taught me how to ride, the day we rode to the onset, oh, the sunset was red and full. That was what? The best day of my life. It's dark, Kasumasa. Tell me what you see. I can see all the way to Yariko. I remember the war. A tragedy for all the clans. Castle Canada. I wish you weren't there so often. Why do you say that? You have many responsibilities. I am grateful for the time we share. But I always want more. There's the temple in Kushi. 
You can see the pagoda. Every new year, I pray there for you and little Jin and my family. Jin is lucky you take such good care of him. Now tell me what you see. Yuriko? Rest, Yuriko. The strength we need is all around us. The mighty fall at last to be no more than dust before the wind. Why are these people outside the town walls? The Mongols have surrounded Yarikawa. No one can get in. Recruiting Lord Shimura's old rivals was never going to be easy. But now... Now they need allies too. Think about it. We help them drive off the Mongols. And they help us. I need their word before I fight for them. And we can't even get into their city. Yes, we can. There's a hidden entrance. From when we were children. Even if it's still there, we can't reach it. It's worth a try. I know a place we can scout for a way around the Mongol siege. Yarikawa doesn't stand a chance. You know, where's the hidden entrance? See that river near the town walls. Get us that far, and I'll do the rest. We can't sneak past an army. And even if we find an entrance, what if the Mongols see us? We'll sentence the town to death. Taka, I stake my life on your metalwork. Now it's your turn to trust me. Yes, my lord. I don't see how we can make it to the river. We'll find a way. Could take the fight to the Mongols. Draw them off. Please, no. Taka's right. Too risky. The walls won't keep this many Mongols out. Azamo Bay fell. Yarikawa will too. I know these people. They'll choose death before slavery. The hidden entrance used to be over there, behind that white tree. Let's hope the Mongols haven't found it. We just have to find a way through the camp. Once we reach the water, it should be easy to find the entrance without being spotted. That's our plan? Sneak through the biggest Mongol camp I've ever seen? Then hope the secret entrance we used as children is still there? Stay close, Tucker. Count on it. Let's go. It's still here. I'm being put to good use. Probably why they've held out this long. When we get up there, let me do the talking. It's your hometown. Who are you? How did you get in? My brother and I were born here. Did the Mongols see you? No, but we're here to help you break their siege. First, tell me the name of the dead samurai you stole your gear from. He's not a thief. He's the ghost. The ghost? I'll take you to Ujimasa. But mind your step. We're all armed here. Run and tell the steward! Right away! Ujimasa. That was the name of Lord Yarikawa's youngest son. But my uncle disbanded their clan when he defeated them. The family still runs things here. Unofficial. Your uncle put down a rebellion and created a generation of people who hate Clan Shimura. The Mongols are crossing the bridge! You three, follow and stay close. What's going on? A disturbance at the main gate. That can't be good. It's their leader! Are they going to attack? Let's find out what they want. Anmar Mind, people of Yarikawa, I am Temuke, leader of this war band. I learned your speech, so I may offer you a future. Open your gates before my camp flies the black flag, and you will know great mercy. Refuse, and you will know 
terrible misery. Choose your future, Yarikawa. They're leaving. Let's go. If Yarikawa surrenders, Lord Shimura won't get his army. Don't worry. They're too stubborn to surrender. If they don't, it will be a bloodbath. They need my uncle as much as he needs them. United, we can beat back the invaders. People here have bad memories of Lord Shimura. If they're going to survive, Yarikawa needs to let go of the past. Easier said than done. Ujimasa knows you're here. You two go ahead. I want to check on the swordsmith. Lord Sakai. Ujimasa Yarikawa. I never thought Lord Shimura's nephew would be responsible for the ghost. You best be careful, or he'll punish you. As he punished my once great family. For inciting rebellion against your Jito. That was years ago. We've all got bigger problems now. Who's this? Your servant? I was born here. Yet you're aiding Clan Shimura. No, I'm fighting for Lord Sakai. For the ghost. We can help break the siege outside your walls. In return, Lord Shimura requests your help. <laughs> the Mongols want to conquer the mainland. They will lose interest in us. And Yarikawa will survive. Like we always do. That could have gone better. Let's find Taka. Ujimasa is a fool. He can be convinced. The whole island's burning, and Yarikawa is next. If that doesn't convince him, nothing will. Taka used to visit this swordsmith every day. If there was any leftover metal, he'd let my brother pretend to make swords. The swordsmith remembered you? Shinsuke passed away. That's his son. How did it go? Ujimasa thinks they can outlast the siege. The smith told me all the best archers left to fight the Mongols, against Ujimasa's orders. They've been missing for days. If we find these archers, they may help us break the Mongol siege and win the town's support. Meet me in old Yarikawa when you can. We'll look for them there. And show Yarikawa how to fight back. I told him not to come. I wanted to help Lord Sakai. If I stayed in Yarikawa, I'd be useless. Better useless than dead. We're searching for missing soldiers. You're not trained for this. I can learn. And I won't get in the way. Fine. But be careful. And listen to your sister. Yes, my lord. Any sign of the archers? Locals have seen them in this area. But we haven't. Let's look around. There they are. Heading up the hill toward that ridge. They're staying low for a reason. Keep your heads down and don't call out. Samurai! Alive! Get over here! You must be the archers from Yarikawa. What's left of them? The Mongols caught us raiding a camp for supplies. We barely got away. What about the others? Captured. We tracked them here. We can help you free them. Hmm. You look like you can handle yourselves. I'm Daikoku. Jin Sakai. Sakai, eh? As long as you're not the Shimura. Bad idea to rush in. We know where they're headed. We can set an ambush along the route. The terrain isn't good for an ambush. What about old Yarikawa? Rooftops on both sides of the road. We can even use your stolen explosives. You found that, huh? I like the way you think. Good. Let's move before the Mongols do. The Mongols are headed this way. Taka, get inside one of the houses. No. I'm staying out here. I can fight too. Jin, tell him. Taka can decide for himself. Then you can watch out for him. Are you 
you scared? No. Not really. A little. Yuna's never afraid. You're probably like that too. Fear drives you to be stronger, fight harder. My father taught me that. I never knew my father. When I get scared, I can't think. I freeze. That's because you lack training. Yuna's been in danger many times. She's had more practice than you. Without her, I'd be dead. So would I. There they are. I'll shoot the barrels when the Mongols get close. Lord Sakai, I'm not ready. You can do this, Taka. Just take your fear and use it. Yes, my lord. Now, my lord? Not yet. They're close enough now, right? Good work, Daikoku. Take your men back to Yarikawa stronghold. Right away. I know you're a Sakai, but you didn't mention you're the ghost. Will we have your help breaking the siege? If Ujimasa accepts it. I'll make sure he does. The stories are true. I've never seen anyone fight like you. Taka, go with Daikoku. I need a moment with Jin. I'll see you back home. We did it! Taka could have been killed, Jin. I saw him fall. He's fine. He did everything perfectly. I shouldn't have let him fight. You know... I know you want to protect him, but you're holding him back. Taka's not a fighter. He could become one. You don't know my brother like I do. You can't always be the one to defend him. I'll decide what's best for Taka. You look after your own family. I need to go back. We still need to end this siege. I'll see you there. Taka. Yarikawa has a fighting chance because of our efforts. You should be proud. I am, my lord. But the Mongols are growing restless outside. We showed them Yarikawa won't surrender. Now they won't pay back. Will they attack tonight? Unlikely. They'll give us a sleepless night, then attack tomorrow, when we're exhausted. Get some rest while you can. Preparation for the town's defenses are going well. Daikoku tells me this is the ghost's doing. Thank you. But it won't change what I think of your uncle. That's not my goal. The samurai were wiped out. We need you. You need bodies to throw at the Mongols. Yarikawa's people are known for courage and skill. We need that more than anything. I'll consider it. You're awake too. the samurai. What chance do a bunch of farmers have? We have to try. I think you need this more than me. Kenji spent the rest of the day wearing one sandal. <laughs> <laughs> this is terrible. My mother loved it. Used to drink it like water. She gets so mad when she ran out. Yelled at us. 
Where's my tea? <laughs> Sounds like a demanding woman. She broke Taka's arm when he was six. I took him away. Ran as far from her as we could get. We heard they found her a month later. Face down in the street. You were brave to protect your brother. Sometimes our only choice is to walk away from everything we know. Yuna! Jin, this is it. To the gates. Whatever happens, we don't retreat. Jin! Yuna! The Mongols! Let's go. How close? They're at the main gates. If they get through, we'll stop them. There he is! The ghost! The ghost! Save us! Taka! Gather everyone who can't fight and get them to the keep. Everyone! Take shelter in the keep! Quickly! They're attacking! They'll breach the gate! Stand your ground! Every Mongol who sets foot inside our walls will die! Don't let them pass to you! Archer! Cut them down! Oh, here he For the gold! Falling back. We barely damaged them. What are they up to? Trying to lure us out? No. Hold them off as long as you can, then fall back to the keep. I'll deal with the siege weapons. I should come with you. No. Taka needs you. I am Jin Sakai, and I have killed men like you all across our island. Your blood will soak the island! Careful, Tamuge. You can't get Kotun's reward if you're dead. A lucky blow! You will not get another! Leave 
Fukushima now, and I might show you mercy. Yarikawa will burn! You have killed men in many countries to move on, but here, you die. Saved your town. Now we help Lord Shimura save our island. We are not soldiers. Who killed these Mongols? Who stood against the siege? Who saved? Yarikawa! We did! You can't just stay here and wait for the Mongols to try again! You say you are not soldiers. You are warriors. We could defeat the invaders and save our home. But only if we stand together. Join our fight, but I have other duties before we can retake Lord Shimura's castle. You must be Goro. Uh, we must all be someone. Who must you be? Lord Sakai. Ah, the samurai are all dead. I'm very much alive, but my patience is dying. Lord Shimura asks that you repay your debt to him. He's alive? What does he want? To deliver a message to the mainland. Uh, I charged a lot for that trip, even before the Mongol blockade. You owe my master a debt. This will repay it. Then I have no choice. After Komoga Beach, I thought my debt to Lord Shimura was erased. That's why I was drinking. To celebrate your escape? To mourn the samurai. Those warriors died protecting men like me. Hmm? If that's how you feel, find your courage. Help us avenge them. 
We need a lot more samurai to do that. We'll receive them when you deliver Lord Shimura's message. Nagra and Morty. Suppose you've got a... This is my home. Come in. Hmm. Getting past that Mongol blockade won't be easy. Do you have Lord Shimura's message? He has it. At his camp on the Akashima coast. Ah. I can work with that. One of my boats is hidden near Fort Mitodake. This map shows where I'll wait on the forest road. Open up, Goro! We're not leaving until you pay us what you owe! Shit! I'll deal with them. Get moving. And I'll leave you to it. See you in Akishima, Lord Sakai. There's no use. I didn't call for Ronin. Uh, my lord, what's your business with Goro? Private. We'll... we'll be back. Destined to wear that armor in battle. I hope I'm worthy of it. I found Goro in Umugi Cove. <laughs> Was he drunk? Not anymore. He will fulfill his debt to you and sail for the mainland. He may be unsavory, but few know the sea like Goro. Will these men deliver your message? Precisely. Kotaro and Jiro are loyal and courageous. I will petition the Shogun for reinforcements. Goro is ready. He will meet us nearby, then lead us to his boat. We will ride when the time is right. Take this moment to prepare for battle. Yes, Uncle. It is time. To your horses, men. We are ready, my lord. Stay alert. And keep watch for our smuggler. Hey I can always tell when you want to ask me something. How could it? I'm curious how you met Goro. I caught him selling Chinese silk forbidden by Shogun decree. I burned his stock. And let him go. He could have been flogged, but you saw a better path. A skilled sailor can be a valuable asset. The Mongols have many ships. Can Goro evade them all? He has no choice. What will we do if they catch us, my lord? Do not fear death, Kotaro. Live with courage, and never forget the people you fight to protect. Lord Shimura! Goro! Where is your boat? This way. I'm happy you're alive, my lord. Thank you for agreeing to settle your debt. I'll do my best. But I fear the Mongols will sink me before I leave the coastline. There are too many eyes watching the water. Perhaps we can direct their attention elsewhere. This not. We walk from here. Fort Mitodake. My father took that stronghold from Clan Yarikawa. Now the Mongols have it. Imagine their surprise when two samurai take it back from them. If we make enough noise inside the mm. fort... The Mongol ship crews will look to it instead of the water. Goro, we will draw the enemy's attention to the fort. Sail when you hear the fighting. My lord, you will be killed! Your only concern is delivering my message. Horses might give us away. We will go on foot, Lord Sakai. Mongol armies are formidable, but our attack will catch them off guard. Let's pray that holds true in the fort. They outnumber us, but they cannot attack all at once. How long can we keep the element of surprise? Only until we see the enemy. Then, we strike.
Mongols are here. We could avoid them. Turn your back on a foe, and you will die with a sword stuck in it. See how the enemy fear you! You are a true warrior! Thank you, Uncle. Remain alert. Huh? Archers! Take cover! Get through that gate! Lord Sasha wreak havoc on the fort! We need the Mongol ships to focus here, not on Goro! But in time, but not enough. The Mongols have seen them, and their attack ships are faster. Our men are defenseless. No, they have us. We have a Huacha. A weapon of the enemy, not samurai. Saving our people is all that matters. You know how to fire this. I'll learn. Destroy the Mongol ships. Leave the guards to me. Uncle. We will not die here, my boy. The Mongols sent boarding parties. Don't let their boats reach Goro. It's working. The Mongol ships are in flames. Don't turn up. Goro must have run them. Ships on the way. Hold on, Goro. You made it, Goro. Bring us the Shogun's help. We did it. I knew we would. You continue to prove the Mongols are not unstoppable. You taught me to fight. I couldn't disappoint you. And you never have. I am proud of the warrior, the man you have become. Jin, my message to the Shogun included an announcement. I wish to formally adopt you as my son. Uncle. In my heart, you have always been the heir to my legacy. When this war ends, we will make it official. One day, our people will look to you as their leader. You will become their honorable Jito, backed by all the power of the Shogun. I hope I can serve them as well as you have. I know you will. 
We must finish our preparations while we wait for the Shogun's reinforcements. What are your orders? Finish your preparations, and I will see to mine. When you're ready, meet me at our staging camp in Kubala. Then we will retake my castle from Kotun Khan and save our home. As father and son, the Shogun himself will celebrate our victory. We will meet again soon. Until then, travel safely. <laughs> Thanks to your efforts, we have an army to reclaim my castle. I told you Yuna would have come through. I'm already arranging her payment. The Shogun's reinforcements will be here soon. Before they arrive, we must resolve a new problem. My scouts intercepted orders from the Khan, addressed to Duzo. His mercenaries are poised to strike our flank. Do you know where Rizo is now? Not far. Fort Koyasan. You do not have to face him yourself. He was my friend. I will deal with him. Do what you must. Our forces will be ready for battle when you return. You're leaving. Your uncle kept his word. A boat sails at dawn tomorrow. I need your help one last time. I found Ryuzo hiding in Fort Koyasan. I can't. Please understand. I spent my life working for this. Going to bed hungry. Risking my neck so we'd have enough money to start a new life on the mainland. I can't give up now. I'm not asking you to. Help me defeat Ryuzo, and I'll see you off myself. This is your battle, Jin. Not mine. All I want, all we need is to start a new life. I won't stop you then. Thank you, Yuna. For everything. I hope you find peace. You too. My lord, listen to your sister, Taka. She'll take care of you. Goodbye, Lord Sakai. I can do this alone, under cover of night. A nest of traitors. Better scout the fort. Mongols. As if straw hats aren't bad enough. Lord Sakai! Wait! Shh! You give us away! I won't let you do this alone. If you now won't come with you, then I have to. You're not trained for this. In Yarikawa, you said we can save our home if we stand together. I stand with the ghost. I can't pit you against Mongols. If anything happened... At least let me create a distraction. Draw some of them away. Even the odds for you. All right. But when they chase you, ride back to camp as fast as you can. I won't let you down. Go. I'll make my move now. Dogs! Mongols are nothing but ugly dogs! I'll tell Lord Shimura you're here! The samurai will come for you! They'll take your hands, you coward! Samurai! Juzo, it's good to see you. You know why I've come. Yes, I made sure you'd know where to find me. The Khan wants to meet you. 
I'm not here to talk. You betrayed us all. We can save our home together. It doesn't have to be like this. Yes, Yuzo. It does. Lord Sakai! Lord Sakai! Please, wake up! Taka... How? You were gone so long. I knew you were in trouble. I came to help, but the Mongols caught me. <clears throat> Damn. We have to get free. They're going to kill us. Only if we let them. Try to get loose. <clears throat> Just need to loosen this. <clears throat> Must be thirsty. Arag. Milk from my favorite horse. Her final gift to me. She broke her egg yesterday. So I fed her to my men. We do what we must, Lord Sakai. That is why you and I are both survivors. I am Samurai. No, you are more than that. You are the ghost. Convince your people to join me, and I will give them peace. We will never serve you. Hmm. Your uncle... ...said the same thing. When I asked him to end this war... He refused to be your slave. I, too, have pride in family. And I know what it's like to live in their shadow. Why should we settle for scraps when we deserve to be legends? He is a legend. Mm, see? Your people will follow you. Join me and save them. You want to divide and conquer. You did it, Yuzo. Not us. Oh, your legend does not even care about you. <clears throat> if you kill him, you can go. friend died for you. Now I must find another, and you must choose again. Sakai! 
the Khan ride out to Ryuzo. Where's Taka? I know he's here. He left a message saying he'd followed you. Where is he? No. No! 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 Shuna, wait! Taka! <laughs> he wasn't supposed to be here. Why didn't he listen? like the ghost. You shouldn't have made him come! I tried to stop him. But he wanted to help. That's dark. Leaving him. That's the last of them. The Star Hats have finished. Use us alone. He's still alive. With the Khan. There's nothing more we can do here. I need to bury my brother. I'll help you. I never meant for this to happen. I'm sorry. I swore I'd give him a good life. Keep him safe. This isn't your fault. It's mine. No. It was the Khan. Rizzo. Every Mongol on this island. Help me kill them all. Help me avenge Taka. There's no reason to leave anymore. Nowhere to go. Nothing to do. Except 
Stay. And fight. You should go to my uncle's camp and get some rest. I'll meet you there. Was Taka brave? At the end? He was always brave. I'm Lord Sakai. You must be our reinforcements. That is correct. I am Lord Sadamane Ogai, Bannerman to the Shogun. Welcome to Tsushima. Thank you, Lord Sakai. The Shogun dispatched us the moment we received your message. Your uncle just issued the order. We're to ride to battle, defeat the Khan, and reclaim Castle Shimura from the Mongol invaders. Excellent. Rally your men. I need to check on someone first. I'll wait for you by the northern gate. Then we'll ride to meet your uncle together. Jean, I didn't know you returned. I hope you're not being too hard on them, Lady Masako. They can take it. The Yedikawa peasants are hardier than they look. Stubborn, too. <laughs> More stubborn than you? Not a chance. A week ago, they would have spit on the name Sakai and Arachi. But after what you did in Yedikawa, they're here because of you. Then I won't disappoint them. Nor will I. Every last one. I see you're hard at work. Someone's got to make sure the battering ram's ready for battle. The, this thing falls apart. There's no way we're breaking into your uncle's castle. If only we'd had one to breach Azamo Bay. You didn't like hiding in my car? I didn't like reeking of sake. <laughs> You not told me about Taka. He's a braver bastard than I ever was. If Taka were here, I'm sure he'd disagree. Well, I'll try not to let him down. Lord Sakai. Norio, is he training our new recruits? Not quite, my lord. I just finished leading them in meditation. Samurai, the people of Yarikawa, Every spirit needs a moment of quiet before battle to accept the impermanence of life and the possibility of death. Wise words. Will you meditate with me? It would be my honor. Thank you, Norio. May the Buddha watch over you. Come back, Lord Sakai. Sensei, I see you've met our reinforcements. Mm, the Shogun's bannermen are elite warriors, but even they would benefit from archery practice. And the peasants? Impressive. In raw talent, if not in skill. High praise coming from you. Yarikawa used to be the backbone of our island. We could send the Mongols running for their boats with a month of heavy training. You have one hour. Then you should stop distracting me. It's time, you know. The samurai are here. Everyone's preparing for battle. Did you get some rest? I couldn't. I'm sorry. Taka should be here. He believed in you. No, so do the people of Yarikoa. Because you stood up for them when no one else would. They're risking their lives for the ghost. I will give my life for the people of Tsushima. And for you. Let's hope it doesn't come to that. Take care, you know. I need to meet Lord Oga. I'll see you on the battlefield. Lord Oga, where's my uncle? Waiting for you atop the hill. Clan Oga would be honored to escort you to his post. I'm glad for the company. We'd better not keep the Khan waiting. 
Splendid. Not to be commended, Lord Sakai. Rescue your uncle, then recruit the Yarikawa outcasts. They may not be trained warriors, but I trust them with my life. Then I will do the same. Is it true that people have a name for you? Ghost. They needed something to believe in after the samurai were defeated. Now the samurai are back. It's time we put these folk tales to bed and reestablish the shogun's law. It's time we save this island and the people who call it home. Politics can wait until the Khan is dead. Of course, that's okay. Lord Shimura, your nephew has arrived. Jin, up here. You've done well, Jin. We now have everyone we need to reclaim my castle. I dealt with the Straw Hats, but Ryuzo escaped with the Khan. They wanted me to betray you. You spoke to the Khan? I was captured. If I'd known, I would have marched my entire army to save you. Yuna helped me escape. But her brother... He died with honor. The Khan will pay for his sacrifice. And for all you've endured. Jin, the Shogun formally supports my decision to adopt you. When our island is saved, you will be heir to Clan Shimura. Not as a ghost, but as a samurai. I won't disappoint you, Uncle. Today we ride into battle as Sakai and Shimura. Tomorrow we celebrate victory as father and son. Samurai pride themselves on their honor code, but it also makes them rigid, predictable, easy to break. Ghost has no limits. This makes him dangerous. This is our moment, Jin. The fate of our island hangs on this battle. We will take the Khan's head. Together. And personally deliver it to the Shogun. Warriors of Tsushima! Today we defeat Kotun Khan! Retake Castle Shimura! And drive the Mongols from our home! Follow Lord Shimura to victory! Kill them all! Back down! Fight! This is for my son! Oh, <laughs> 
them as a warrior with honor, not a monster. It's all they understand. Terror is not the weapon of a samurai. That tower, they'll block our advance. This is your chance, Lord Sakai. Destroy their weapon with honor. I will hold the line and draw their fire. I'm coming with you. Stay close. Is Your position. Lord Sakai, take the water. To the top. Look for the towers. Push forward. Aim at the Mongols. We are past. Give up like this. Something's wrong. Soldiers, we will repair the bridge and attack at dawn. No, we've lost too many. If you had listened to me, Enough. there is another way. We will discuss it alone. Mongols are on the defensive. We will strike before they regroup and end this war tomorrow. You sent our men to die. They are soldiers. Their blood is on our hands. I can find a way past the bridge. Poison the enemy. An act of terror. I am trying to save our people. By teaching them to fear us? If you continue down this path, you will be no better than the Mongols. Trained you to fight with honor. Honor died on the beach. The 
Khan deserves to suffer. You are ruled by your emotion. I sacrificed everything I knew to save our people. I gave them hope. You did nothing. <laughs> Kenji, what are you doing here? Trying to help the wounded. But the best I can offer is a stiff jink. How do you comfort someone who's just lost his arm? I don't know. Taka always knew what to say. Hmm. I miss the damn kid. We all do. Get some rest. Lady Masako, you survived. Many weren't so fortunate. I wasn't there when my sons died, but I'm doing what I can to ease these boys into the next life. Lord Shimra wants to press our attack at sunrise. If there's another strategy, one that saves someone's children... There may be. Do what you must. You'll have my support. Sensei, Lord Shimura plans to repair the bridge. We strike at dawn. Mm, the Khan won't expect such a bold move. Hesitation could cost us even more lives. There may be another way. One that violates your uncle's honor code? One that saves people's lives. Tread carefully, Sakai. You disagree? I didn't say that. Not you. I worried you fell at the bridge. It was close. The blast knocked me to the ground and carried these brave warriors to the afterlife. We'll give them a proper burial once we've taken the castle. You think there's still a chance? There is always a chance. Don't lose hope, Norio. Never, my lord. They're patching the bridge on your uncle's orders. Lord Shimura is determined to see his plan through. No matter how many lives it costs. These people came here to fight. For you. How much Wolfsbane can you find in the next hour? A few handfuls. Talk to the others. Tell them to gather all you can carry. You're going to poison the Mongols. I'll find a way into the castle. Then slip it into their drinks. Watch the Khan choke on his own blood. Your uncle's going to find out? I know. Taka was making something for you. I wasn't sure you'd want it, but now, if something happens... It won't. He'd want you to have it. This is all the wolf spin we found. Will it be enough? I'll make sure it is. If I reach that tower, I can scout the Khan's forces. Find a way to poison his army. That's where they store the milk. Now to add the poison. Now to wait. In the
Jean. Where's the Khan? He rode north. Made me stay behind to collect the ghost's head. Then come claim it. No. I could have killed you earlier. Instead, I convinced the Khan to give you a chance. He murdered Tucker, and you slaughtered my men. I've lost everything. Except you. We can defeat the Mongols together. After everything you've done! Tell the people I was your spy. Sent to gain the Khan's trust. They'll believe the ghost. Stop! You are my oldest friend, Ryuzo. Surrender. And answer for your crimes. For both our sakes. I can't. You should have surrendered. I won't die by your uncle's hand. You won't stop me, Ryuzo. The poison. You broke your uncle's code. You left me no choice. I'll never forgive you! The castle is yours. The Khan marches north. We can head him off. You defied me! I did what I had to. For them. Is this how you want to be remembered? He defended us! By spreading fear and chaos! We are at war. And you are acting like the enemy. This is not our way. Your way. We can't save our people. The Shogun will demand a head. But it does not have to be yours. I know she drove you to this. Uncle. Renounce the ghost. You must blame her for this outrage. Tell them. You 
Yu are Jin Shimura. Loyal servant to the Shogun. My heir. My son. I am not your son. I am the ghost. And you will be judged for it. Find the Khan. What do you want? Lord Shimura asked me to deliver sake, a reward for helping retake his home. I'm watching the prisoner. He's not going anywhere. Wait too long, and your friends will drink it all. I haven't had anything but water since we got here. Then you deserve it, my lord. Kenji, what are you doing? What does it look like? Let's go! If I run, I won't be able to unite our people against the Khan. I'll never regain my uncle's trust. If you stay, he'll ship you to the Shogun for judgment. The orders just came through. The people need you, Lord Sakai. Yuna needs you. Where is she? Up north, tracking the Khan in the frozen wastes. She has your sword. She's waiting for the ghost. Forgive me, uncle. Find Masako, Norio, and Sensei Ishikawa. Get them to Omi village. Yuna and I will open the pass for you to join us. She's waiting in kin with your equipment at the sacred tree. Your horse is at the outer stables. A servant told me about a damaged fence near the gate. You can slip out that way. I'll distract the men outside. But I don't want to be here when they find out you're gone. Thank you, Kenji. Sora. Lord Sakai escaped! Search everywhere! Find him! We help search. You may have run north. You two, on your horses. The rest of you, man the gate. That's it. Nice and easy. How did he get this? Easy. It's me. There he is! On the horse! Stop him! <laughs>
sorry I couldn't protect you. What is he? Everything. Still a chance Yuna's alive. Kenji said Yuna was at the sacred tree. No weapons. We'll have to stay hidden. No. Yuna's not here. These people. The Mongols must have rounded them up. Blood poured from his mouth. Smells like wolf's bane. The Mongols learned how to make my poison. Now they're using it against us. Mongols! Bertrand! Him in the storm. I wasn't sure you'd wake up. I thought I wouldn't. The Mongols used my own poison on me. How did they get it? I don't know. But they learned how to make it themselves. They must have tested it on the people of Kin. Before they burned the town, I saw families lying in pools of blood. There's only one way to end this. Kill Kotan Khan. He's taken his army to a stronghold on the coast, Port Izmi. We will need a station camp somewhere close. I'll see what I can find. Your equipment's in that chest. Meet me by the lookout tower when you're ready. I think I found a better hideout. Climb up and look toward the mountain. Hideout. Somewhere by the mountain. Jogoku's pagoda. Sheltered, defensible, and in striking distance of the Khan's stronghold. There's only one problem. The Mongols have it. We can fix that. Let's get the horses. What happened to your mount? When I escaped, the castle guards fired on us. They killed Sora. I'm sorry. These will have to do, for now. Are those people from Kin? I don't know. The Mongols burned a lot of towns. If they'd only pursued their army, instead of fighting each other. Why did you surrender to your uncle? 
I couldn't let them take you. My uncle needed someone to blame. And I was his first choice. He was trying to protect me, to fulfill his duty to the Shogun. I surrendered so you could escape north and pick up the Khan's trail. Shimura's a fool for turning against you. He wanted me to be his son. I destroyed his dream. By doing the right thing. Being right doesn't always make things better. Tell that to the people you saved. If we kill the Khan and drive the Mongols out, is there a chance your uncle will forgive you? When I was young, Lord Shimra became my father, my sensei, my entire world. I never wanted to disappoint him. I have to hope we can heal this wound. Whatever happens, his forgiveness won't change who I am. He thinks I corrupted you. I made my own choices. Even knowing what they've cost me, I'd make them again. Even if the Shogun brands me as a traitor. We're close to Jogoka Temple. There's a fishing camp on the lake. We could scout the temple grounds from it. Leave the horses here. We'll go in on foot. They are prisoners. They'll freeze to death. We'll free them. Clear the fishing village. Then we take the temple. A signal cannon. To alert the temple of an attack. They were working us to death. You're free now. That's everyone here. The temple will have stronger defenses. We can't rush in. Let's see what we're dealing with. <clears throat> Archers watching the lake. They'll see us coming. Pick us off. Let's bring them to us. How? Fire the signal cannon. Lure them onto the ice. Then divide and conquer. They left explosives on the ice. We can use that against them. That will get their attention. Better get back to you now. Get to the pagoda. We need to plan our attack carefully. That waterfall's frozen. We climb it, go over the back wall. Let's take them. safe. We thought we'd die as slaves. They can't hurt you now. No Mongols. Solid walls. I think we'll be safe here. Hey. Your uncle chose his path. And I chose mine. Koton studied Lord Shimura's tactics. He knows how to break an army of samurai. But he doesn't know how to defend against us. 
will make him hurt. For Taka. For everyone. We could use the old road from Omi up through Fort Kaminodake. Only problem is it's held by Mongols. You need help to drive them out. I know some hunters camped on Mount Sago. Their leader's named Takashi. Friend of yours? No, but he'll do anything I ask, and his men are good archers. While you're meeting them, I'll slip through your uncle's castle. Meet our friends in Omi. Lead them to strike the fort from the south. I'll attack from the north with your hunter friends. You think it'll work? Yes. Be careful, you know. You too. Are you Takeshi? You know my name? I'm Jin Sakai. Yuna sent me. She's alive? Where is she? The Mongols blocked the pass to Omi. I have to open the way and I can't do it alone. Yuna told me you can help. <laughs> Sounds dangerous. I thought you were an expert hunter. Leader of the best archers in the prefecture. Is that what Yuna told you? She thinks you care enough to fight. Is she wrong? About me? No. But my people need a reason to risk their lives. It's going to be a cold winter. Why spend it on a mountainside hunting squirrel when you can live in a warm fort? If we can stay till spring, we're in. You have a deal. This won't be like hunting wild boar. Come over here and you'll see. Mongol archers guard the gate. Patrols ride in and out all day. If we can get in from this side, Yuna and the rest of my friends will hit them from the south. Yuna will be there? All right. The fort was built around the cliffs. We can use them to get inside. Woodcutter camp. Supplied lumber to the fort. Haven't seen anyone there since the Mongols showed up. How good are you at climbing? Better than average. We made them climb for eight hours. We sit up here much longer. The Mongols are sure to see us. Back away from the edge. I'll be right up. Sure you will. Yuna's got some interesting friends. Let's plan our attack. You can see inside from over here. Archers on that ridge will have a good view of the courtyard. And plenty of targets. The bulk of our force should go there. We'll get on that roof. Control the high ground. <laughs> you sound like Yuna. She was a good teacher. <laughs> you men with me. Everyone else get to the ridge. If the enemy sees me, take them down. Understood. Good luck.
What sort of animals would do this? The Mongol kind. The woodcutters must have resisted them. Let's kill every bastard in this fort. Another patrol. We'll ambush them when they come through. Hide. You heard him. Move. Get closer. Now, kill them all! <laughs> I heard Lord Shimura has an army, with samurai from the Shogun. Why aren't you leading them? Lord Shimura has his plan to fight the Mongols, and I have mine. You're on your own. This fort isn't yours to give us. That came from the southern gate. Got to see what's happening. Over here. Yuna! She did that? We have to get over there. Let's get a look at the bridge. The Mongols sent most of their forces over there. This is our chance. If we charge across the bridge, we'll have to deal with that Huacha quickly. Could you sneak under the bridge with that hook of yours? Take the Huacha by surprise? I could grapple onto the tree and swing across. There's a way up the cliff on the other side. If they spot you, we can hit them with arrows. Charge across or sneak over. Either way, it'll be risky. We'll follow your lead, Lord Sakai. Get your people ready to move. waited for us to open the gate. things considered. Good to see you, Lord Sakai. Uh, um, is it this cold everywhere up here? You'll get used to it. Take any supplies we need, and prepare to ride for Jogaku. We are so, you and Takeshi... That was my old life. He and his people are more than hunters, aren't they? Depends on how you look at it. 
I told them they can stay and hold the pass for us. But I don't want bandits making trouble for innocent people fleeing the Mongols. He knows what I'd do to him if they tried. I think he's been looking forward to seeing you. He's seen me. We can go now. Let's get everyone to Jokaku. We'll plan our final attack from there. It's time for the Khan to die. You've been praying. To my ancestors. Asking forgiveness for what I'm about to do. What do they say? I can't hear them. Perhaps your ancestors are silent because they can't do what you must. I know where my sister is. Clan Kikuchi's old fort. Then you're ready? I have no incense left to burn. No more prayers to make. The Kikuchi estate is this way. How did you find your sister? She was married to a man named Ikeda, a retainer for Clan Kikuchi. Their stronghold is near here, under the mountain. She always wanted an estate and holdings of her own. And with Kikuchi's men fallen at Komoda. It made sense she would try and take Kikuchi's for herself. Especially after she failed to take yours. I asked around. It seems a new clan has taken up residence. Their emblem matches the one on the notes. Then it's her. People say she's turned it into a haven for refugees. Claiming she knows what it's like to lose her home. Do you think it's true? We're about to find out. Why would your sister say she lost her home? She had to leave home when she married Ikeda. You said Ikeda was a retainer? Yes. But you're the younger sister. Why were you the one to marry a samurai? When we were young, bandits attacked our estate. Hana hid with our parents. I took up a sword. Only after I dispatched the bandits did a samurai guard arrive to help. A dachi was leading them. Hana saw him as a way to realize her ambitions. But he only had eyes for me. She was jealous then. A seed of many betrayals. I wanted to ease her heartbreak. So I helped arrange her marriage to Ikeda, and she was sent north. Did you know the man you sent your sister to live with? Ikeda was a respected widower. People spoke well of his kindness. Kindness is a mask, easily removed behind closed doors. What are you getting at, Jin? I want to understand why she went to such extremes to destroy you. After so many years... There is only one thing to understand. Hana murdered my family, and today, she will pay for it. Was there ever any sign of her betrayal? We were never close, but our relationship was always cordial. I would see her at Lord Shimura's conclaves. We'd exchange pleasantries. I had no idea she held such hate in her heart. But she was at your estate, the day of the attack. She came that morning, to wait with me for news from Komoda Beach. We were both concerned for our husbands. It was the first time I ever felt close to her. She met my grandchildren, brought them gifts. They loved her. Now I know she hadn't come for comfort, but to witness our death. The women in your family fought. I saw that for myself. I stayed with my son's wives while Hana took the children and ran for the stables. Afterward, I found what I thought was her body. The face was brutalized, unrecognizable. But the gold sash was Hana's. I buried her with my family. She must have learned you survived the attack. Faked her death to escape you. A clever plan. My survival was her greatest mistake. We're almost there. Leave the horses. We'll continue on foot.
guards at the gate. Be ready. If this is a haven for survivors, there's no telling what to expect. Where is Lady Hana? It's Lady Massacre! Kill her! Cut them down! Open the gate. Quickly, before more gods show up. So she is helping people. Hana helps no one but herself. Lady Hana, show yourself! <laughs> <laughs> Where's Lady Hana? In the estate up the hill, my lord. Tell the coward her sister has come. What will you do when you see her? Exactly what she did to me. She's still your family. My family is dead. She is nothing but a murderer. Hana! Show yourself. Little sister. You let me think I buried you. Who was it, really? A peasant woman killed by the Mongols. Did you weep for me? You have taken everything! Daughters and grandchildren. Not nearly enough. The Mongols robbed me of Adachi's death. And you cheated yours. But finally, I will take everything. Kill them. We are up. Stop her. I will deal with them. Thank you. Attack! Take his head! <laughs> You murdered my children. My grandchildren. Destroyed my family. A small price to pay for what you've done. I have done nothing. You stole everything. Drove me from our home. Took the life that was rightfully mine. Left me with that abusive drunk in this frozen land. I'd have to suffer an eternity of pain to understand the life I've lived. The life you forced on me! None of that is my fault. It is! And damn you for acting as if it isn't! You've come to kill me! So finish this! It will be your only kindness! I can't end your suffering. But you can. Now, you have nothing! I never mourned my family. I've tried to honor them. Meditate on treasured memories. But she consumes them. Even now. I have nothing left. No. You've accomplished what you set out to do. You have honored your family. Given them justice. Now you can find peace. 
This path does not lead to peace. Where does it lead? I don't know. I have to continue walking it to find out. I don't want you to go. I must. But I will be there when you need me. To talk. When I was your age, people said I was the next Tadayori Nagao. You're the best archer we've ever had. Nah, not even close. But I'm damn good. And I'm grateful for everything you taught me. I was so dedicated to my study. I never made time for a family. Tomoe was to be my heir. Her crimes. I could not forgive her. No samurai would. I devoted my life to the bow. The life it gave me was remarkable. But the life it took from me. Family is more important. Sensei? Don't become like me. Don't let the ghost consume you. Hey. Tomoe is somewhere in Kamiyagata. A last-ditch effort to rally the Mongols and restore her reputation. If she's here, we will find her. And end this. Yes, we will. What's that over there? Mongol convoy. Wiped out. By who? All shot in the back. Probably ambushed. Burn the cart. Flaming arrows. Japanese arrows. Lord Shimura's men? Japanese archers did this. Likely a group. Unless Sensei Ishikawa has been here. <gasps> Please, excuse me, my lord. It's a bad idea to sneak up on me. I thought you were with the man who killed these Mongols. He was samurai, but older. An archer? Sensei Ishikawa. Where is he? He said he'd come back to my house in a day or two. Why your house? I have food, a fire. Whatever his business was, it seemed urgent. It's possible he picked up Tomoe's trail. Where's your house? Not far, but there's a storm coming, and I need to check my snares first. Then I can take you there. Fine, I'll go with you. What's your name? Matsu, my lord. What exactly did Sensei Ishikawa tell you? Nothing more, my lord. He wasn't the friendliest man. Sounds about right. I never talk to a real samurai. War brings unlikely people together. It's my chance to ask a really good question. Don't mess it up. <laughs> What's it like to hold the power of life and death in your hands? It's a heavy responsibility. But you secretly enjoy it. Only a monster would enjoy it. That's not the answer I expected. Damn. Empty. Have to reset it. You might have more luck hunting. Oh, I could never do that. So awful. Maybe try a different bait. My bait never changes. What do you use? The illusion of opportunity. There's your problem. That only works on men. <laughs> this way, my lord. It's not easy surviving up here. It's hard everywhere. I fled north when the Mongols came. Alone? My parents died when I was a girl. Been on my own ever since. Your family must be very important. 
My uncle is Lord Shimura. Wait. You're the one people talk about. The ghost. But you're not ten feet tall with eyes like a demon. As far as you know. But demons often visit humans in disguise. I know there's no such thing as demons. I hope. <laughs> Besides, you're much too handsome to be a demon. And if I were a demon, I would agree with you. Look! They're stealing my cats! Drive them off, my lord! Please! Wait here. <sighs> They're starving. Hey! Please don't hurt us, my lord! That's not yours. We are sorry. It's just a squirrel. We have eaten grass and tree bark for days. Take it and go. Thank you, my lord. You let them escape. We thought dinner. They were starving. And no threat. Doesn't sound like the ghost I've heard about. Not all the stories about me are true. The blizzard is almost on us. How many more traps do you have? Just one. But it's farther away. No one will believe I talked to you. What's it like to be the ghost? The stories are stories. Without allies and friends, I'd be dead. You're just saying that. I owe my life to many others. From the Lady of Clan Adachi to a thief. People may not tell their stories, but I would not be here without them. Got something? We might eat like civilized people after all. What's out there? The mainland. No Mongols, no war. Somewhere I can start over. Say you make it to the mainland. What then? In Kyoto, I'll open a fancy inn. Learn to play the shamisen. Welcome the undying parade of beautiful men and women, while my servants rob them blind. Sounds like Kyoto's in trouble. It's snowing hard. We should go. Maybe your sensei will be here with us. If I get any closer, we'll have to share a horse. What was that? Never mind. Keep going. My lord! Mongols! Close to the house! I'll deal with them. Stay back. No wonder they tell stories about you. Where's your house? <laughs> Come on. Here we are. Let's get inside. You seem too kind to be the ghost. But the way you killed those Mongols... I do what I have to for Tsushima. The truth is, we're both survivors. We have darkness in us. If we didn't, we'd be dead. Sensei Shikawa said something similar. But it sounds more natural coming from you, Tomoe. Ishikawa always said I underestimate my opponents. I don't have an arrow in my back. Why not? The Mongols turned against me. After you trained them to slaughter our people, a mistake I tried to fix. But I can't kill all my archers. Not our own. You need me. And the Sensei. But we don't need you. I know where they'll attack next. We can ambush them together. You get a victory, I get revenge. I'll talk it over with Sensei Shikawa. Jing. You can stay the night. I can't. 
Sakai. You have news. Something like that. I spoke with Tomoe. She's hiding in the north. The Mongols turned against her. If you saw her, why is she still alive? Her archers are preparing a massive attack. She wants the three of us to wipe them out. Or she needs both our heads to get back in the Mongols' favor. She could have killed me, Sensei, but she didn't. Hmm. I have never been rewarded for trusting Tomoe. I don't trust her. But we need what she knows. And I believe she needs our help. Then she's a fool. And we finish this. Sakai! You have word from Tomoe? The three of us will meet. Then she'll reveal where and when her archers plan to attack. You think she'll tell us the truth? We'll find out. And Sakai, there will be no room for error. I came prepared, Sensei. Let's go. Where are we headed? North of Umugi Cove. She sent word to meet at an old gambling den. Might be a good spot for an ambush. We have the advantage. The Mongols turned against her. She is desperate. Desperate enemies are dangerous. Because they are unpredictable. But Tomoe has two choices. Enlist our help, or betray us. You spent time with her. What do you think? She can help us wipe out her archers. The risk is worth it. You're gambling with your life. She could have killed me in Jogoku. And lost me. This way, she gets us both. If she doesn't ambush us, we hear her out. And if this planned attack is real, we cooperate. After that, we'll deal with her. She betrayed her people. She will answer for it. What will you say when you see her? I have nothing to say to Tomoe. You don't want answers? You haven't spoken since she joined the enemy. Any chance of talking ended the moment she turned on me. That outcropping to the right. I'll position myself there. Then you... If I was here to kill you, you'd already be dead. Get over here! You should wait out here. Not a chance. Stay alert. Sensei. Jing. Always so sure of yourself. The one thing you never had to teach me. Your archers are planning an attack. Where and when? Umugi Cove. Heading there now. Why tell us? The Khan betrayed me. I'm taking my archers away. And if we don't help you stop them, they'll wipe out Umugi Cove. I don't believe you. Do nothing. And watch what happens. Damn it. The Mongols followed me. Damn you, Tomoe. traps to Moe. This wasn't a trap. She fought back against the Mongols, Sensei. To deceive us, so we lower our guard. If I want to put an arrow in you, there's nothing you can do to stop me. Enough. Umugi Cove could be under attack. We need to move. Fine. But if Tomoe even breathes wrong, I'll put her in the dirt. Both of you. This way. Saving Umugi Cove won't make amends for your crimes, Tomoe. They forced me to teach your way of the bow. Did they force you to kill your own people at Fort Nakayama? They were being tortured. I offered a quick, painless death. And the Mongols spared me. I won't apologize for surviving. If they see us headed for Umugi Cove, Tomoe's archers could be alerted. Agreed. We should stay off the roads. Cut through this field. 
How did you find my camp in Akashima? Your people attacked me. We tracked them. I told them to avoid you two. I had plans for a dozen more camps. I'm glad they ignored your orders. I lost control. By the time we set up in Kushi, I wasn't in charge. You sound like Sensei Ishikawa. The tree is at the end of the field. We can rest there, out of sight. Tomoe, you said you lost control of the Mongols in Kushi, but a woman saw you there with them. A woman you burned alive. That was not my doing. Not with your bow, but you trained her killers. Most of the time, I convinced them to spare lives, not take them. Over here! Get down! The Mongols are out in force. They're hunting me. I thought I lost them. Didn't think to mention that earlier. I'm mentioning it now. Wait here until nightfall. We can use the darkness to our advantage. Will they attack the cold before then? No. They'll position archers. Make sure no one gets out. Plan their slaughter. Get some rest. I'll keep watch. Sun's down. Ready? Tomoe, you're in front. The sensor and I will follow. So you can stab me in the back? If the Mongols spot you first, we get out of sight and drop them. Let's Stay go. Stay close. Don't let her out of your sight, Sakai. I can hear you, Sensei. Good. On your mark, Sakai. Don't miss, Sensei. One arrow, one death. You took that last one with the circling falcon shot, Sensei. You saw that. You change your form, too. I shift the right hand down, so when you release... Hmm, that's interesting. Nobody said this would be easy. We get in a fight here. Your archers will be alerted. Start the attack before we reach the cove. We can't risk it. What do you think, Sakai? Follow my lead. Don't fall behind. My archers. The moment we attack, they'll retreat into town. Use it to defend against us. Innocent people will die. See the barrels in their carts? I'll circle behind. One flaming arrow. Once you shoot, they'll be on you. If you stay back in the tree line... I might miss. I need to get close. Let me undo the damage I've done. Go. You trust her? I trust her desire for revenge. So that's how she stayed one step ahead of us. You taught her well, Sensei. I know. Get ready. Now! Not bad, Sakai. Where's Tomoe? I don't know. Was she wounded? Tomoe! Near the end of the fight, I saw her by the archway over there. That leads straight into Umugi Cove. If any Mongols try to retreat that way... Maybe she gave chase. Tomoe knows that killing her archers won't erase her crimes. But she got her revenge. Is that all she got? She fought alongside us. That will mean something once we defeat the enemy. Forget the Mongols. What does she want in Umugi Cove? There's not much here besides thieves and cutthroats. Damn it, and smugglers. She needs a boat to get off the island. You there? Yes, my lord. Did you see a woman run through here? A warrior. She was headed for the beach. This way! She helped save Umugi Cove. The Mongols were hunting her. We gave her safe passage to a way off the island. We're always one step behind. But there's still time to stop her.
Sensei Ishikawa, we have judged each other harshly, but the Buddha tells us that our greatest enemies can be our best teachers. I am grateful for your teaching and for the chance to fight by your side. A final time, I have been your student. I would have become your daughter, but the way of the bow is behind me now. What lies ahead? I am like an arrow shot from a bow. Who knows where the wind will take me? It's over. Maybe she'll reach Kyoto after all. If she were anyone else, I'd say that's impossible. We still have a war to finish, a home to rebuild. I have no more lessons to give in this life, except one. Promise me, you won't repeat my mistakes. I promise, Sensei. for your services if they refuse they kill us but the guardian's brother will change that what do you know about norio he's going to lead us to victory i can take you to him quickly this way my lord does norio know you're helping the mongols until we take back cedar temple he told us to keep cooperating so they don't suspect us that doesn't sound like norio really but you inspire everything he does. He always talks about what he learned from the ghost. What are you doing back here, ghost? I brought the ghost! Nonio is inside with the others. Bands up each side to flank. Use the tree line as cover. Lord Sakai! Everyone, give me a moment to speak with Lord Sakai. You arrive just in time. This way. I hear you're planning to take back Cedar Temple. We've been training hard. They're ready. I recognize some faces here. I'm from Akashima. I sent messengers to Kushi Temple, but no one came. After all we did there. We can free Cedar Temple without them. You think these people can take back the temple? We could handle it on our own. Why risk their lives? Cedar Temple can be a beacon for all of Tsushima. Everyone who takes part in the attack will be a messenger of hope. We can't carry this message alone. This victory has to be theirs. When do we ride, Norio? At dawn, my lord. Ride for Cedar Temple with the ghost! When you took Castle Canada, you did it without the samurai. You must have had doubts going in. I wasn't sure we could take Canada until it was done. I feel the same without my brother and his men by my side. I wish Angel was here with us. His spirit is. You have supporters, Norio. They remember the Guardian. And they know why we ride for Cedar Temple. They're fortunate you fight for them. We should get off the road. This way. The 
temple is just ahead, through the cedars. Are they holding any monks hostage? No. One reason I told them to cooperate, reduce their risk when we attack. Good thinking. We're getting close. Breathe, Norio. You can't fight if you hold your breath. <laughs> How could you tell? I know you well enough by now, my friend. Norio, and the ghost. We came as soon as we could. It's good to have Kushi Temple with us. Cedar Temple, Akashima, and Kushi stand together as one. You'll attack through the main gate? Yes. Draw the Mongols' attention while the others flank. What do you want me? My lord, this may be my plan, but you should fight as you see fit. All of you, follow me. Stay close. Not one of you will die today. Everyone who falls will live forever in history. Was yours. The last time I was here, my brother, Hochi, the abbot, they were all alive. Starting today, you can rebuild. Come with me to the main hall. I have to make sure the Mongols did no lasting damage. This way, my lord. Norio! Lord Sakai! What's wrong? Do not go inside the main hall. Get a hold of yourself. Whatever the Mongols destroyed, we can rebuild. The hall looks fine from the outside. Nothing damaged or stolen. <laughs> Norio. Angel? Yes, you can. 
can. <laughs> Please. Lord Sakai, would you leave us? Yes. His name is Khart Sho, the one who burned my brother and cut off his limbs. This Khart Sho is among the dead? Not yet. Ariel, your brother was the guardian. He died a hero. No, he didn't. I can find out where this Mongol coward is, but then I'll need your help. You have it. When the snow lets up, we'll hold the funeral. My lord, can I help you? I'm looking for Norio. Where is he? He brought his brother's ashes to a cemetery. It's in the hills to the south. I'll look for him there. Thank you. Enjo's urn. He liked the open air better than the pagoda at Cedar Temple. The Mongol you're looking for, Harucho. Have you found him? He's not far from here. Norio, Cedar Temple needs your leadership. This comes first. Revenge is not the first duty of a monk. Before I was a monk, I was a brother. Don't do this alone. Let me help. If you wish. Where do we find him? Fort Shoni. You're sure he's the one responsible? When I find him, he will pray for a quick death and his cries will go unheard. You're Enjo's brother. I respect your right to seek revenge. I don't want you to become... Like what? You? Like so many others who have been changed by this war. It's far too late for that, my lord. There's a spot down here where you can see the fort. I put everything you taught me to good use tracking Kharsho. What does he look like? Like every other murdering, honorless Mongol dog. You may only get one chance at him. I'll know him when I see him. When you have him in your sights, strike without delay. Dogs, get away from there! Norio! Please, we were just hungry. Spare us. We're leaving. Norio, they weren't a threat. Maybe. They're definitely not now. They should have known better. Advance and reach Nirvana. Retreat and find hell. What's that from? A prayer Enjo inscribed on this Naginata after he saved Kushi Temple from bandits and became the guardian. He suffered more than either of us know, but he held on so he could see you. Do you know what his last words to me were? I was wrong. About what? I'll never know. Karsho's last words will be a howl of pain. We should get some rest, Norio. For tomorrow. You're right, my lord. 
I'll save my strength for Karcho. Norio, where is he? Damn you, Norio. He's gone mad! What happened? Norio! At first, when I saw him, I thought my prayers were answered, but... Return to see the temple. I'll handle this. Norio. Seek refuge in Amida Buddha. Who did this? Norio. He's lost his mind. You do not have the courage to do it! Burn! Burn for your crimes, butcher! You once told me you would never swing your Naginata in hatred. I did what the ghost would do. And now Harsho is gone. I'm not going back to see the temple. Not after this. Where will you go? It doesn't matter. He was still alive when I lit the wood. When he screamed, it filled me with joy. And I would do it again. I'm no longer a monk. You don't get to give up. We all have regrets and broken promises. But this island needs you. The last warrior monk of Cedar Temple. I can't go back to what I was before this. I'm not asking you to go back. I'm asking you to keep your faith and move forward. Thank you, Jin. I'll see you at Cedar Temple. How are the others? Ready to follow wherever you lead. The Sensei told them you're the only person on Tsushima who can kill the Khan. I can't do it alone. Or without a plan of attack. We know he's at Port Izmi, surrounded by an army. We need to know the weakness in their defense. How to get past them, and where to find the Khan. Sounds like we need a hawk's view of the place. I know where we can get one. We'll have cover of darkness if we leave now. Port Izmi. We'll have a better view from the lighthouse. Just need to get up there. Without being noticed. Let's move. Why would the Khan come up here? He'll sail for our mainland. Attack it, just like you did here. This is our last chance to stop him. These flowers... The same ones I used to make my poison. The Mongols have been here picking them. To use against us. Did we do the right thing at your uncle's castle? I was too eager to stop the Khan. You couldn't have known he'd learn from you. It was always a risk. Now our people may suffer even more. You're right. We need to kill him. Soon.
What's in all these barrels? Supplies? Flowers. Poison. One barrel holds enough to kill hundreds. Khan will use this against the mainland. We can't let him leave Tsushima. We'll scout Port Izumi from the top of the lighthouse. Right behind you. you see before a storm. That could work to our advantage. For now, I'll leave the lighthouse dark. Make sure the Mongols can't use it when the storm hits. It can be lighted once they're gone. Let's get a look at the port. The Khan is almost ready to sail for our mainland. With ships full of men, explosives, and my poison. If we don't stop him here, the Shogunate will fall. The storm is our key to beating him. When it comes, the Khan will have to shelter his fleet in the bay. That's when we strike. Destroy his ships and everything on them. To do this, we'll need Mongol weapons. A simple task for a master thief. <laughs> we'll need fighters, too. A small force could distract the Mongols while I get inside Port Izmi. Kill the Khan. Could work. Let's get back to Jokaku and prepare. What they done here? Are oh, the plans coming? Kenji found where we can steal watches from the Mongols. I'm heading there now. That's a good start. But we need more fighters. No. My uncle wants the Khan dead as much as we do. He'll join our attack. He'll throw you in prison. I'll write him a message. Leave it in his quarters. In a castle full of samurai. I'll be gone before they know I was there. There. Let's hope my uncle reads it. I'm not letting you leave without a good horse. I can't replace what you lost. But give one of these a chance. Easy there. It's all right. I'm a friend. What will you name this one? Kage, born from the darkness. Good choice. How will you get inside your uncle's castle? I grew up there. And I still remember every hidden path through those old walls. Even as a boy, Lord Shimura couldn't keep up with me. Jin, why did you run away? I wanted to catch an eel for your dinner. Were you planning to catch it with your bare hands? Yuzo said you'd get rid of me as soon as you had a son of your own. Jin, come here. Your friend is wrong. The path ahead may take a lifetime, but I will walk it with you, always.
Kanot? I inspect every car before you cross into the main keep. Just wait for the guard to finish checking it. Thank you, my lord. What was that all about? Lord Simura can't be too careful. The Mongols turned the straw hats against us. We can't be sure who to trust. But we're not warriors. We're merchants. Remember all that Ataro? The silk trader? I hear he got some of the ghost's poison and used it in Lady King. She was his only business, right? Oh, she's a bloated corpse. Poison made her bleed from her mouth. Oh, that's why they search up the pot. Who knows what we might be bringing? I would never hurt Lord Shimura. Me neither. But that's just how things are now. There he is, inspiring his new samurai. Deliver that speech together. Damn you, Jin. Leave the message. Leave the message where he can see it. He's here. Guards. Uncle. Forgive me for not facing you in person. The Khan's fleet has gathered at Port Izumi. His ships are loaded with poison that would devastate the Shogun's army. But when the next storm arrives, I plan to kill the Khan and sink his fleet. I ask that you join me. I hope we can meet again. If not as father and son, then as warriors who have walked different paths. Whatever you believe I've become, I will always be your family. You had us worried. I thought you'd been caught. Delivering my message wasn't easy. Did your uncle read it? Will he help us defeat the Khan? I hope so. But we can't wait to find out. 
The wind's getting stronger. The storm will be here by morning. Do you secure the siege weapons? Enough to cause plenty of damage. Also found some deserters from your uncle's army who want to follow the ghost. We're ready. Tell the others we attack at dawn. I'll spread the word, but you should check on them. They want to hear from their leader. Lord Sakai. I think he was right to do it. It's good to have the head of Cedar Temple with us. I would never claim such an honor for myself. I know. That's why you deserve it, my friend. Tomorrow we avenge your brother and the warrior monks of your temple. I just want our home back. It's good to have your bow with us, Sensei. I gave you my word. You've given me more than that. Don't get sentimental, Sakai. <laughs> As you like, Sensei. I'll let you prepare for tomorrow. I prepared my whole life. <laughs> One more day makes no difference. Masako, I wasn't sure you'd come. I said I'd be there when you needed me. But I need the Khan dead too. He murdered my husband, and his men slaughtered my sons. We won't let them escape justice. I'll help you make sure of it. Get some rest. Tomorrow will be a long day. Or a very short one. <laughs> You're in good spirits. Of course! I've been sipping good spirits all day. Don't sip too much. You don't want to sleep through tomorrow. Joking aside, there's no way I would miss tomorrow. I'm here for Taka. Thank you, Kenji. You've come a long way since you pulled me off Komodo Beach. You were so heavy I could barely drag you. Had to strip you half naked just to reach town. <laughs> I wouldn't be here without you, you know. I can't lose you, Jin. After everything we've been through, everyone we've lost, I can't. I have to stop the con. No, you don't. We could find a boat, sail somewhere quiet, while your uncle fights his samurai war. Do you really want that? No. If I fall, promise me you'll keep fighting. You're a real bastard, Jin Sakai. You should get some rest. Not yet. Let's sit just a little longer. This is it. We have one chance to take down the Khan before he attacks our mainland. Kenji, what's the status of our siege weapons? Ready to rain fire on the Mongol fleet. Good. Yuna will signal your attack. Once the volley begins, the Mongols will charge your position and run right into our ambush. The explosives are set up. Archers on the rooftops. We're with you, Sakai. Thank you. All of you. Go. Jin, there's no sign of your uncle. That storm's not waiting. And neither are we. Get ready to fire the signal arrow. Now! The Mongols are coming. We'll cut down anyone who gets through. Take the fight to them! Forward! 
Plan worked. The Mongols are regrouping. We won't give them a chance. Norio is leading the rest of our forces up the hill. Then we'll join him and press the attack. This is where it ends. Today, the Khan dies. Lord Shimura isn't here. We fight alone. We'll lead an attack on the main gate. Distract the Mongols while you find a way inside. You'll be overwhelmed. We came this far. We're not turning back now. You are all the bravest warriors I've ever known. I hope to see you again. Leave the battle to us. What are we waiting for? No mercy for the Mongols! is death because you and your uncle would not surrender I offered you peace and you chose war now the people of your mainland will suffer you will never leave this island Avenge the people of Tsushima. Vengeance? The petty wish of a child.
Armada will come. is dead, but his army is still here. Almost dead. Our home won't be safe until we drive them out to sea. And when they're gone, what happens then? We start new lives. I used to know what my new life would be. Now I'm not even sure who I am. You're a great warrior, a loyal friend. And a thief. That's the past. What you become tomorrow is your choice. I can't stay here long. My uncle will come looking for us. No, he won't. After the battle, he sent a messenger. Did he offer to make peace? He wants to meet you by the still waters under the red-leafed tree. Omi Lake. We used to spar there when I was a child. Want company? I need to face him alone. He's my only family. I know. It still hurts thinking about Taka. The smell of smoke in his hair. His quiet laugh. The hell he'd give me for drinking too much. My whole life, he was part of me. And, and now... I'm alone. You're not alone. You have me. A ghost. You belong to everyone. Looks like an altar for some kind of Mongol ceremony. Samurai! The eagle calls to you! Surge 
to that shaman's call. Find out who these invaders are. Tell me what you did to these people. They heard the call of the Eagle. The Eagle? Is he your leader? She will lead the Eagle tribe to your shores. With all of Iki Island at her back. They came from Iki Island. Father. Jin. Help me. I came as soon as I heard. Those people. They're getting the help they need. But I don't know if they will recover. What happened to them? I'm not sure. I haven't seen these Mongols before. They claim to follow someone called the Eagle. And they're planning an attack on Tsushima. Those people lost their minds. If the Eagle can do that to the whole island... She won't. How will you find her? One of our people mentioned Iki Island. It's full of raiders and criminals. They hate the samurai. I know. My father led the campaign to pacify them, and he... He died on that island. The samurai retreated after he fell. Now something monstrous has taken root on Iki Island. I have to go back. Brace yourself, boy. <coughs> Kage! Tracks. Kage survived. You there? Quiet. They'll hear you. The Eagle Tribe is hunting us. 
The thing we say to two people's minds, it's awful. Calm down. We're alone here. When I heard them coming, I ran. Didn't see the snake till I was almost on it. You did a fine job killing it. Oh, not me. A horse came charging out of nowhere, trampled it, and saved my life. The horse? Which way did he go? Up the hill, toward the Mongols. Thank you. If you find that horse, give him my thanks. That sound, they're close. Kage, he needs me. Or not? Kage! <laughs> I'm here, boy. Are you alright? I thought I'd lost you. But I should have known you'd never give up. Remember that trick from before? Where you charged the Mongols? Let's try that again. More Mongols. Get ready. Good to have you back, boy. Help! Over here! Someone's in trouble. We need to help him. That's the last of them. That's twice you saved my life. You're welcome. I meant him, but my thanks to both of you. Easy now. Good work, boy. Time to go. This island needs us. Scouts you sent to Tsushima. I killed them. Koten Khan is dead. We defeated his army on Tsushima. Tomorrow, a thousand samurai will join me on the shores of Iki. Surrender, and we will spare you. Your journey was hard. Drink? There are easier ways to kill me. I do not harm my guests. Did you give me? 
My sacred medicine. Save your strength. This is the easy part. You won't break me. You were broken long ago. I release your spirit to travel the underworld. Face the judgment of your ancestors. you not to come lucky for you I didn't listen I borrowed the first ship I could find <coughs> what's wrong what did they do to you the Eagle tribes leader she fed me some kind of poison let's find you a healer before they come back my katana was here look around for the rest of your things the Eagle and her Mongols. Where are they? I started a fire outside the compound. Drew them out to investigate. Hurry! Grab your belongings! All right. Let's go. This way. After all these years, Fort Sakai is still here. You know this place. My father built it. Oh, of course. Is anyone on the island fighting back against the Mongols? None that I know of. Yet. So you haven't found allies? No. Iki Island resents Clan Sakai. It will be hard to gather support. Because of your father. Give me a hand with this gate. When will the other samurai get here? Other samurai? I didn't tell anyone. Not even Sensei Shikawa. Was your father killed at this fort? No. We were ambushed in the canyons. So you were there with him? This way. Where to? There's a ravine across the yard. We can escape that way. Interesting. I'll follow you. Losing your father in an ambush. I can't imagine how painful that was. Sometimes I can't either. Try climbing down. What do you see? I wanted to save you. You saw your father die. Something's wrong. You... You poisoned me. To open your mind, these visions are just the beginning. Without my help, the fear and pain will overwhelm you. Let me guide you through the horror. Purge the guilt from your spirit. Make you whole again. Just as I have done for all my shaman. Then we will tame this island and finish what your father started. Help me defeat the raiders of Iki Island. Avenge your father's death. No! Jill! <gasps> Oh, 
Tim! Can you hear me? Father? Poor boy. You failed your father, and now your soul is lost. I tried to teach the child all I know, but he acts more like a poet than a samurai. Kill it! You're in danger! Keep going! I'm coming, father! Kazumasa doubted you, and you proved him right. What kind of samurai watches his father die? After my father was killed, he sailed home with his body. I wished I had drowned. Soft! Clumsy! If he dies in battle, the future of our clan is in danger. Your father never wanted you on Iki. Everything you do tarnishes the Sakai name. That's a lie! Jim! Hurry! I'm coming, father! It was a trap! Thieves and murderers tricked us! Destroy your clan! Father! Ranji! We're almost there! You let your father die. No! May your death benefit all beings. Father... You all right? The ego... She's close. We better go. I know someplace safe. You weren't looking so good. I let you rest. Who are you? Answer me. You're used to talking that way to people on Tsushima, but not here, Samurai. I don't even know if you're real. Draw your blade. Find out how real I am. If you're from Iki, you know who won the Battle of Cloud Forest. Rained two weeks straight before that battle. Flash Flood killed Samurai and Islanders alike. We all lost. My turn to ask questions. What's a Samurai doing on Iki Island? The Eagle sent a scouting party to Tsushima. When I saw what they did to our people, I knew I had to stop them. So you saw the effects of her poison? More than that, she made me drink it. And you can still hold a conversation? First time I've seen that. How long does it take to wear off? As far as I know, it doesn't. I won't let that stop me. How long have the Mongols been here? Few weeks. Wiped out most of the raiders. My crew are the last holdouts. I can help you fight back and drive the eagle from Iki. A samurai helping raiders. Anything to stop the eagle. What's your name? Jin. From Yarikawa. Let me think about your offer. Jin from a Yarikawa. You're not slipping away that easily. I need to find more survivors. And you need to get your head on straight. Catch up to me at a farmhouse on the western coast. And we'll talk more. If the eagle's poison doesn't break you first. It won't. What happened here? Friends of mine lived on this farm. I hoped they'd join our fight. But those Mongol bastards got to them first. 
The least they deserve is a proper burial. Won't be long. I'll help you. You don't have to do that. I know. I want to. <laughs> Grab the spade. May they find peace in the next life. I didn't take you for a religious man. I'm full of surprises. You said you would think about bringing me to your crew. Have you made up your mind? That depends. Is the eagle's poison still affecting you? Yes. But it hasn't slowed me down. Take me to meet your raider friends. And I'll prove I can help you fight back. All right, samurai. You've got a ride ahead of us. Try and keep up. Where are you taking me? An old raider stronghold. We used it to hide from the samurai. Now it's keeping us safe from the Mongols. You're not worried about taking a samurai to your secret hideaway? Of course I am. But we need every fighting arm we can get. Just watch yourself once we get there. Ever since the Sakai invasion, samurai are slightly less popular than a pit of venomous snakes. The Sakai invasion? The butcher of Iki and his gang thought they could bring a little law and order to our island. <laughs> we showed them, but not before losing a lot of good people. From what I heard, neither side was innocent. There's some truth to that. I've never seen a pretty war. There's a hidden entrance to the stronghold up ahead. Mongols, they found the entrance. Let's see how good you are with that blade, Samurai. Stand and fight me! Sick to fight. We're not getting in this way. That's Fune's doing. Any outsiders find our home, we block the entrance and kill the witnesses. No exceptions. I hope she's more welcoming to invited guests. We'll find out soon enough. Is there another way in? Only by sea. There was a path years ago, before my time. Don't know if it's still there. It's worth a shot. Samurai has this man murdered. Remember your father's attendant? His throat was opened while he slept. His blood sprayed your tent. Silence! Jin, you alright? Yes. Sometimes I hear the eagle's voice. Like she can read your mind or something? No. I hear my own thoughts. Things I didn't know I was thinking. But in her voice. I hope it wears off. I see why the samurai never found this hideaway of yours. It's the only stronghold on Iki that survived the Sakai invasion. Let's hope that holds for the Mongols. No way to cross. There's always a way. Samurai have to say shit like that. Do pirates have to mouth off? Just the clever ones. trick I could use one of those it was a gift from a brilliant friend he passed I'm sorry to hear that bastards they're after one of our ships friends of yours would you call them friends yes I knew that that makes four craft we've lost to the Eagles warship how did you join up with Fune? We enjoyed the hospitality of the Sakai Inn together. You mean Fort Sakai? Terrible food. 
But we left with our heads intact. Most of the guests weren't so lucky. Almost there. He is luring you into a den of murderers. They will kill you just as they killed your father. <sighs> when we step through that gate, there's no turning back. Everything you do is on my head. Don't make me regret this, Samurai. You don't have to worry about me, Tenzo. I promise. Good. Keep that attitude and you'll be fine. Just stay close, keep your sword sheathed, and let me do the talking. Tenzo? You're back. You brought a samurai here? Wait until Hune hears about this. I'll tell her myself. Get back to your posts. I'm watching you, samurai. Let's get you to Hune. Impress her, and the wolves will back off. And if I don't impress her? I've seen her tie men up and leave them to drown at high tide. Even hung one traitor from the mast of her ship for the gods to eat. But I don't know what she'll do to a samurai. And those people. More victims of the eagle's poison. Not as lucky as you. Tenzo! You're running out of clean rags! Check the drawers. I have a shirt you can strip down. Let's go, Jin. Fune is waiting. Was that your house? They needed more than me. There's Fune, watching us from her favorite perch. Tenzo! Get your ass up here! Coming, Fune! Remember, make nice. And stole the samurai hat. Welcome back, Tenzo. I can explain. I hope so, because right now I'm really curious why you brought a samurai into my home. You sent me to find people who can fight. Fight for us, not against us. If I wanted to come for you, you would know it. Jin. It's all right, Tenzo. I want to hear this samurai dig his own grave. I'm here because the Mongols invaded my home, too. And if the Eagle isn't stopped on your shores, she's going to bring her army and her poison to Tsushima. We can defeat the Eagle and save both our homes, but only if we work together. He's your catch, Tenzo. What's your take? Maybe he helps us. Or he's skewered on a Mongol spear. And you get to brag about one more samurai dying on Iki Island. Either way, we've got nothing to lose. You're in, Samurai. I hope you don't get seasick. When the next storm hits, we're taking every boat in this cove and attacking that Mongol warship. Sounds like a good way to lose half your men. Get me aboard that warship, and I can sink it. <laughs> Tenzo, get this fool out of my face. Jin may have a point. We can't get close enough to board the warship, but a Mongol boat from Iki resupplies them every few days. We can take their supply ship and make the delivery ourselves. Tenzo, if you think this can work, you're in charge. I need a dozen men. Jin can be one of them. They're yours. The supply ship docks on the northeast side of the island. Look for a small inlet, steep cliffs. I'll meet you there. Fune, it has been a pleasure. Just watch your step, Samurai. More Mongol lies! The Eagle speaks the truth! <laughs> Going to keep me waiting, Jin? Next time, don't be so quick to kill your enemy. He may have known something useful. He spilled plenty. You called him a liar. What did he tell you? Nothing the cat wait. The ship should dock soon. Once it does, tell your men we'll take it quietly. 
If we cause too much damage, the Eagle's warship will see through our disguise before we get close enough to attack. Don't worry, Jin from Yarikawa. We'll take that supply ship without a scratch. I'll get some rest. The ship will be here soon. It's time. They've brought rowboats ashore. We'll borrow them to reach the supply ship. The fog will work in our favor. If they see us coming, we risk scaring them off. Let's get moving. Is the eagle's poison still in you? I won't lose focus, if that's what you're asking. It's not. You said it made you see things. Things I'd like to forget. Like getting blood stains on your favorite silk akama? A little worse than that. All right, I'll buy it. What's the worst thing that happened to Jin from Yarikawa? Losing my father. We were in battle together. I'm sorry. Don't be. You didn't know. Fall back! No, I can go around. Take out those weapons. You'll be blasted to pieces! Do it, Zin. Show us what a samurai can do. Watch the fire! Keep your hands out! The raiders know who you are. They are leading you into a trap. You're not real. When you die, will the raiders pray for you? The same one they spoke before murdering your father. What was that prayer again? You know the words. They haunt you. May your death benefit all beings. Be quiet! Sure took your time silencing those cannons. I thought you needed a chance to catch your breath. How thoughtful. What's going on with you? One moment we stand shoulder to shoulder, the next you're ready to cross blades. Not now, Samurai. We have a job to do. Then let's finish it and talk after. Set a course for the Eagle's warship. Let's hope they don't notice it's manned by a crew of raiders. We need more than hope. Tell your men to hide when we get within sight of the warship. An empty ship? That won't look suspicious. It will buy us time to get close, past the range of their heavy cannons. We'll wait for them to board us. Then we'll attack. Set off their black powder stores. And rip open the beast's belly. You'd better be right about this, Jin. for Pune's refuge. Next, we take back Iki. And one day escape the endless wheel of suffering. <sighs> Good work, Tenzo. I think Fune is going to be pleased. No. She's going to skin both of us alive. What are you talking about? You tell me! Lord Sakai. One whisper of your real name, and every person in this refuge will line up to split you wide open. 
Say my name. Force me to defend myself. This is what the Eagle wants. Samurai and Raider spilling each other's blood. She knows we're a threat if we work together. Bullshit! Who told you I was a Sakai? Was it the Mongol you interrogated? The Eagle wanted you to know. This is what I get for trusting a damn samurai. I grew up here, you know. Learned to swim in the shallows. Helped build half these homes. Broke my arm falling off the rock wall. Trying to impress my wife. You were married? Years ago. She didn't make it through childbirth. Fune helped me bury them. This is my home. These people are my family. If they find out I brought the butcher of Iki's son here, they'll stake both of us down. Make us a feast for the crabs. I won't let that happen. This stays between us. Yes, we're in this together. The eagle's hurting thanks to what we did today. We can save Iki Island if we stand together, but our fight is just beginning. You, Samurai, and your speeches. I'll tell Fune your plan worked. When you're ready, I'm sure she'll want to thank you in person. <laughs> Somehow I doubt that. Be careful, Tenzo. And watch what you say. You too. Jin from Ryarikawa. Well done, Jin. I can't believe I'm about to say this, but... Good work with the warship. Is that a thank you? Don't push it. My ships can finally leave the cove. If you're itching to hire a boat back to Tsushima, I won't blame you. We're days away from everyone on Iki falling victim to the Eagle's medicine. We're joining her army. And if Iki falls, my home is next. All right, Jean from Yarikawa. Stick around. And you can help us clip the eagle's wings. She rode from Fort Sakai hours ago. My scouts saw her leave with her main force. She must be planning something. Where is she now? No idea. She's covering her tracks well. But she left her stronghold exposed. Now that her main force has left, this is our chance to take back Fort Sakai while it's lightly defended. Even with fewer guards, it won't be easy to breach. The place is a prison camp. Captives are being tortured and forced to drink that witch's poison until they swear loyalty to the Eagle. I know. I escaped once before. Some of my best men are trapped inside. Free them, and they can help you liberate the fort. Then, I'll finally have enough forces to take the fight to the Eagle. Tell your men to tighten the defenses around the refuge. If this works, the Eagle is going to be angry. I hope she is. Fune's men. I can free them if I cut down the Mongols. Show me your skill! El Dei Ashiglach! Samurai! We were, before the Eagle captured us. What are you, some kind of samurai? I'm a friend. Your boss sent me to free her crew, and take back Fort Sakai. The Eagle may be gone, but she left her commander in charge. Kunbish is torturing prisoners, breaking us down before we're forced to drink the Eagle's poison. Then he won't leave this fort alive. Go, report back to Fune. I can fight. I will fight. Find a weapon and join me. May your death benefit all beings. You couldn't save your father. What makes you think you can save his food? No, don't listen. Let's drive the Mongols from this place. Break open and take the fight to them. Forward!
Remember the night your father tied starving bandits to trees as punishment? Not so different from this. The Eagle knew you would return, Samurai. You have received her sacred drink. A gift offered to warriors and princes worthy of becoming one of her shamans. Is that what she wants? To make me a shaman? Your transformation has already begun. You can accept her gift, become her shaman, and learn to soar in the eternal blue sky. Or I will break you in the name of the eagle. Her gift is a curse, and I will never bow to her rule. like the peasants. Driving you to madness and death. If only you had accepted the ego's gift. Unbish killed some of my best friends. Glad to see the coward get what he deserved. Even if it took a samurai to run him through. He fell because we worked together. But the eagle... She knew I would come here. That's why she left Fort Sakai undefended. So I would take her bait, and Kumbish would deliver her message. Now the bastard's dead, and she's lost the fort. Thanks to you. We can finally fight back. Gather anyone who can fight and report to Fune. Everyone else can shelter here. With a few repairs, Fort Sakai will stand against the Mongols. Good thinking. But before you run off, take these saddlebags. Figured a samurai could put them to good use. I will. Thank you. Travel safely, and I'll see you back at Fune's refuge. My men returned safely. And Fort Sakai is in our hands. We finally have a fighting chance against the Eagle. Any news on her whereabouts? Not yet, but I did learn something. While you were busy, my scouts recovered orders the Eagle sent to her shamans. It sounds like she wants to capture a samurai. Did she name them? No, but I think we can guess who she's hunting. What I want to know is, why does she want to take you in alive? The Eagle captured me when I first arrived. I escaped, but maybe she wants to finish what she started. What aren't you telling me, Samurai? Fune, Jin, we were searching for the Eagle. Lost her, but then we stumbled on one of her patrols. Tracked them all the way back here. The cliffs outside are crawling with Mongols. We had to sneak back in to avoid being seen. 
The eagle knows we're close. She's going to find us. Hmm. She's retaliating. This is payback for her warship. And the death of her lapdog, Kumbish. We can evacuate to the ship. Abandon your home now, and you'll lose it forever. You'd rather die here? We could draw them away from the refuge. Fight them on land. They outnumber us. So do the samurai. You know the terrain better. What about an ambush? Somewhere we have the advantage. Kita for the village. We have a plan? Round everyone up, Tenzo. We need to go now. I sent scouts ahead of us. They'll lure the Eagle's forces to Kidafre village. I've got people preparing an ambush. What about the people who live there? It was abandoned after the Butcher of Iki destroyed it. Your father put the entire village to the sword, and you did nothing to stop him. The lookout tower. We got a good view up there. Our scouts will lure the Mongols here. We can't be sure where exactly they'll come through. Get people in the most likely places. Few of us on horses can hold back. And respond where we're needed. Like stopping a wildfire. We need to cover a lot of ground. Where should we position the men? Place them among your father's innocent victims. Uh, the tree line. Station people there to keep watch. If they see something, they can signal us with those fireworks we took from the ship. Uh, set them off the moment your people see the invaders. Then we ride in. Mm. Hide people in those houses and granaries. Where your father's victims hid. Terrified and weeping. And if the Mongols don't get close? Have riders ready to hit their flank. Force them in range. What would you do there? The moment the villagers saw your father's men approach, they knew they were doomed. That was where they fell back. What? Who fell back? Uh, where we could fall back. If we're overwhelmed. We'll reinforce it with whatever we can throw together. Get everyone in position. We'll hang back for now. They don't know the horror your father inflicted here. The horror you failed to prevent. Ride to your posts. Signal when you spot the invaders. You said that was where they fell back. You were here. When your father massacred the village. It wasn't a massacre. What do you call armed men slaughtering an unarmed village? A village hiding armed fighters. And their families. The people who lived here ambushed our patrols. Set traps that maimed and killed our warriors. Slit their throats where they slept. What did you expect? You came here to kill us! A friend of mine grew up in this village. After the samurai left, I found his body. But it took me a week to find his head in all the mud. I'm sorry, Tenzo. <laughs> You're sorry. Do you have any idea what it's like to find your friend like that? Do you know how many lives your father destroyed? Too many. If I could change that, I would. But you didn't. Others had to end his cruelty. And I watched him die. I could have saved him. But I didn't. Why not? They're here. Get to the horses. They're coming. Get ready. They're attacking! Tenzo! Jin! With me! Strike hard and fast! If the Mongols overrun us, we'll fall back here! The group will stay to bolster these defenses! Fighting on the side of your father's killers, what would he say? There they are! Get ahead! Run them down, boy!
That's all of them. Huh? Easy pickings, right, Jin? A good start. This is just like the old days. She's enjoying Fireworks. this. More Remembering the how they soft. Let's go! Smooth. Let's ready a welcome for the Mongols. There's a few drums of black powder on those carts. You've been busy. Here they come! Aim for the barrels! That's the last of them. We held them off. For now. You'll never forget the sight. So much blood. The ground was soaked in it. Devastation all around you. Look what Kazuma Sasakai did. The butcher of Iki. Quiet. More fireworks to the west. We can't keep this up forever. Let's go. Feeling all right? Yes. Keep moving. Bune, you think the fallback defenses are ready? Our people need more time. We'll hold back the invaders as long as we can. Hold up. Fireworks stop. Come quiet. We had lookouts close to here. I don't see them. Might be an ambush. Let's take a closer look. They've captured the lookouts. Hang back. I can sneak in. Surprise the Mongols. Nice work, Jin. That's all of them. Untie the men. You'll be free soon. I thought I was dead. Thank you. All fireworks! On all sides! The Eagle Tribe's making its move. There are too many of them, and we're spread thin. We're out of time. Everyone, get to the horses. Retreat to the tower. We'll face them there. Lead the way, Samurai. Fall back. Fall back! Time for nest. Defenses are ready. Hold the invaders here. May your death benefit all beings. Jin? May your death benefit all beings. I've heard that before. From my father's killer. You're hearing things. It's the eagle's poison. Say the prayer for yourself. 
before I end your life. Do it. On this blood-soaked ground, where your father massacred hundreds. He was trying to save lives. You knew who I was, what you did to my father. You lied to my face. You lied to yourself. Your father was my enemy, not you. <laughs> How did someone so worthless defeat Kazuma Sasakai? I don't know. I... Luck! He slaughtered dozens of us before we brought him down. Broke his leg, I think. All I did was finish the job. Get on with it, Samurai! Not yet. You killed my father by luring us into an ambush at Senjo Gorge. That's how we're going to kill the Eagle. We need more than the two of us. Talk to Fune, and meet me near the canyons. We can't hide who you are anymore. But if I tell Fune... Do it. Tell her I'm Jin Sakai. She knows I fight for Iki. My actions prove it. Tell her I am not my father. If I was, you would be dead. The ghost will help us. I hear he killed a thousand Mongols with that old Shimura bastard slung over his shoulder. <clears throat> yes? Those stories, they're not entirely true. Of course they are. You must have heard some good ones about the ghost. He snapped the Mongol Khan like a piece of driftwood. Sounds like him, all right. If you want to help his fight, the ghost of Iki is asking for donations. We leave our offerings at his camp, northeast of where Kidafure village used to stand. If you're taking food, he likes his sake filtered and his millet washed. I'm sure he does. Must be the ghost camp. Still warm. Drank every drop. He was here, maybe watching something. I should wait, see if he comes back. Movement near the camp. Bandits. You must be the ghost. Are you stealing sake? Hmm. More thief than samurai. Don't hit those... ...barrels. Where are you running off to? Better catch up. Time to meet the cop. Kazuma's never time so easily. Are you dreaming? Or awake? You can no longer tell. Enough. I'm looking for the ghost. You and half the island. But we found him first. This little rat shit owes us a fortune. He owes me more. One day, boy. Then we start snipping off toes. So you're the hero everyone's talking about. Oh, oh, oh no. I I'm not the ghost. But I do work for him. There we were, fighting to save Iki Island, when those dead fox bandits attacked us, took the ghost prisoner. Where do they take him? Their camp, just west of here. I've got one day to pay them back. No, stay out of trouble. I will find your master. 
I have some questions for the ghost of Iki. <laughs> Won't let you kill any more of us. to be the ghost. A respectful tribute. Respectful? I should have known you were behind this. I'm sorry, Lord Sakai. With the Mongols everywhere, I, I couldn't take it anymore. Then I heard this icky smuggler was prepping a one-way trip to the mainland. I had to get out! And you didn't say goodbye. You're always so busy! If you were so eager to escape, how did you end up like this? I got caught sneaking aboard the smuggler's ship. When word got out that I was stranded on Iki, some very bad locals hunted me down. Tried to rob me! Did you rob them first? Skimmed prophets and Sarasaka never hurt anybody! So you're the most hated man on Iki. Half the island wants you dead, the other half you owe money. Am I close? Lucky guess. That doesn't explain the ghost act. The people here hate me! But as the ghost, I could inspire the locals, rob the lowlifes, and... and... And buy your way to the mainland. Everybody wins! I should leave. Let you deal with this mess. Ah, but the ghost wouldn't do that, right? <sighs> Hold still. Uh, mm, arms are still asleep. Wake them up. I'll escort you to the campsite, but that's it. All right, Ghost of Iki. You're on your own. Wait, wait, wait! You can't leave me here! Everyone on this island is out to get me! What about your recruit? You met Hugo. Is he all right? He nearly lost his head trying to pay your ransom. <sighs> He's just a fisherman. The kid needs me. Help me find Hugo, and I'll be out of your hair, I promise. Oh. You better be close. We agreed on a meeting place nearby, in case we were split up. Lead the way. I thought you only had eyes for Tsushima. What brings you to you? I came here with my father once, years ago. Never thought I'd return. When I heard something terrible was happening here, I couldn't ignore it. Wish I'd known about those rumors. All I heard was Iki is safe, not a Mongol in sight. This friend of yours, how did you convince him to join your ghost performance? The eagle tribe sank the boat I used to get here. I almost drowned, but Fugu pulled me from the sea. I tried to ditch him, but he wouldn't listen. <laughs> he couldn't resist your charms. <laughs> you can, my lord. Fugu! It's me! I knew you'd escape, master! The ghost lives to fight again! Hey, enough with the ghost talk, Hugu. You can call me Kenji. My friend here is the ghost. Oh, I see. Well, someone called the Viper has a message for the ghost. Th that's for me. You're in trouble with the Viper of Hakata Bay? He's the smuggler I told you about. The one with the ship ready to sail for the mainland? I tried sneaking on board, but he caught me. Now I owe him a small fortune if I want to keep my head and get off this island. Then we better meet him and sort this out. You're going to help me? The ghost of Iki is going to help himself. I want to meet the smuggler who spent the last 20 years evading samurai capture. What happened to your horse? Nico? I had to trade him to the Viper as collateral. I hope he's alright. Lord Shimura's been hunting the Viper for years. 
You're lucky he didn't take one of your hands when you tried to sneak aboard his ship. He was about to chop off other things, but I convinced him to save me a seat to the mainland. All it took was handing over Miko and promising to pay ten times the asking price. You should know, the Viper doesn't like people like us. People like us? You know, tough guys. <laughs> What's so funny? <sighs> Nothing. Well, whatever you do, don't push him. This doesn't have to get ugly. Wait here, Fugu. Yes, go. I mean... Master Kenji. It's me, Kenji. The ghost of Vicky. We're here to see the Viper. Be calm, Kenji. And don't talk too much. Who? Me? Where is my money? You must be the Viper of Hakata Bay. Who is the Masu, Kenji? He's a friend. Jin Sakai. Sakai? Had a run-in with your father once. Never got the feeling back in my little finger. <laughs> Cannot say I mourned him. My father made enemies. But they're not mine. Good. Old grudges are bad for business. How did this runt recruit a samurai? Kenji said he tried to sneak aboard your ship. He regrets the insult. That's me, stupid, disrespectful Kenji. Now he owes you a small fortune. A big fortune. If you came to negotiate, you are wasting my time. If you're holding out for money, it's going to take Kenji a year to pay you back. <laughs> that is his problem. And yours. You need payment today, to fund your journey. And whether the Mongol invasion, lower Kenji's payment. And we can settle up now, or wait. And hope he survives long enough to pay you back in full. Hey! <sighs> you have got a smart friend, Kenji. I think we can work something out, Lord Sakai. Those Ego Tribe bastards stole my navigation charts. Maps of every smuggling route between China and Hakata Bay. You need them to reach the mainland. That is right. And if the Mongols break my code, they will learn every weakness in the Shogun's fleet. That sounds very bad. We can recover these charts. If you grant Kenji passage to the mainland. You have yourself a deal. Keep an eye on Kenji. Rubble sticks to him like shit on rice. That could have gone worse. The Viper trusts us. Now we have to deliver. Let's go, honey. I think I pulled something when those bandits tied me up. Maybe I should rest up while Kugel helps you rob the Mongols. He's just a fisherman, Kenji. He saved your life. I know. If you want to act like a ghost, stop using people and start thinking how you can help them. You're going to die here. Just like your father. The Sakai name will vanish from the earth. Your life means nothing. Stop it! Back there with the Viper. I didn't know you were such a smooth talker. I spent most of my life helping Lord Shimura settle disputes among samurai families. Sounds boring. <laughs> Sometimes, but wield it carefully. The right word strikes deeper than the sharpest blade.
More guards than I expected. Maybe I should keep watch. Anything goes wrong, I'll give a signal. Bird call. No! Screaming monkey! Shh! Send your best warrior! Sugal Selme! The Viper's navigation charts. Time to go. Any luck? I've got it. Let's go. Better this than fighting the Mongols. Just in time. Uh, good work. Everything is here. We'll just need a few minutes to check my maps. Then we set sail. What about the people we sent ahead of us? Hmm? Settled on board, but we are at capacity. Have to dump all expendable cargo. There's only room for one more passenger. Ready to set sail, Kenji? When do we leave? Soon. We wait for no one. Reza doing business with you. Lord Sakai. And you. Sure you don't want in? I could hide you in one of my sake barrels. It's a tight squeeze, but with a little cooking oil, those narrow hips... Uh... <laughs> I'll pass. I'm not finished here yet. Well... I guess this is goodbye. Keep some of your best sake chilled for me. We'll celebrate when this is all over. I'd like that. Forget something, Master? Yeah, my common sense. <sighs> Take my seat on the ship. You earned it. But, Master... Get moving, before I change my mind. I didn't think you had it in you. I'll scrape by. Fugu, I didn't like his chances. It's better this way. Besides, you didn't think you'd get rid of me that easily, did you? <laughs> I'm not that lucky. This calls for a drink. To the ghost of Iki. To forgetting all about him. Rosa, not much time. Who did this? Mongols? No. A rival band. Traitors! Uh, Yamaneko and his crew made a deal with the Mongols. Mongols armed them with Wacha. Who are these raiders? Where can I find them? Uh, ask Sugi. She, she can help. The village to the south, Red Casa had won her. They're coming. Hear the watchers. Run! Yamaneko's crew. Come to kill the survivors. Signs of an attack. Looks recent. Locked. Hey. 
Still warm. Someone is living here. You're looking for me? Why? I mean you no harm, Sugi. My name is Jin. I was sent to warn you. The vessel that fired on your village belongs to someone named Yamaneko. I need your help to stop them. They know I'm here. That means... Should we leave? Draw them away? No! No! We don't know anything! It's too late. Pack our things. Be ready to go when I return. Come with me, Jin. Come back to me. I'll avoid unnecessary risk. That's the first time for everything, I suppose. Sugi! Yamaneko sends his regards. Sebe, you always were his lapdog. <laughs> How do you like our new allies? Soon we'll be the most powerful crew on this island. Kill them all! <laughs> Yamaneko's crew are careful, well armed, only dock at a specific time and location. I take it you've met. I was his first mate, kept him from indulging his worst tendencies, for a time. When I met Sampe, I didn't want to be that person anymore. But you don't just leave Yamaneko. Tell me where his ship docks. I'll handle them. We work together, or not at all. Hmm. <laughs> just remember that goes both ways. You're good with a blade. I have an idea we might be able to pull off, but I need to scout around first. Track down an old contact. There's an abandoned fishing village to the west. I'll meet you there. Good luck. Hmm. You too. This is the place Sugi mentioned. Where is she? More of Yamaneko's crew. I'll deal with them. This will make for a grand story. I'll kill you! Hold still. Thank you, my lord. That was quite a sight. You're not a samurai or ronin. What exactly are you? Someone like you. Who knows what it's like to be hunted. I scouted the cove. Yamaneko's crew are trading captives for Mongol watchers. Treasonous slavers. We can't let them have more Mongol weapons. Yeah. We'll need to split up. Distract the forces on the beach. I'll take a boat out. I've been slipping aboard ships undetected since I was a child. If Yamaneko is as dangerous as you say... He's my responsibility. Yamaneko is... my brother. Killing your own family. It's harder than you could ever imagine. 
Yes. All right. I'll head up the coast to where the Mongols and raiders are camped. Find some way to deal with them all. I can take over their watchers. And even the odds for you. Good. If we make it look like the raiders have betrayed the Mongols, they should turn on each other. I'll send you a signal of where to aim. Hmm. A little flower into their campfire will make it flare. Good luck, Sugi. Hmm. You too. There's a lookout post nearby. I can't leave until... I'll take care of them first. Meet me on the northern coast afterward. Once night falls, Sugi can row out to the ship. Better look around. This alliance ends here. Use that campfire to signal Sugi. Direct her Huacha attack. Yamaniko's crew and the Mongols working together. Time to signal Sugi. That should set the Mongols against Yamaniko's crew. Set the Mongols against Yamaneko's crew.
Yamaneko's crew will be an example to others. Don't side with the Mongols. Now to meet Sugi up the coast to the north. fortune in the afterlife. I should return to Sugi's husband, tell him what happened. Safer for everyone if I just disappear. I suspect no one understands that more than you. May we both live lives free from being hunted. <laughs> she survived. Good luck, Sugi. To both of us. I have no quarrel. Here you are, this whole journey, and I never asked your name. I am Imotaro, and you are Jin Sakai, who freed us from the eagle. Like building this house, I figured it out on my own. If it's not too bold for me to say, you should be as proud as I am. You built this house too. There, supporting the roof, that beam came from you. You can't see the hides, but they are there, beneath the thatch. And that corner there? That stays standing because of the metal you found. Believe me, I tried without. Set me back a week. You once told me you never built anything. Now you can say you have. And with this house, I can build a new family. Like the one I never had. Thank you. When I saw home burn, it was here on Iki. I did nothing then. This house won't make up for it, but it's a start. Hmm. Father's forces made their initial camp here on the island. My lord, your father is ready to address the men. Must gather your honor. Come. Your father wants you to join the men. They consider themselves the masters of Iki. Lords of the sea. But I don't smell lords. Do you know what I smell? Rats. <laughs> Greedy, vicious, disease-ridden rats. And we have found their nest. Come here. Apologies, Father. Every warrior under your command owes you five heads. As for what you owe me, fifty heads each. Anything less and you can swim home. Ready the men. We march for Mount Takenotsuji. Father. Let me have a look in the light. You're wearing that armor to battle. Hmm. Ah, the shoulder's loose. 
One good strike, that's all it takes. I'm sorry. A warrior learns from his mistakes, or is buried by them. But you won't die today. Remember your training. And never leave my side. You wish I hadn't come. You're here now. Pay attention. Sharpen your skills. Make your father proud. Did I make you proud, father? Sucker here. We're out of sake. Go get some from the men. Yes, father. Was just like Tico's head. The rats hardly knew what he'd done. Young Lord! You all seem in good spirits. Congratulations on today's victory. <laughs> the credit belongs to your father. The raiders call your father the Butcher. A fitting title for a legend. I strive to honor his example. Now, if you'll excuse me, my father requests more sake. Ah, take this. The Raiders don't need it anymore. They're dead. I brought the sake, Father. Good. Sit. Drink. The victory. Shouldn't we be celebrating with the men? The Lord must set boundaries between himself and his followers. Why? Familiarity breeds a lack of discipline. But they lay down their lives for you. And it is their duty to do so. Without question. As it is mine to obey my Jito. Your mother and I discuss such matters often. I relied greatly on her counsel. I wish I remembered her better. Choco had clever insight, deep compassion. Losing her was like losing the best part of me. This flute was hers. It's all I have of her. Let's hear it then. Please, play it. First time you asked to hear me play. The first time I felt like your son. Hmm. I know this battlefield. I tried to forget this place. Are you well, my lord? This doesn't feel like victory. Let me take you to your father. Is this how it's supposed to feel, Lord Adachi? Victories don't have to feel good. Oh, 
Father, what happened today? These villagers were helping hide the raiders. We butchered them. All the men in the village. The samurai ran hot, yes. But these fools attacked us. The man I killed. The man you killed was a criminal. You did well today. Better than I expected. Father. We fulfilled our orders from our Jito. Raise your head high. Today, you were a warrior. If you were here today, Father, would you condone my actions so freely? far from here. You cheated. I don't know how, but I'm certain you did. You owe me 20 mon. <laughs> Come, let's get back to camp. I was taught that debts owed to swindlers are not to be honored. Hmm. I was taught there's no shame admitting defeat by a superior opponent. Next time we compete, I would like to inspect your arrows. You bring them on, I'll bring the arrows. One last battle. One final fight. Then we begin preparations to leave this stinking island. Pardon me. I must speak with my father. Of course. Now Shimura's stewards can collect taxes and tend the manure fields. Father, a word. Yes. Walk with me. What is it? After this campaign, don't you want to stay? Bring Iki Island under your control. It's not for me. Only in the battlefield are my homes. And you, would you stay and rule this place? I thought I would. But after everything we've been through, I feel more alive in battle than any other time. <laughs> uh, you are Sakai. What do you mean? Let the Shimuras of this world keep records and manage councils. We are the lightning in the storm. The avalanche that topples a mountain. That is Clan Sakai. I understand, Father. I once judged you soft, unfit. Our time together has given me... Lord Sakai! Pardon my intrusion. Our scouts bring urgent news. Yes. One moment. I must go. Prepare your things. Follow my lead today. Everything will be fine. What were you going to say, Father? What did our time together give you? I've often guessed, but we'll never know. Hmm. I held a vigil here once, after my father died. That song, it's very beautiful, my lord. It's not finished yet. It's in memory of my father. Ah, uh, I apologize for disturbing you. I've packed your belongings. 
But some of your father's effects are missing. I'll look for them in just a moment. Of course, my lord. We'll finish this back at home, father. voice. I wish I could remember the sound. We are the lightning in the storm, the avalanche that topples a mountain. That is Clan Sakai, some of my father's last words to me. Lord Shimura told me how father broke this blade in a duel. Shocked by his strength, the Chikzen rebels surrendered immediately. Young Lord, it's time to leave. Lord Adachi, forgive me. I'm still collecting my father's belongings. Our scouts report raiders in the area. We must go. Please. Come with me. Yes, of course. I am sorry for your loss. Know that we all grieve with you. Thank you, Lord Adachi. The people of Omi village are preparing your father's funeral. My men and I will escort you and your father home. I should have saved him. His assassins would have killed you as well. Clan Sakai must prevail. Soon, you will wear your father's armor. I will never be worthy of it. My lords, our scouts report a large group of raiders approaching. I fear we must depart immediately. But the boats aren't fully packed yet. Our supplies... Leave them. Our people's lives take precedence. You heard Lord Sakai. Go! I ran from these memories most of my life. But now, after facing them, I think I understand you, father. After the battles, and under the legend of Kazuma Sosakai, you were just a man, chasing something. Or maybe running from yourself. I'm glad you slowed down and finally saw me. But I'm sorry it was too late. Thought I knew every face on Iki. Just a traveler. Stranded here by the Eagle tribe. You're welcome to join us. If you want to hear an old man complain about the past. We survived one invasion, and we can do it again. Or have you all forgotten how much we suffered at the hands of the samurai? That was nothing compared to the danger we face now. Nonsense. You are too young to know anyway. It's past time. I remind you all about the dark days of the samurai invasion. About the brutality of Kazumasa Sakai. Fifteen years ago, our home was invaded by an army of ruthless samurai. Their leader was Kazumasa Sakai. 
the Butcher of Iki. He rode to battle atop his demonic beast, shielded with armor as black as his master's heart. Luckily, the Butcher made a grave mistake when he came to Iki. He brought his whelp of a son. Our bravest warriors hunted the boy, not to kill, but to tempt his bloodthirsty father. Kazumasa gave chase, then rode into a trap. His armored horse met a grisly end, but the butcher and his runt son survived, then fled like cowards. Enough of these lies. That is not what happened. I live near Senjo Gorge. I saw it with my own eyes. So did I. Who are you? My name is Jin Sakai. Kazumasa Sakai was my father. He gave his life trying to help this island. Help! He murdered us! Your people repaid his help by murdering him. Is that why you're here? To avenge your father and take my head? You may be a liar, but you are not my enemy. Not yet. Stop this! You're acting like wild dogs! I came here to help, not for revenge. You mentioned my father's horse armor. After he died, we never recovered it. We know. Tell me where it is, and I can use it to ride against the Eagle tribe. I would die before I help a samurai. It's time you leave. something about my father's horse armor. But he'll never tell me. Unless I listen in on him. Without being seen. You're not welcome here. One more word about noble samurai, and I would have... Jiro! I lost six family members to the samurai invasion. My sister? Was still. What about the rest of your story? Ah, yes. I was just getting to the good part. Kazumasa fell for our trap and lost his armored horse. As our warriors closed in, the butcher and his boy fled into Senjo Gorge. The samurai limped through the canyon and ran headfirst into an ambush. There was no grand battle. Only a few raiders with dull blades. But that was all it took. One swing to end the life of Kazumasa Sakai. While the samurai slunk home, we recovered the armor from Kazumasa's mount. Over the years, our finest horses wore that armor. Every one of them killed its rider. As if possessed by the Butcher's vengeful spirit. So we sold his horse's armor to the Ida merchant family. The cursed armor left our shores aboard the merchant fleet as a storm descended on our island. The sky roared with the thunder of a thousand charging samurai. And the raging tempest shattered the Ida ships against our rocky coastline. The ruins of that doomed fleet still choke Zasho Bay. And somewhere in that watery graveyard lies the cursed armor once worn by the horse of Kazumasa Sakai. My father's horse armor. We'll see if it fits Kage. Curse or not, you wouldn't throw me, would you, boy? You look just like my father's horse. May this armor protect you in battle. 
The Eagle Tribe. They found the survivors' camp. Come, Kage. Armor of Kazuma Sasakai, restored to his son, and cursed no more. After everything I said, you saved us. There is a new threat on Iki. I saved you from these Mongols because I was raised to help those in need. Raised by Lord Shimura, and the man you call Butcher. I can't forgive your father. But as for his son... You're more merciful than he ever was. I never thought I would say this, but... Thank you, Lord Sakai. I wasn't sure you'd show up. Wasn't sure you would either. I take it Tenzo told you who I am. He did, Sakai. And if we weren't in the middle of a war, you would both be gathering flies. We won't survive the day with blades held to each other's necks. First, we stop the eagle. Then we'll settle this. Deal. I came to hear your plan, Sakai. How's a band of raiders supposed to take down an army of Mongols? The same way you defeated the samurai 15 years ago. You lured my father into Senjo Gorge, took his life, and forced the Sakai clan to retreat. We can do the same to the Eagle Tribe. How do we get her attention? She's hunting me. If I provoke her, she'll chase me into Senjo Gorge. Where we'll be waiting to spring the ambush and send them to hell. It could work. We'll have to find the Eagle first. She's always on the move, hunting new victims to poison. I have scouts combing the island. They'll find her. When they do, I'll get her attention. Not alone you won't. Any day now, the Eagle will find our refuge and burn it to ash. If this is our best chance to stop her, I'm going to make sure she takes our bait. Then it's settled. Tenzo, see to the scouts. I'll prepare the ambush. I'll camp here until we're ready. We have one shot to bring the Eagle to ground. Make it count. Jin! Scout spotted the Eagle's force. Is Funa in position? The canyons are crawling with raiders. We just have to lure the Mongols to them. Meet my scouts. They're keeping an eye on the Eagle's force. When we attack, I'll get her attention. You said she's hunting you. What does she want with a poisoned samurai? She wants to make me one of her shamans. What? One of her followers at Fort Sakai said she wants to recruit me. But she forced her poison on you. The sacred medicine is poisonous to most. But her shamans use it as a rite of passage. Are you still seeing visions? Yes. Getting worse. I warned you this would only end in madness and death. Hey! 
Enzo, over here! The Mongols are sweeping the island, looking for the samurai. Is the eagle with them? She called a halt and released some of her eagles to fly. We weren't spotted. Let's get a better look. Look for the eagle's helmet. It shouldn't be hard to spot. That's her. The eagle is here. Where? I don't see her. Right there. She sees us. Move in. There you are, Lord Sakai. I've scoured the island for you. Your gift is poison. Refuse me and you will die here. Just like your father. God damn it. Where is she? Tenza! The eagle got away! Look for her! She was never here. waiting for us. But if the eagle wasn't here, then where is she? Where am I, Jin? Be silent. What place on this island calls to you? Where were we destined to meet again? Can't be. Central Gorge! The eagle is there, where my father was killed. We have to get back to Thule. I underestimated the eagle. You sure you didn't want to become her shaman? Offer us up to your new master? I'm no traitor. Uh, when I was imprisoned, poisoned, I thought the eagle was someone else. I told her about my father, how you ambushed us at Senjo Gorge. So she knew your father died there. Then she learned you joined our fight. Heard we were planning something big. She's one step ahead. We can still win this, Tenzo. Axel Hutton, where are you? I know you're here. Face me. came out of nowhere. What happened? We'll explain later. Did you see the eagle? She led the attack. Killed half my men. We need to fall back to the refuge. We won't get a second chance at this. We have to bring down the eagle now. You're as stubborn as one of my crew. Then let's go. Listen up! We're hunting the eagle! Into the canyon! It's too late. The battle is lost. You failed like you failed your father. Do you remember how you let him die? Your mind is lost. How do you know this battle is even real? <sighs> Jin, still with us? I'm fine. Lord Sakai, you return to me. The eagle. 
Is she here this time? Remember the great Kazuma. Broken and lean, you shook like a new poor cat. I was a child. A samurai, not a farm boy. But when your father was desperate, you hid like a coward. Shin, you all right? Yes, keep fighting. I used to only hear her voice. Now I see her, feel her presence. Maybe being here makes the visions more intense. Are you not tired, Lord Saka? Come, I will give you peace. And I will give you cold steel. Jin, hold it together. Remember your terror. Your father's dying screams echoed off the canyon walls. Let me take away your pain. And I'll send you to hell! That's the last of them. The eagle has to be close. You know where I am. Don't judge. The eagle is waiting east of here. Where my father was killed. I'm not betting everything on your gut, Samurai. You go east. Tenzo and I cover the other path. No. I'll go with Jin. He needs me. Good luck to both of you. Meet me in the heart of your pain. Let me heal you. Damn it, give me silence. Jin, you need to turn back. Too late now. This is the place where you killed my father. The sacred medicine brought you here. Do you know why? To end your reign of terror. No, to be healed. For years you hid your pain. The sacred medicine allows you to see it. Against my will, your medicine is a weapon. Don't let the darkness take you, Ji. Let your spirit soar in the eternal blue sky. I don't soar over my people. I serve them. Even the people who killed your father? Yes, even them. What a waste. Handle the others, Tenzo. I'll deal with the ego. How can you fight an enemy who turns you? You cannot defeat me. Judgment of your ancestors, Lord Sakai. Father. Jin. Help me.
Jean. We should have died here together. Like warriors. I'm sorry I failed you, Father. Not me. Our clan. The Sakai name is tarnished. The people here accuse us of terrible things. Sometimes, what is necessary is also terrible. The actions I took were not easy. But they needed to be done. <laughs> you did what was needed on the battlefield. Not at home. I needed a father. <laughs> when we lost your mother, I was left with a son I didn't know how to help. So, I raised a samurai. It's time, Jin. Do. What is necessary? Rid our clan of shame and defeat. Avenge me. Kill him, you coward! be like you. The way you lived was not my choice, and your death was not my fault. Sacred medicine no longer affects you. How is that possible? Judgment of your ancestors. One. Yeah. <laughs> your chance. Are you alright? I'll live. What about you? Still hearing her? No. I'm sorry, Jin. So am I. Sounds like a celebration. I better check on Pune. Tell her the good news. Go on. I'll join you later. Don't wait too long. Jin.
petals soak with blood. My father's breath subsiding. Soar into the sky. Like the samurai wants a word with us. Fume, Tenzo, you both look well. Feeling better with the eagle gone. Nice work, by the way. <laughs> Same to you. The eagle tribe will lose their foothold here if we keep fighting. Hear that, Fume? He said we. Find me later, Sakai. I could use the help of a samurai who knows how to keep a secret. Looks like you're healing up. It only hurts when I laugh, so... I should be fine around you. <laughs> you only laugh at your own jokes anyway. <laughs> but I'll never swing a blade like I used to. No more robbing innocent merchants on the high seas. How will you make yourself useful? Too many people here still suffer from the eagle's poison. There's no cure, but I can ease their pain. Maybe even help some recover. Like you. The Eagle's medicine forced me to relive my father's death. Gave me another chance to avenge him. What did you do? I realized what I feared more than dying. Failing my father. For years I blamed myself for his death. And for choosing to live. So I forgave myself. And him. And that cured you? The darkness never leaves completely. But it recedes. Maybe that's how to heal the others. Guide them through the memories. Help them face their fears. I hope you're right. Years ago, I could never have imagined saying this, but I'm glad we met, Tenzo. Never thought I'd do this either, but... Thank you, Jin. Why send us on another raid now? We've barely caught our back on the last battle. We're at war. If you want to rest, try asking the Eagle Tribe for a few days off. But he ignored me, then ate it later when I wasn't looking. That is their nature. They wouldn't last Leave long. Leave us, Hachiro. Food in their faces. Trouble with your men? Nothing I can't handle. I suppose I should thank you for killing the Eagle. And for letting Tenzo walk free. The eagle deserved it. As for Tenzo... This island has seen enough bloodshed already. It's about to see some more. There's a Mongol ship off the coast. Loaded with enough supplies to get my men through this war. We're going to take it. And you want help from Iki's most hated samurai? That honor goes to your father. You're willing to hire your former enemy. Put your entire crew at risk. Over a few supplies? What's really on that ship, Fune? My daughter. So this is a rescue mission? Yes. Hidden in a raid. Your crew doesn't know. You haven't told them you're risking their lives to save your daughter. They'll mutiny if they find out. And if we turn against each other now... The Eagle Tribe will tear you apart. I can't abandon my daughter. Join my raid and help me save her. Quietly. All right. I'm in. Thank you. We leave at sunrise. Until then, you can join the festivities or rest on my ship. Enjoy yourself while you can. We sail at first light. That doesn't smell like any sake I've had. We don't drink fancy brews on Iki, Lord Sakai. You want fire in your belly, you'll have to settle for my special recipe. If you're trying to poison me, you'd better be strong. I've survived the eagle's drink, after all. <laughs> I'll share the bottle to put your mind at ease. What are we drinking to? To Iki Island. Oh! Fune said the Mongol ship's loaded with riches. <laughs> Fune says a lot of things. You think she's lying? I think she's hiding something from us. 
and the last time she acted this way, I lost two brothers in the deep. Rune's busy planning. Oh, shit. She's never missed a celebration. She did once. The night after. We've got company. Want to place a bet? A game of go. I used to play this with my uncle. There's no room for more players. But we're taking bets. Who do you think will win? White or black? I'll choose white. Good luck. Stop by later and see if you won. Gotta miss that. I gave you an order! We're not moving until you tell us everything! What's happening? This isn't just a supply run, is it? What's so important about this Mongol ship? The enemy is on the move! And you are delaying us! You owe us answers! No, Hachiro. I owe you nothing! Leave him to me, Chi. Who are you loyal to, Hune? Your men, or the Butcher's son? I have given every piece of myself to you and my men. Prepare the ship. Now. As you command. I have men waiting down the beach. This way. Don't let him distract you. I know. Not when we're so close to Toki. What does your daughter look like? If there are other prisoners, we'll need to find her in the crowd. She has my chin. And eyes. And... And? I don't know what she looks like now. I haven't seen her in years. Growing apart from family can be difficult. Do you have children? No. But my father... I barely knew him. He saved his true self for the battlefield. Maybe I have more in common with the Butcher of Ikki than I'd care to admit. I could say the same. Yes, report. Mongol dogs are loading their ship now. No clue we're coming. If they see us, they retreat for open water. Let them try. My archers are in position, ready to torch their sails. A quiet attack could take them by surprise. Protect any precious cargo from harm. Good thinking, Lord Sakai. Looks like you volunteered to lead the charge. Take the ship. Leave no Mongol alive. His daughter. This is my daughter, Toki. It's me, Oka. Her mind. It's been consumed by Kusuri. I gave it to her to ease a broken arm. It's powerful medicine. It can be very addicting. I didn't know she kept using it until she got a group of my men killed on a raid. By my own law, she should have been executed. But she was your daughter. So I sent her away. The crew was furious. Some left. Some still hate me. I followed my laws to the letter. Every day since. But it's done no good. She's gone. You were trying to do the right thing. I had a chance, once. I found her in the back of a tea house, lost in a dream. 
She'd soiled herself. By the stink, she'd been like that for days. I was so angry. I just... I just left her there. I should have brought her home. Now you can. Let's get her off this boat. Well, look at this. Fune brought us here to save her daughter. That bitch who got my brothers killed. She has paid for that mistake, Hachiro. Not enough. You made sure of that. But don't worry. I'll let you say goodbye before I open her pretty little throat. The girl is lost. Only a monster would spill her blood now. This isn't your fight, Sakai. Yes, it is. Those of you still loyal to me, stand back. Leave these rats to us. and cast them into the sea. Hachiro had a loud voice, but few allies. Your men respect you more than you know. I'll admit, I'm surprised. My daughter got men killed. Fathers, brothers, husbands. If it were anyone else, I would side with them. You're where you should be, with your daughter. Her mind is gone. But her body still suffers without Kusuri. I need to help her rest. Thank you. Jin. I hope you find peace, Fune. Lord Shimura isn't here. I'll wait for him on the dock. I wasn't sure you would come. I wanted to talk with you. If we work together, we can drive off the remaining Mongols. Start rebuilding our home. That is not your duty. The Shogun has disbanded Clan Sakai. As of today, you are no longer Samurai. I sacrificed everything for my people. And I would do it again. New samurai are coming to replace those we lost. They will occupy your land and estate. I have to say goodbye to my home. Ride with me. Will you remain in Jito of Tsushima? Yes. The Shogun asked me to train his warriors to fight the Mongols. Good. They won't give up until they've conquered all of Japan. I will spend what years I have left ensuring they fail. The task I hoped we would face together as father and son. You can still remarry, start a new family. Yes, I suppose I can. Looks like he could use a push. Here, let us help you. Well, no trouble yourselves, my lord. Nonsense. You can't do it alone. You are much too kind. The mud is sicker than it looks. That's a heavy load. Where are you headed? Jogaku. The ghost army is up there. He has an army. You didn't hear? They'll sail for the Mongol steppes with a storm at their back. 
burn their homes to the ground. An impressive goal. This is everything I can offer them. I hope it helps. Then we will see you on your way. Thank you, my lord. Jogaku is many miles from here. Keep away from the mud and the Mongols. I will. I have no idea what he's talking about. Not here. Only me. I don't have an army. Every day, more people flock to your cause. The Shogun is concerned. I am concerned. You have nothing to fear. When the new clans arrive, will you people bow to their samurai? Or betray them in the name of the ghost? I won't let them do that. They'll listen you to me. You openly defied me, Jin. My most trusted warrior. You taught our people to disobey their leaders. What makes you think your followers will obey you? As you wish. My family cemetery. The resting place of seven generations of Sakai. Including your mother. And my father. We must pay our respects. I will miss this. So will I. The Shogun has declared you a traitor. He ordered you to kill me. The ghost was an outlaw. He taught our people to defy their leaders. To defend themselves. With poison? A gift you gave to our enemy? I had to stop you from throwing away our people's lives. You have no honor. And you are a slave to it. You are my son. I must continue the line of Shimura without you. I must start a new family. And my head is the cost. Taking it is my punishment. Our final day together. It is beautiful. It's time. Write the last words of Clan Sakai. And Clan Shimura. 
that saw my pain. A fate neither of us want. Will death redeem us? will always be with you. Yes, uncle. I will train you to become the strongest warrior Clan Sakai has ever known. I will raise you as my own son. Let me go in peace. The wounds you dealt my spirit will never heal. Killing me will only make them worse. Let me go in peace. Me with a body 
Mysterious death. I will make sure you are remembered as a great warrior, a wise leader, and a father. Fallen at my family cemetery. Beautiful. Even in death. I lived under these banners most of my life. Lady Masako lost everything. And everyone. If she can keep moving forward, so can I. The twin mountains of Clan Sakai. I won't let my family fade from memory. I wish you were here, Uncle. Tomoe didn't need this anymore. I hope she found what she was seeking. Yuriko helped me pick these for my mother. I can't believe she kept them all these years. Jin Sakai is hereby an official student of Sensei Sadanobu Ishikawa. What have I gotten myself into? Yuna's knife. The blade's dull. Can't believe it's still in one piece. For most of my life, I dreamed of being your son. Norio promised he'd teach me to play the horagai. So we can signal each other across the island. You were faithful to the end, Sora. Smells almost sweet, but it's as deadly as any blade. You should be here, Rizzo. Trading stories, getting drunk. How long did it take Yuna to make this? I owe her everything. She's the one giving me gifts. Kenji's best. Or so he tells me. I'll have to share it soon. I used to think I only needed a horse, a bow, and my katana. Taka's trial run. Oh, he made my grappling hook. He didn't want to disappoint me. And he never did. Jin. I like your new home. It suits you. It will have to do, now that Clan Sakai is gone. And I've been branded a traitor. I heard about your uncle. I'm sorry. He's gone. I did what I had to. Matters is you're alive. You defeated Kotun Khan and left the Mongols without a leader. The mainland is safe. But our home isn't. 
The Khan's forces are stuck here, more desperate than ever to conquer our island. Then we'd better keep fighting. Just don't forget. Tsushima needs you. I'll never forget that. Good. We'll cover more ground if we split up. Hit the Mongols from all sides. Take back our home. Goodbye, Jin. And take care of yourself. I will. You too, you know.